One year ago, Franklin had a dream to become the richest man in the universe. He started with nothing and worked his way up until eventually he did it. But staying at the top is hard, so we pranked anybody who came close until we messed up. Franklin lost everything. Locked in jail with $1 to his name, we had to think smart. And once we were out, nothing was going to stop us. We made money, grew power, and captured the richest army, conquering the world and rule as king. But it's never enough. And one day, we had to give everything away. So I put his entire adventure into a movie. From $1 to richest man, he's done it all. So grab your popcorn and your soda, sit back, relax, and enjoy. Franklin has $0 in his bank account. There are five goals I want to go for. Buy the most expensive yacht, buy the rarest supercar, buy the biggest house in Los Santos, and upgrade Franklin's house with the half a billion dollar upgrade. It's going to be crazy. And of course, the final goal is become the richest player. Now, I know what you're thinking. How am I going to do that with $0 in Franklin's bank account? I could join the club or alternatively, join the mob. Now, if these things sound a little bit too scary for you, we could take things slower. We could become a shopkeeper. We could become a taxi driver. We could even get a degree if we wanted to. There's literally a million and one things I could do in Los Angeles to make money. If at any point today we die or Franklin gets arrested, then it's challenge over and he becomes the poorest person in the world for good. The first car has arrived. Don't lose this car, Franklin. We need this to catch a ride to Los Santos. Hey, man, excuse me. Can I just borrow this ride? Thank you very much, buddy. You're a legend. Thank you. <laughs> Go, Franklin, go! Oh, he wasn't happy about that, guys. No wanted level. That's great news. Now, let's go into Los Santos and start working. Simeon always needs something collecting for him. And maybe if we're lucky, he might just send me on my way to a Lamborghini. And then think about that. I could literally sell that and become ultra rich. He's just given me a job. Repossess the car for Simeon. You got it, Simeon. It's only one mile away. Quickly, Franklin, we haven't got long. We gotta get there as fast as we can. That guy's driving around the city. Right, I'm following him on my radar, and we're just about to cross the road. Who is this guy and what car is he driving? Once I do this job, I'll have money to actually buy food and then do other things. All right, buddy, it's game over. Give me that car. It's mine. It looks like some sort of sports car. It looks very nice. Oh, jeez. Oh, no, he's going to pull me out. Go, 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 go. $52,000? That's so much money. Whoa. All I got to do is return this car and Simon's going to pay me 52,000 big ones. So it looks like we've collected the Faria supercar sports car. Could do with some paint, though. I mean, what's wrong with yellow or red? Why have you got to go? with black. I am just looking forward to this $52,000 paycheck, dude. We're gonna make so much money. If I collect like a couple of cars like this, we'll be able to buy the rarest car in no time. Take it around here. Hey, Simeon. Look what I got for you now. Give me my 52,000 big one, Simeon. There he is, my guy. Look what I got for you. I got your car, man. <laughs> I wonder if Simeon has any other jobs I can do. If I do one more, I might just make over $100,000. Stop right there. If you want another job, you got to tell everybody to subscribe to your channel. Oh, Simeon, you got to be kidding me, man. All right, guys, just subscribe. Press the button. I need this work to become the richest player. I'll give it three seconds, and then I'll speak to Simeon again. All right, let's just walk around. Three, two, one. Simeon, please give me another job. I think they've subscribed now. Yeah, fine. There's a bike I need to collect. Go get it. Thanks, Simeon. That was wasn't so hard, was it? Anyway, thanks for subscribing. Let's go and get this bike. Oh, man, this guy fell off his bike. Oh, what a shame. <laughs> Don't you worry, buddy. I'll just take your bike from you. Just hijacked the taxi. 150 bucks? Are you kidding me? All right, guys, this is like the worst collection ever. There is no way I'm going to become the richest player just collecting vehicles for Simeon. 750 bucks. Who does he think he is? Just give me the money, Simeon. Thank you. 750 bucks. Appreciate it. Not. So I made $52,000. $53,000. That's not bad, Franklin. We can now feed ourselves, and we can even go to hospital and repair that car on your head. But we're not going to do that, because we don't have long. And we still want to become the richest player in the world. Clearly, collecting cars is not my forte. And I don't think we're going to become the richest player working nine to fives. We're going to do something a little bit sneakier. There is a secret organization, which I know the address of. And you can join them and become part of the mob. They're the kind of people who say, hey, Lou, take them out. I think we're going to fit just right in, Franklin. We're going to be A-OK. -okay. You got me. Protect Protecting you, buddy. Start working for the mob. Let's go. So now I've joined the mob. They're going to contact me at random points throughout the day and give me high risk but high reward jobs. I'm going to purchase my very first college course. I, 
I've just got a degree. We got all my days. Franklin, congratulations, buddy. I got a degree. Now, what can I do with this degree? Can I become a college professor? Is that possible? To purchase driving course. Yes, yeah, screw it. Let's get a driving course. Oh, my days. Drive around for two in-game hours and don't cry. Are you kidding me? That's so long. I have to drive around for two in-game hours pretending to be a taxi driver. All right, I've just been given a job. All right, my first passenger guy is here. What's up, my guy? Get back on the road. All right, fine. Screw you then. I don't want to pick him up. I want to drive. <laughs> ditched him. We're gonna get some terrible reviews, guys. Just saying. That person was not happy. <gasps> oh, my days. I've done it. I pass. I now have my taxi license. We can become an official taxi driver, Franklin. Amazing. Congratulations. I think we'd still make more money with Simeon, but there's a job there. Let's go check that one out, shall we? I can apply for this job. What kind of job is this, then? Okay, I've got a job, guys. Oh, I don't want to become a... T I'm no, no, no. I'm not becoming a taxi driver. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. This is not me. I'm quitting. I am not doing taxi rides around Los Santos, okay? We're gonna do more exciting things. I'm gonna give this ATM a go. The one's right outside the cinema. It's hidden away. I don't think anyone will see me. And let's see if we can actually rob this ATM. Alright, let's get onto the computer. Let's go onto good old external device. Plug that in. And we're cracking the code. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I feel so sneaky. Dude, we're gonna be robbing every single bit of money at this ATM. Easy peasy. Uh-oh, there goes the alarm. They put us, buddy. I got two stars and $16,000. That that's not bad. I've got to find somewhere to hide now because I got two stars and I don't want to go to jail. Remember, if we go to jail, Franklin, it's game over. I think this is a good hiding spot. There's no way they're going to come down here. I'm going to rob the other ATM. Maybe the other one has a bit more money. $19,000. Ah, my days. I may as well work for Simeon at this rate. I'm getting closer to that $100,000 mark, but we still need to find ways to make even more money. Lester, what do you want, buddy? Hey, kid, I heard you're looking to make some money. If you want to make some serious cash, swing by my place. Hmm. Lester wants me to go to his house. Well, he is right. I do want to make serious money. Let's go to his house and see what he has to say. If you want to make some serious dough, rob the banks. I'll set you up. And don't worry about the police. Robbing banks, you say? Well, Lester, I do want to make serious money. And right now, this seems like the only solution. Okay, guys, looks like we're robbing some banks in Los Santos. Excuse me, guys. I gotta take out the cameras. This is a robbery and nobody's escaping. Oh my days, dude. I think someone just ran out and now I've got a one to level. We better do this quickly. Franklin, we better do this quickly, buddy. Excuse me, man. I am not telling you again. Are you gonna open the vault for me? Are you gonna be a good boy? I know you're gonna be a good boy. Of course you are. Come on, open the vault for me, buddy. I'm not kidding. Open the vault. Right, he's putting in the numbers. Oh boy, I just shot him in the arm. Sorry, man. <laughs> Can you open the door, please? Thank you. I'm gonna be arrested by the time we get through this box, you know. This is really, really tricky. This is so tricky, dude. Don't overheat. Don't overheat. Make it through the bolts. Come on, there's just three left to go. Come on, Franklin. You got this, buddy. You can do this. Two bolts left. Final bolt, the last one. You got this, buddy. You can do this. I believe in you, man. Come on. Yes, I'm in. How much money are we gonna make from this safety deposit box? Guys, I don't know how much money we've made from this, but it better be a lot of money. Thanks, guys. I'm going. Oh, but is the police are outside. Lester, I thought you said you saw them. Well, that's the last time I take Lester's word for anything. There's helicopters in the sky. They're going to be tracking me from everywhere, Franklin. We're going to find somewhere secret to hide. Oh. Heist passed. We could have made $5 million from that heist. I made a mere $500,000. Well, at least we know the potential. I've made almost a million dollars, which is almost enough to buy the rarest car in the world. I'm gonna do one more heist. And conveniently, there's a bank right here. Maybe this will get me enough money to tick off one of the objectives on my list. Lester, you better deal with the ones level this time. I am not dealing with the police again. All right, take it slowly. Take it easy, Franklin. Don't overheat that drill. If it gets a bit too red, then it stops cutting. Et voila, open sesame. Number 167. Seven. What do you have for me that I currently don't have? Another half million dollars in cash. Not bad. Thanks, ma'am. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, yes. Lester did deal with the ones level. Thanks, Lester. Thank you for coming in clutch. All right, guys. This is my third bank. I'm not messing around. You're going to give me the money? <gasps> okay, guys. All right. Now I know why we're robbing banks. There's so much cash and so much gold here. Get it all, Franklin. Get every single bit of it. That's what I want to see, my guy. And then the gold. Can we do the same thing? Just swipe gold in the bag. How much are we getting per... $30,000 per ingot. This is insane. Final gold bar. I've made 1.2 million bucks from this heist. And there's still a few more banks to go. Thanks, ma'am. You're a legend. I'll uh, send a postcard, all right? <laughs> 
and no one did level. The police literally let me walk free. We've made more than $2 million, which means I'm able to buy the rarest car in the world. I want to see what this even is. The rarest car in the world is in this lay-by. Are you ready to see what this is, guys? <laughs> it looks so nice. It's a Lamborghini. Of course it is. How could it not be a Lamborghini? Check out that front. I love the light system. How it's got two different lights. This is the rarest car in the entire of GTA 5. Cost two million bucks. Quiet. It's fast. It's everything I want from a car. Apart from the steering, that is not good. <laughs> I've already crashed the car. Now I finally got the rarest car in the world. I can tick that objective off the list. But now there's only four objectives left to get. And I need to somehow make half a billion dollars if I want to even upgrade Franklin's house. You know what I'm thinking? I want to check out the biggest house in GTA 5. Let's go there now and see what it's all about. Is it really that big? This is the biggest house in GTA 5. And I need to somehow find a way to buy it. Oh no, it's occupied by guards. If I want to get this house, I need a tank. Well, at least I know where he lives. How much do tanks cost these days? And by the way, I'm not even buying the house. I'm gonna take it by force. Could you imagine how much money could potentially be in that house? Three million dollars. Ah, oh, we need to figure out another way to make even more money. Lester, what do you want? Have you got more work for me? I've already robbed every bank in Los Santos. Hey, kids, want something bigger? I got the job just for you. Why, yes, I do, Lester. Yes, I do. What job is this? Now, I've got a super fast car. We could probably evade the police in seconds. A jewelry store. Hold on a second, Lester. You're not saying I'm robbing the jewelry store now. All right, luckily for me, I got a Lamborghini. Okay, guys, this is a hold up. I need all of the money you've got. Uh oh, he's shooting me. Uh oh, that's not good. Okay, let's take out the security cameras. I haven't got long. I got one minute 45. Are you kidding me? And then there's like one left in the corner. Oh my days, dude. At this rate, we're not gonna rob anything. Quickly, Franklin, quickly get every single cabinet you can. One minute 37. Lester, you better give me enough time, buddy. Guys, the police are gonna be here any second now. It's not long, Franklin. Not long at all. Okay, quick, we're running. I'm getting out of here. Six, five, four. Get in the Lamborghini. Giddy, frankly, get in the car. Go, 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 go. Oh, my days, dude. I just made it. <laughs> No wonder level. That couldn't have gone any better. And I've made almost $7 million. I got to deliver the jewels to the buyer and then I'll be on my way. Is this where we're meant to go? I mean, I think it's the yellow circle, guys. Hey, guys, listen, I got what you need. I got the jewels. Now give me the money. Come on, guys. Oh, wait, what's up? <laughs> Serious business. I know that's the briefcase. Thank you very much. Shake the hand on my face. You guys are legends. You've made me so rich. We have almost $10 million dollars, ladies and gentlemen. That is so much money. That is almost enough to buy the most expensive yachts in GTA 5. There's even more work down here. There's another blip thing in my bob. Guys, I have a feeling the mob wanted me to go here. Hey, guys. Hey, what's the deal going? <laughs> oh, boy. What you got there? Wait for them to load the parcels onto the truck. Very well. You guys carry on loading. Okie dokie. How long are we waiting for then? I got a Lamborghini. It's a pretty fast car. He's putting all this thing down. He's writing it down. This is proper accounting right here. Are we done? Celebrating. I think it's done. All right, escort the truck to the destination. Where are we going now, folks? Where are we going? All right, Tony, whatever your name is, don't touch the radio system. You keep those grubby fingers off the dashboard. Where's this thing even going to? Is it going far? Hey, buddy, if you're gonna drive like a granny, then don't drive at all. Amazing. They've got it. My guy's left. And I've made $26,000 for all of that. That was so worthless, dude. All right, I wanna see what job Lester has in store for me today. So this is where Lester sent me to the airport. Hmm, what kind of heist is this? Lester, this this seems really top secret to me. Are we going into Devon's warehouse or something? Oh, hold on. What kind of plane is that? That is not your average plane. Bro, it's red. It's black. Where is this thing going to? Wait, hold on, guys. Am I robbing this plane? No way. Lester wants me to rob the plane. All right, Lester. You got a deal, buddy. I'll get the plane for you. <laughs> There's someone in here. Get him, Franklin. Get him. Oh, my days. There's four of them. And now they're down. Apart from that guy. Now he's down. Look at this cash. How much money do you reckon is in here, guys? It's all $20 bills. So, you know, divide it by five. But oh, no. $100 bills. Now we're talking. And there's $1 bills. How sad. <laughs> Let's carry on going through, guys. I can go through this next shutter. Which buttons connect to these ones? Da -da 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 -da. Is this good? Test the connection. Let's go. Oh, I only got one of them. Oh, that sucks. All right. What if we do that to there and then, like, maybe that to there, and then like, let's do this one to- No, 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 don't do that. <laughs> All we have to do is connect the wires up. Is anyone in here? Uh-oh, there is. Has he seen me? Oh, damn, he ducked. <laughs> 
That is literally the best timing duck ever. All right, where's the other guy? Buddy. Hey, man. I just want to talk. What's in these crates, huh? Do you know who you even... Do you know? Hey, buddy. It's me, Mr. Franklin. I'm going to be the richest player in the world. I'll give you a great funeral. Don't worry. Let's grab the rest of the cash, Franklin. Each wad is at least $1 million. That is insane. Come on, sweep it all in. The plane is literally flying with us in it, Franklin. We can't let this take off, okay? Once I grab these gold bars, we'll have made more than $50 million. I'm in the sky. I'm in the sky. It's taken off. Come on, push this. <laughs> no! Are you kidding me? Oh, jeez, I missed the crate of cash. I got sucked out of the plane. Well, I still made $54 million, but we could have made more. That's so, so sad, Franklin. With only three objectives left, we're slowly closing in on the richest player in GTA 5 position. I mean, they've already made $64 million. Are you ready to be impressed? Feast your eyes on my 500 meter mega yacht. It's kitted out with the most luxury features around, from a spiral staircase to like a dozen deck chairs for all the friends I'm yet to have. On the inside is, of course, the beautiful lounge chill out area. Here's the hangout pits. And then behind the kitchen, at the other side of this lounge, and by the way, that kitchen is better than the one I even have at home, like 10 times better, are all of the bedrooms. Bathrooms. Check out this luxury, dude. It feels like I'm in a hotel, except it's floating. I still have more than 50 million dollars, and I'm gonna buy that tank, and we're gonna invade the biggest house in GTA 5. Let's go. I finally own a tank, and there's the biggest house. Once I invade this, I'll be able to take it for my own. Hey, fellas, what's going on? <laughs> this house is mine. No one's taking this from me. Oh, my days. I just blew up a helicopter, dude. Oh, jeez. They're gonna get this tank. Come on, Franklin. Come on. We're not dying. Suckers. Suckers. <laughs> I've almost taken them all out. There's only like three people left. <laughs> <laughs> this is so good. They literally stand no chance. We take this house from him. We'll officially have the biggest house ever. <laughs> hey, man, I took out your guards. I've been waiting all day for this. I want this house. It's mine. Oh, my days. This is the vault. Are you kidding me? Is he in here? <gasps> he is. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. All right, now I've taken down the richest player in the world. I have all of his gold. Franklin, get every single bar. I want all of it. What? Guys, I'm the richest player in GTA 5. I can take <laughs> off the bottom objective and this one for getting the biggest house. Now, there's only one objective left, and that is to upgrade Franklin's house with half a billion dollars. No way. This is my house upgrade. <laughs> oh, look at what they've done. I can see a lot of cars. I can see a lot of cars. Hey, come on. Let's land this helicopter. I think there's a helipad on the roof. I'm just gonna call that thing a helipad. It looks like a helipad to me. This looks so sick. Look at all the supercars. Oh, my days. There's another garage, like, underneath, and there's a footpath over my swimming pool. I right, land the helicopter. Beautifully done. Done. Well done. <laughs> Let's go and check this out, Franklin. All right, check this out. So there's like a parking spot there. And then follow this round and we just like got another garage. Beautiful. Gated. There's no cars down here. I got another garden. Oh, my days. And I got friends. That's so nice. There's a garage down here. All right, beautiful. I think I'm just going to leave my Lamborghini here, you know. I want to walk along my swimming pool. Check it out, guys. There's now a little footpath. That's so nice. <laughs> Hold on, guys. There's another footpath, which takes me down even further to a chill out spot with a barbecue, and there's some more people down here. What's up, guys? There's a trillionaire living in Los Santos, and he's the richest man in the universe. He owns 50 supercars, a luxury giant yacht, and the biggest house in GTA 5. And everyone hates him, because every morning he sails around in his yacht, crashes into people, and then honks his horn super loud at every house he passes. What a beautiful morning to crash into boats! Stupid peasants! Hey, wake up! Come on! <laughs> Don't make me run you over with this boat, because I will. But it gets worse, because tonight he's throwing the biggest party, and a hundred of the richest people in the universe are going to be attending. It happens every year, and the entire city gets trashed. You didn't have to set the building on fire. Yes, I did. It was funny. This guy will never learn, and he has too much money to get himself out of every situation. So I am going to prank him so good that this party never happens again. It's 10 in the morning, and he's doing his usual routine. 10 push-ups, followed by 5 minutes of bragging. 7, 8, 9, 10. Hey, what do you think about that? It's kind of embarrassing to watch, but what I'm about to do is going to be even more embarrassing. Are you ready for this? This is going to be the best prank ever. And there's so many cars in here. I can't exactly goes through them. How are you supposed to get to the middle car? What if I want to drive one of the other ones? <laughs> Careful now, Franklin. We don't want to get spotted. Luckily for us, he's doing his push-ups. I don't think he's going to be distracted anytime soon. <laughs> After all, he's got two lovely ladies in front of him who he definitely wants to try and impress. I've been watching 
this guy really closely, and every single time he finishes his exercise routine, he goes to the kitchen and has this disgusting glass of green juice. I mean, look at it. It's so horrible. <laughs> but I know something even more horrible. Blended worms. Once he drinks this, he's gonna run straight to the toilet, and I don't think he's gonna want to throw a party after that. <laughs> Right, Franklin, quick, grab the glass. Glass taken. Now put the worms down. Uh, nice. That's so disgusting. Oh, it stinks. <laughs> quick, we better get out of here, Franklin, before he finishes his routine. <laughs> Thanks, ladies. I gotta go and drink my green juice now. Here we go. Here we go. He's actually about to take the green juice. Quick, Franklin, run, run, run. I need to see this. I need to see this. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. He's about to take a drink. Guys, get ready for this. <laughs> He's drinking it. No way. This is lovely. Oh, I love the protein. Oh, yeah, nothing better than a green juice. What? How does this guy like that? That's literally blended worms. I got them out of my garden this morning. This doesn't make sense to me. This guy is another species. Oh, my goodness. That, oh, that's so gross. You know what, guys? That's pranked me more than him. <laughs> that is horrible. Siri, save this recipe. That's crazy. I can't believe that didn't work. But don't worry, guys. I got another plan up my sleeve. This prank is gonna be bigger and better than the last one. Are you ready? <laughs> Franklin's dressed as a repairman, and I know there's nothing which needs repairing yet, but soon enough, he's gonna need a repair, because I'm about to do something a little bit cheeky. <laughs> there he is, in the garden, looking at his luxury helicopter, and still drinking the blended worms. Oh! Right, that's it. Let's play prank number two. You see this TV over here? I'm gonna smash the TV quickly, so let's quickly just hit the TV, and... Oh, I really got that good. Quick, we better run. Run, run. <laughs> what was that? Oh, no. This is my TV. It's been smashed. This cannot be. I need my TV for the party. I need your repairman now. Yes, that's my perfect chance. I think... Oh, put that away, Franklin. I think you said you needed a repairman. Well, it just so happens I'm in the area. I know exactly how to fix TVs. <laughs> I'll do it for uh, five bucks. Wow, that was quick. Uh, yeah, uh, fix my TV now and do it quickly. Like, really quickly. Yeah, yeah, okay, don't worry. I know exactly what to do. I'm sure I've fixed this a million times, haven't we, Franklin? There is something glitching inside. Uh, how hard did we hit that TV, Franklin? Here we go. Oh, I'm making real good progress now. See, I'm fixing a TV. Let me just take a look. Yep, those cracks are definitely getting bigger. <laughs> Eventually, we'll take the screen off and replace the whole thing. Just make sure it's fixed. I'm gonna go and lie down. You got it, mister. Have a good nap. Amazing. Now he's going to lie down. I have all the time in the world to play the best prank ever. <laughs> I am gonna sneak around the place until I find his vault of cash. <laughs> this looks like a place you would keep your money. There's a keypad and there's a locked door, which isn't locked, but there's the vault. <laughs> oh my days. So I'm gonna just open this vault and take all of his money. I mean, I, I think that's a pretty good prank. <laughs> if he's not the richest man in the world, he won't be able to afford this party or the aftermath. Right, let's uh, get this thing open. Access denied. Access denied. Night? What could the password be? Let's try 1111. Access denied. Three attempts remaining. Don't know. Okay, I gotta find the password to the vault. Let's see, it's gotta be around here somewhere. If I was him, I would keep it close by in case I forget the password. I mean, I don't really fancy blowing through that door. What does that say? Days since injury. Zero? Oh my days, this guy's terrible at running a workshop. <laughs> Let's see, what about through this door? Is there a password in here? Oh my goodness, this is a firing range. No way, that's crazy. This guy's got it all, but I have no idea where this vault password is. Unless, is this what I think it is? It is. I found a secret elevator, which takes me upstairs. I didn't realize this level existed. The games room, wow. <laughs> now I want this guy's money. There's so much in here. Right, let's see. Where would he keep the password, Franklin? It's gotta be here somewhere. He's got a snooker table, even air hole. And what is this? Out of order? What do you do here? Oh no, guys. I think he raged a bit. <laughs> Wait a second. There is a note in there, though. Do you reckon that's the password? Let's find out. Phone number? Guys, I got his phone number. No way. I think I'll keep that till later. <laughs> so I found his phone number, but still no password. Oh, wait a second, guys. I think maybe this could be it. Yes, vault password. Oh, it was one, two, three, four. That's so easy. Well, I got his password. Let's go and open that vault and steal all of his money. I wonder how much is in there. I mean, this guy is a trillionaire. The richest man in GTA 5. He's bound to have a vault full of cash. But I guess there's only one way to find out. Let's do this. One, two, three, four. 
four. No way. What? What? Hang on a second. He's got a turret. What do you have this? A golden minigun? Wow. <laughs> and look at all these bars. No way. Hey, Franklin, stuff your pockets and get all of the gold. <laughs> He's even got missiles and cash. No way. But I'm going to do something even better. I've just taken like a bunch of gold. Let's just say a couple of million. <laughs> <laughs> and I am going to make sure this guy can't get the rest. Now I've got his password. I'm going to change the password on the vault. And there's nothing he can do about it. Enter new password to reset. Hmm. 9876. There we go. So now I've changed the vault password. He can't get into his money. <laughs> and to give him a little bit of a kick, you know, to make sure he gets pranked straight away, let's do something even crazier, which is going to make him want to get his money out. <laughs> his luxury super yacht. This is what he uses to annoy everyone in the neighborhood. And once it's destroyed, everyone's going to celebrate. Except for him, of course. I don't think there's anyone on here, but it's too late anyway. Let's just throw some sticks down. <laughs> This is gonna be insane. Oh my days. He's gonna be so angry, but he's definitely gonna wanna open this vault once this is destroyed. This is a luxury super yacht. There are five levels, and everything about this is high end. I look at the lounge. <laughs> There's even a kitchen in here. In fact, I think this yacht is bigger than his house. How crazy is that? For another one down, another one. Oh my goodness. This is actually gonna be insane. <laughs> I can't wait to explode this. And let's put one more down. Perfect. Now get out of here, Franklin. Quick, quick, quick. <laughs> well, here goes nothing. Three, two, one, explode! <laughs> Whoa, I actually elevated it. Dude, it came up from the sky. It's drowned. I can't even see it anymore. <laughs> and just like that, his yacht has disappeared. And I can actually hear cheering from the other guy over there. Wow, that's that's awesome. <laughs> Yay! Luckily for us, he has so many cars. I'm going to hide right between them all and catch his reaction, which should be in three, two, one. My yacht! There we go. I knew it. No. No! No! Who did this? This can't be. This can't be. My yacht. My beautiful yacht. Is it really? Is it gone? I love that thing. More than my wife. More than my second wife. And my third. It's gone. I promise. I will find the person who did that. But first, I need to get another one. You cannot be rich without a luxury yacht. My vault. My vault. My vault. Hey. Hey. Open the vault for me. One. 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 Access denied. Access what? What? Hey, let's try this again. One. 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 Incorrect password. Incorrect password? Incorrect you. Give me my money. Now. Vault has been permanently locked. No. Open the vault. How could this be? I remember the password. This is great. He has no idea that someone tampered with it. <laughs> yeah. Well, I think I'll leave him to it. No money, no party. <laughs> my job here is done. Wait a minute. Is that a van? Oh, no. Guys, he might actually get inside the vault. He called someone out to open it. Hey, what vault needs opening? Mine. It's locked. Hey, no problem. You called the best locksmith in town. Thanks. Now get it open. Somebody changed the password. Not to worry. I got the best hacking system around. Bibbidi bop, 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 and it's open. Just like that? Yeah, super easy. You gotta give me half of what's inside, though. No chance. Get out. Wow, okay, okay. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> and I'm sorry. I was just joking. Oh, boy, we better go. Miguel Olsen, out. Bye. That was fun. I'm out of here now. Oh, why is this drive so long? Why is this so long? <laughs> Hey guys, Miguel Olsen, engineers! Who needs someone to open a vault? My money! Yes. I can't believe that prank didn't work either. Although now he has lost his super yacht. <laughs> but he's not broken yet. I'm doing prank number three. Remember, I still got his phone number. And we're going to give him a call and uh, <laughs> play the best prank ever. Hello, who's this? Hi, Dad? Is that you? Timmy, Timmy? I miss you, Dad. I, um, meet me here. <laughs> Perfect. I set him a location and let's start this prank. I just took a lucky guess that he had a son out there somewhere who he hadn't seen in a long, long, long time. <laughs> and it actually paid off. I'm sure he won't mind if I borrow one of these cars. Let's take this one. You're seriously going to love this prank. It is so genius. I should have come up with this even sooner. <laughs> but this is going to make sure he never has a party again. If this actually works, everyone in Los Santos is going to celebrate. The Raven Factory. <laughs> now I need to hide my car somewhere so he doesn't spot me. Let's just leave it uh, with this cow. Hey, buddy. <laughs> He's gonna park my car here. Can you look after it for me? 
Yep, yeah, thanks, thanks, appreciate it. I am gonna find somewhere perfect to hide. Like this bin! Quick, hide in this bin! <laughs> this is a strange place to meet. Raven Factory. Does this guy work in a smelly factory? Ugh, can't believe he's my son. Well, he told me to meet him outside these doors. I was told specifically to wait right here. There's a big surprise for me. This is kind of strange. Hey, why is there a golden car in the field of cows? Pretty weird out here. Hey, hey, what's that siren? Do you hear that? Is it Timmy? Is that you? Uh, 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 get out of here! Uh, run! 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 Can I borrow your car? Thank you! Quick! 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 Go! 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 Hey, my car! Give me my car! Oh! Oh! You shot me! Oh! That really hurts! Police! What do you guys want? I'm just here for my son! You tell that to the judge! We got him! Go what? I didn't do anything! Yeah, you tell that to the judge! He already told me that! Well, I'll tell you it again! This is working so well! They're arresting him! They think he was the guy involved in the robbery! That's perfect! <laughs> hey, thanks, Trevor. I think I'll have to high-five you after this. Let's do a digital one. Da -ba! <laughs> Wait a second. They're looking our way. Quick, hide. <laughs> This is perfect, but very gross down here. Bye-bye, rich guy. Have a good time in prison. <laughs> They're actually taking him away. This is perfect. <laughs> get me out of here. I don't think you're getting out of there anytime soon, buddy. <laughs> there is no way he'll be able to throw this party now. We've done so well, Franklin. I'm getting a phone call from the prison. Could this be him? Listen to me, Timmy. When's my birthday? Oh no, guys! He's asking me when his birthday is, and I don't know that! Which is gonna prove that I'm not actually his son! Let's just make a guess. I mean, there's one out of 365 days I can choose from. Um, it's every year, Dad! Of course, like everyone else! Tell me when my birthday is. Tell me when my birthday is. Hey, hey, what's your birthday? I'll just go with that. Let me know your birthday. Uh, please, uh, 10th of November? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Well, uh, uh, 10th of November. Wrong, it's the 11th of November. You're not my son. I was one day off. Hey, Dad, one day off, man. Come on, give me a break. When I get out of this jail, I'm gonna find you, and you're gonna regret it. Well, I don't think that's gonna happen anytime soon. <laughs> you're gonna be there for a long, long, long time. Oh, yeah? Let's just see about that. See you soon! Oh, it's on. It's on! <laughs> now this is gonna get fun. Me versus the richest man in GTA 5? What could possibly go wrong? I actually have good personality, and I know how to do a good prank. That guy, he just has money. There's no way we'll see him anytime soon. Wait a minute. Oh, my days. It's their tanks. Their tanks. Their tanks. Drive. Fire. Now. Okay. All right. We better get out of here. Hey, mister. How do you get out of jail? That's not fair. Quick drive, drive, drive. Oh, no, you don't. I'm coming to get you. I'm going to get you. Let's do this. Come back here. Come back here. Come back here now. He escaped. Well, I know who he is now. We're gonna find him, and when I see him again, he's going down. Four, that was a close one. He almost had me. I have no idea he was out of prison already. I literally saw him get locked up. We have to be extra careful now. He knows exactly who I am, and I still haven't broken him. Although he is getting very angry with us now. <laughs> if you want me to keep pranking him, subscribe to my channel and press like on the video now. If we get 20,000 likes, I will not stop pranking him until he breaks. He knows who I am, so we better be careful. So right now, I'm hiding on his roof, and if he had any idea I was up here, he would literally burn the house down. <laughs> but he's down there on the phone. I wonder what he's saying. No pranks, no funny business. I want the fastest car money could buy. The king of San Andreas is coming, and I need to beat him in a race. Ah, uh, you got it, boss. Don't worry. This is the fastest car money could buy. I built this amazing creation myself. There's a rocket on the back, and once you press button, you boom! Straight off. I like it. How much? You can't really put a price tag on this, but if I had to, I would say like, uh, I don't know, uh, 100 million bucks. Son, you got yourself a deal. Come on inside. 100 million dollars for that car? And that guy's getting ripped off. <laughs> ah, thank you. You're the kindest person in the world. So, how would I get this money? In cash or in check or uh, in gold? In gold, of course. Gold is the only way forced. All right, that is. I love gold. I melted down and turned it into golden apples just for me to eat in the morning. You're weird, kid. You're really weird. So, where do you keep this uh, gold of yours? Uh, this is a very empty house. Oh, you know. It's, uh, right here. What is the 
going on down there? Hey, I don't think he's gonna come back out of that house. He's really angry. I think he just took him out. Well, since the car is still there, what if I try and prank him with the ride? Oh, that would be perfect. I call this the improvised prank. I've got a jerry can full of gasoline, and I'm sure he won't mind if I pour this all over the engine. So when this car starts, <laughs> it's gonna light the gasoline on fire and blow everything up. <laughs> Come on, let's get more on the car. More of it on the car. Come on, get it all over the engine. All over the thing. <laughs> He's gonna be so annoyed when he sees this. Oh, this is gonna be epic. This is gonna be so epic. Please, mister, leave me alone. Oh my days, what is going on in there, dude? He's still, okay. Right, Franklin, we better speed this up. I do not want any problems with this guy. Yeah, we'll throw down some stickies. All right, nice. We'll just throw a couple down there. He's got so many cars. <laughs> We'll just blow everything up. Oh my goodness, this is gonna be so epic. And just in case everything fails, let's just plunk one right next to the engine, like that. Oh, he'll never see that. <laughs> Perfect, I've completed the plan. Now it's time for the prank. He's getting in, he's getting in, he's getting in. No way. <laughs> this is literally gonna be insane. Now, how does this work? Okay, engine and go. Oh, oh. He actually did it. He exploded every single car. <laughs> Oh my days. Yo, where did he go? Look at these cars. Every one of them has been destroyed. This is an explosion. Oh my days. We better get out of here. We better get out of here. <laughs> I just destroyed literally every single car of his. I'm gonna find you. Oh yeah. Well, you're gonna have to look a little bit closer, buddy. I'm literally on your roof. There is no way he's gonna find me now. <laughs> But now every single car is destroyed. What is he gonna do about this party? Listen, you two. I want cars. Lots of them. Go get them. Yes, boss. And show more enthusiasm. Yes, boss. Too much. This guy just can't make up his mind. If only he knew I was on his roof, he would literally tear this place down. I just know he would. But speaking of which, let's go into the next prank. <laughs> I've been up here a while, and I've discovered a few pretty interesting things. For example, this entire house is built over a giant gap. It's elevated. So I've got a plan that we might actually be able to do. If I can just about place stickies in the right places, we might be able to destroy the entire house. Do you think we can do it? <laughs> I guess there's only one way to find out. Let's do it. If I can destroy his house, then he is gonna be so angry. Perfect. It's working. We're getting him in the rock. <laughs> Let's put some a little bit lower down, too. Oh, yeah, amazing. If we go over the foundations, then this place is gonna crumble so much. <laughs> he loves this house, but without a house, he's not gonna have a party. And he's 100% gonna break. Three, two, one. Let's destroy this house. Go! <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's coming down. It's coming down. Oh, that didn't work out too well. Uh-oh. Franklin, we better get up. That's him. You destroyed my house. You're going down for a long time. What do you mean? No, you can't do this to me. It wasn't me. I, I was just a passerby. You can't prove anything. You're wearing the same outfit as before. Oh, no, he's right. He's got me here, and that siren's I can hear. Please, man, please. I I'm sorry. I didn't mean to prank you. Too late. You're going to jail. Oh, no. Franklin, we might have failed this one. I can't believe it. Only five pranks in two. I didn't mean to do anything, officer. I promise. Hey, Frank, don't sweat it. This guy needs to get pranked good. Michael, is that you? <laughs> No way! Michael is pretending to be a police officer! I've been watching you, Frank. Uh, those pranks are good, but we can do better! Better? No way! Am I gonna prank this guy with Michael D. Santa? You're a legend! <laughs> He's moved to another house out of Los Santos, and this one is even nicer! He's got bodyguards everywhere, luxury planes, so many supercars, and a giant swimming pool! And this place looks like a masterpiece! I need to pull off a pretty big prank if we want to ruin this party! But it's already getting too late, because some of his guests are beginning to arrive. The driveway is filling with cars, and there's three people waiting to get inside. And I can hear music already. Make sure their name's on the list. No pranksters. Yes, boss. Hey, Michael, did you hear that? There's a guest list. If we can get our hands on that guest list, then we could tweak a few names and remove some others. <laughs> and add our names on there. And then we can just walk straight in. Hey, uh, first things first, Franklin. We better put on a new change of clothes. He knows exactly who we are, and he'll be able to spot us a mile away. There we 
we go back to normal. He won't suspect a thing. <laughs> so I gotta get my hands on that guest list. Luckily for us, I found a perfect way to sneak inside, but there's a couple of bouncers hiding around. The only guy who's my worry is this guy. Bam! <laughs> and now he's not. Now's my chance. They're already dancing upstairs, and I don't think there's anyone at the door. <laughs> Apart from the two bouncers. Come on, Franklin, don't screw this up. Don't screw this up. We're gonna take them both out and check out that guest list. I wonder who's coming to the party. Do you have any ideas? I mean, it's the top 100 riches. We gotta know some names on there. Hey, sorry, buddy. I need that clipboard. And you as well. Give me the clipboard. <laughs> Stay down. Oh, my days. In the hedge. That's perfect. Right, let's get that clipboard. Who's coming to the party? <gasps> what? Tom Cruise and Ronaldo? <laughs> Right, they, they gotta go off the list. We're gonna really annoy them. And, uh, yeah, you know what? Just rub, rub all these names off. 90% of the names, get rid of them. Amazing. And put Franklin Clinton, Michael DeSanta. All right, quick, get out of here, Franklin. Get out of here. I'm just gonna walk straight in after this. They have no idea it was me who knocked them out. And when I go back up there, they'll literally let me inside. <laughs> but I can't wait to see what happens when Tom Cruise arrives. He is gonna kick up a big fuss. And so is Ronaldo, the most famous football player in the universe. Ugh, don't tell boss, okay? Boss won't know about this. Neither will our wives. Or our friends. Oh, that was so embarrassing. Really embarrassing. Here we go. It's working. Uh, wait a second. I think I can see them both. Uh, hey, guys. Sorry. I think I'm on the guest list. No one's being let in. This is amazing. <laughs> it's Ronaldo and it's Tom Cruise. Listen, guys. Your name's not on the list, okay? But I'm Ronaldo. And I am Tom Cruise. I love your films and I'm a big fan, Ronaldo. But you're not on the list, okay? I, I can't let you in. Ronaldo! Yes. I know your name. You don't need to tell me again, but I can't let you in, okay? Just go! 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 I can't! My plane's on the runway. I flew here! That's very impressive, Tom. Why didn't you just go inside? Because I'm a good boy, and I always go through the list. Hey, Tom Cruise, Ronaldo, uh, Franklin Clinton here. I think I'm on the list. Yes, you are, son. You go in. Thank you. Thank you very much, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Who's he? He's not rich. Yeah, yeah. Ronaldo, thanks for giving me up, man. Yeah, really appreciate that, man. Really appreciate it. <laughs> now I'm inside the house. I got to keep a low profile because I am going to sabotage a few things. Let's go straight for the music first. That's some really nice tunes he's playing, but it would be a shame if we were to mix things up a little bit. <laughs> There's the richest guy. He hasn't seen me yet. Looks like he's having a little bit of a boogie with the other guys. <laughs> okay, you know what, guys? Let's just um find the stereo wherever that is. Do -do -do, do -do 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 -do. Just please don't look at me. I am in new uniform now. New clothes. New clothes. You have no idea who I am. There's the speaker system. Perfect. Oh my goodness. This is going to be amazing. <laughs> Now, I am going to replace the music with something else. Hmm, embarrassing music. Perfect. Let's put this CD in. <laughs> Whoa, okay, this is a real big difference now. <laughs> okay, we better get out of here. We better get out of here. I love this music. Hey, you, come here. Oh, no. I think he likes the music. Are you having me on, buddy? Um, hey. <laughs> hey, you like the music then? Yeah. Uh, do I recognize you? No, you definitely don't. You definitely don't. No, I do. You're the, uh, yeah, you're the guy at the supermarket, right? Yes. Yeah, I am that guy. Oh, my days. I'm getting so nervous. I need to go. I need to go. Guess what? Tom Cruise is coming. And so is Ronaldo. They're on the list. Oh, yeah, you might want to check on that list, but, um, <laughs> that's pretty cool. I'm just going to go outside for a second. Oh, how's it going, buddy? Lots of guards here. Jeez. And whilst I'm out here, I am going to go on to phase number two. There he is. My guy, Michael. Michael, did he bring them? Did he bring them? Of course I did. But we gotta be careful. I know, we need to be really careful. Now take the rats out of the bag, one by one. You fit all of them in your bag? That's pretty impressive, Michael. Well, <laughs> what are we waiting for? Let's set them off. Hey, rats, go on. There's food inside. Go to the music. <laughs> now we've unleashed a bunch of rats. There's only one thing left to do. Run! <laughs> get out of here, Franklin! Rats! There's rats! Get here now! I think I'm gonna get out of here. Hey, guys, you don't wanna go in there. There's rats in the house. <laughs> I'm gonna hide in this bush. Hide here, Franklin. Hide here. Hide, hide, hide. He'll never see us in here. Perfect. Nobody pranks me and gets away with it. Nobody. Come back here. Get here now. Come back here. Where do you go? Where did you go? I'm gonna find you. I'm gonna... Uh, 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 <laughs> I tripped. Where did you go? Okay, now's my chance. I'm over here. Over where? Over here? Are you sure? Oh! oh <laughs> you, you tricked me. Ow! 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 Oopsie daisy. Sorry, mister. I think what I was meant to say is I was uh, hiding in this bush. <laughs> now he's out the way and broken at least all of his bones. <laughs> I'm gonna go and enjoy the rest of this party. And since I'm on the list, maybe I can make an exception and 
let Tom Cruise and Ronaldo in. I would love to party with them. <laughs> what do you mean your name's not on the list? Wait a minute. I think I can hear his... <gasps> He's still there. How is he there? That's literally impossible. Who did I just throw off the drive? Hey, listen, man. I came here in my private jet and I really wanted to party. Tom, you're on the guest list. I don't understand. Yeah, well, tell that to your bouncer. Ronaldo! Your name is not on the list. What do you mean it's not on the list? I put him on there personally. Let me take a look. Oh, no. This list has been messed with. Ronaldo, Tom Cruise, I'm really sorry. Will you forgive me? No, I won't forgive you. I flew here. In fact, you're never being in my movies again. Never. But no, Tom, I love those films. I really want to be in them again. I'll do anything. I'll be your stunt double. I'll break my kneecaps. I promise. No. What do you mean? No, Tom. You know what? I'm done with you. Yeah, I'm done with everyone. Yeah. Oh, no. We better get out of here. Franklin, he's going crazy. <laughs> oh, no. Wait a second. I've missed the final prank. No, the seventh prank. Hey, guys, don't leave. You're going to miss the ultimate part of the party. The fireworks. Isn't that right, Michael? Hey, just let me uh, let me get on that roof quickly. Let me get on that roof. Don't set them off yet, Michael. Don't set them off yet. <laughs> well, here goes nothing. Three, two, one. Firework time. <laughs> Oh my days, that's insane. We blew everything up. <laughs> hey, mister, look who got pranked. Good. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Hey, yeah, you might want to look behind you first, buddy. There's a couple of police officers, and I'm gonna get out of here. <laughs> no. Sir, get on your knees now. This wasn't my fault. I was pranked. We got all that proof we need. You're going to jail, and this time, forget. No. I can't believe that actually worked. We pranked him so well, and he's stuck in jail, and I don't think he's gonna get out anytime soon. He took out Tom Cruise, Ronaldo, and a bunch of other party guests. So, Franklin, our job here is done, and since he's now in jail, I think I'll take this house for myself. <laughs> it's a pretty nice place. I mean, after all, I haven't even been inside this room yet, but I think he's got his own vault. Wow, he does. Look at all this gold. It's now mine! <laughs> and we should probably throw a pretty crazy party. What do you think? Sounds like a great idea, boss. He's even calling me boss. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, I have officially pranked the richest man in GTA 5, aka the trillionaire, seven times. This seems to be the magic number because now he is completely entirely broken. Franklin's been a naughty boy. He had a rampage around Los Santos and ended up locked in prison. And now he's only got one dollar to his name, which isn't very helpful when bail costs five million bucks. Can we do it? I really don't know, but I'm gonna try everything I can to get out of this mess. After all, if Franklin hadn't robbed the bank, we wouldn't be in prison in the first place. Instead, we'll be a millionaire sitting on a beach somewhere. Yeah. What does this guy want? Rent my phone for one dollar. I can rent his phone for one dollar. Do I really want to spend all of my money on that? I mean, that's actually a pretty good item to have. Hey, mister, I'll rent your phone. How long do I have it for? One minute. Great, I've just rented his phone for one dollar. That's all of the money I have, but I only have one minute to use it. Okay, all right, I'm in Bolingbrook Penitentiary. <laughs> wow, this is so crazy. All right, let's see. What cars can I buy? I need a getaway vehicle. So when I do escape, we can get out of here in one piece. Let's see, what do they have? Uh, I reckon this will have the cheapest ones. Is there anything I can use? Oh, yes, there is. This rusty piece of metal for ten dollars. Right, that's my getaway car, but I need to find ten dollars to buy it. And I don't have the phone anymore. Thanks, that was the really fun fast minute. Actually, I need to make $11 if I want to buy that car. Prisoners get to work. My job is to wash the wool, and I get paid a dollar a day for doing this. So once we've done this for 11 days, I'll be able to rent that phone and get the getaway car. And then all I gotta do is find a way out of this prison. Except this is gonna take me a long, long time. We might have to think of some other ways to make some money. And I know just the man, but... You're not gonna like it. I'm meeting up with the boss of the prison. This guy's been in here for 50 years, and he's willing to pay me good money for doing some jobs for him. Money which I could do with really badly. Find me my baseball bats. I'll pay you five bucks. His baseball bats? All right, that can't be too hard to find. I wonder where he lost it. Oh, it's telling me to go to the roof. That's kind of risky. If I'm caught up there, I could be put in solitary confinement and will be stuck in prison for another two weeks all alone in my own concrete room. That's not gonna help us escape, but I gotta get this baseball bat. If I wanna make five bucks, this is how we do it. Let's see, there is a guard looking directly at the staircase. What about on this side? Ah, oh, man, there's guards up there as well looking at this entire wall. It's gonna be impossible to get up on that rooftop. I need to find a sneaky way onto the roof without alerting any of them. But there's so many guards around here. This corner seems a little bit quieter. We might have some luck over here. Franklin, just sneak around behind the yard. Yes, nice one, buddy. Nice one. And 
beautiful. There's two guards right there. Okay, three, two, one. And get them, Franklin. Bang. And this guy. Ah, nice. Nice. They're down. Amazing. <laughs> and I think he actually had a gun. Beautiful. I got a gun and I have a nightstick. <laughs> I'll be able to use this on anyone I encounter. Now it's much quieter on this side of the yard. And there's no officers to spot me. Now I think I found my way onto the roof. We climb on this and then climb onto the vent. We can do this, Franklin. I know we can. Just yes. Amazing. I have found my way to the rooftop. And no one knows I'm up here. Now let's get that baseball bat. And I wonder if you'll want to buy this pistol from me. <laughs> or maybe I'll need it to escape. Uh, we'll keep quiet of that for now. Don't let anyone spot you. Oh, I am at the highest point in the prison right now. This is amazing. Is it here? Can we see it? Oh, yes, it is. Amazing. I got the baseball bat. <laughs> Perfect. Now I got the baseball bat. I just need to find a sneaky way down to the ground without any other guards. Noticing I'm up here. Oh, there's quite a big drop. All right. <laughs> okay. Maybe we'll just take this steady for now. Oh, great. There's even more guards coming this way. Come on. Give me a break. Please don't catch me. I don't want to go to solitary. All right. He's doing his own thing. Could take him out, but I'm gonna leave him for now. I don't want to cause any suspicion. Not yet. I right, run, run, run like you never ran before, Franklin. Run now! Come on! We need to get back down to the ground immediately. Right downstairs, down here. Do, 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 do. Come on! Come on! Come on! Yes, and then put the bats away. We've done nothing. <laughs> not me, innocent me. Now we've done nothing. Don't worry, guys. All these guards. Yep, not me. Not me. Hey, officer. <laughs> hey, what a lovely day it is today, huh? Right back on the yard. Perfect. Not a single eyebrow raised. Franklin, well done, buddy. Now let's return this baseball bat. Hey, mister, I got your baseball bat. Can I please get my five bucks? You're resourceful. Here's your money. Want some more? You know what? I would love some more money. What is it I need to do? Teach my friend a lesson. I'll pay you double this time. Your friend a lesson? Okay, I'm sure we can do that for 10 bucks. That means I'll get $15. That's perfect. I'll be able to rent the phone and get that rusty car. And then all i got to focus on is a way out of here. And now i got that pistol. That's going to really help me out. <laughs> so this is the guy who needs to be taught a lesson. And he seems pretty casual, just chilling by himself. Where's your friends at, man? What did he do? Did you betray somebody? Hey, man, I'm speaking to you. Anything you're going to? Oh, no, you're not walking away from me. I'm gonna teach you a lesson. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I'm doing this. All right, three, two, one. And, ah, nice. Lesson taught. Anyone see that? No? Guards didn't see anything? All right, perfect. Franklin, let's go back to the pods. That was the easiest task ever, and I did it behind the concrete wall, so he didn't even see anything either. Hey, my man, he's been taught a lesson. Now give me my money. Okay, ten bucks it is. You need anything? Give me a call. I'll just, I'll come and get you. I don't have a phone yet. But I've made 15 bucks from working for that guy, which I gotta say is a great success. Let's go and rent that phone and buy that car. Hey, officer, can I rent the phone again? I, I, I just need to look at it one more time. Okay, that's one dollar down. We still got 14 bucks. Let's buy that car. Da, here we go. 10 bucks down the drain. My car has arrived and it's in the car park of the prison. All I gotta do is get it and drive away. Okay, the easy bit is done. Now let's find a way out of this prison. Lunch time! Nice, my favorite part of the day. What kind of things are they eating? Baguettes, burgers. Hey, that isn't too bad, actually. Uh, oh, jeez, what happened to that guy in the chair? Is he okay? Is anyone gonna... No, all right, no one cares about him. Well, I hope we don't die in the prison, Franklin. Just gotta find a way out of here. We got four bucks. Ah, oh, yes, it's my turn. Amazing! Uh, I would like a banana, and I, I would also like a burger. Perfect. <sighs> all right, this isn't too bad. I mean, I quite like burgers like this. Smashed, burn a little bit, and it's even got some garnish in there. You know, these guys actually know what they're doing. Now, I'm gonna take something from this table. I don't want any of you guys snitching on me, all right? I won't, but you gotta pay us some money. Oh, who said that? Seriously, all of you guys? Really? Jeez. Oh, all right, I've only got four bucks. You guys can split it between you, okay? That'll do nicely. I'm gonna steal the spoon. This spoon will be the answer to all of my problems. I'll be able to dig a hole with this. I'll be able to get out of prison with this. And I can even pick locks with this. Never underestimate a spoon. Now we're talking. All right, let's get this back to my cell. Don't look at me in my spoon. <laughs> do, 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 do. Don't mind me. Don't mind me, guys. Don't mind me. And just like that, I'm back in my cell. <laughs> yeah. It sucks that there's a guard watching me, though. I can't exactly start digging until he stops. I'm gonna pretend to sleep instead. You know, make him think I'm just an ordinary prisoner. <sighs> 
Oh yeah, I love a good night's sleep. Me? No, I'm not trying to escape. I'm just trying to sleep, officers. <laughs> Little do they know. It's the middle of the night and 90% of the guards have gone home to their families. There's only one guard in the entire block and he's staying on the ground floor. I don't blame him. I would be scared of us too. Right, now's my chance. Let's start digging a hole. I think against this brick wall will work. Otherwise, I'll just go into my friend's cell next door. All right, let's do this, Franklin. Let's start digging a hole. Just move my bed out the way and let's get down to business. Franklin, we've done it. I've dug a hole to the vent system behind my cell. Now, once I wriggle through that, I'll find my way out of here, get to my car and escape. Easy. <sighs> Oh, why is it so tight in here? Duh. Oh, yes. It's opening up a bit more. Yes. The tunnel is a bit wider here. I can walk. All right, keep walking, Franklin. Yes. Wait a second. Is that? Is that what I think it is? That's light. No way. <laughs> Have I really done it? Are we going to escape the prison? No way. I've done it. <laughs> we escaped the prison. Oh, boy. That, that, that. Oh, jeez. Franklin, we got five stars. All right, get that car. Get that car, Franklin. Get that car. Come on. It's, it's there. It's literally right there, dude. Hey, officers, please chill out. Leave me alone. I just need to escape this prison. Oh, my days. Franklin, this is it. All right, we can't die. We can't die. <laughs> what vehicle is that? I don't recognize that vehicle. All right, you know what? I'm getting out of here. I got my rusty piece of metal I bought for literally 10 bucks. And it is time to see if you could actually survive escaping the prison with one dollar. <laughs> this is is insane. Oh my days. Okay, they got quite a few like different vehicles. I have no idea what they are, but they look scary. Seems like the prison have their own police vehicles. Like what even are they? Hey, excuse me officer, out the way. I need to escape quick. Franklin, go, go, go. Oh man, even the sheriffs have arrived now. They got the sheriff department involved. Come on. Okay, I got a five star wanted level. This car is not exactly the fastest or the best, but what if there's a plane at the airfield? What if I can steal one of those? Yes, that's a fantastic idea. Trevor's usually always got something at the airfield. <laughs> I really hope there is, dude. I don't want to die, and we are not going back to prison. There's even helicopters chasing me. There's one in the sky, and all I got is a pistol. There's no way I can get that out. Let's see if we can. I'm going to try and get the pilot. Dun, 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 dun. It's so tricky. Oh, oh, my days. Okay, they're on the runway as well. Jeez, leave me alone, guys. Leave me alone. Looks like the sheriffs really have upgraded their vehicles. They're faster, stronger, and bigger than the last ones, and there's not a single plane here. Come on, Trevor. Come on. You're meant to be reliable for those things. Oh, jeez. Move it. Move it guys, move it! Okay, I think I've like lost one tire because this vehicle is skidding like a lot now, but I'm determined to escape the prison in this vehicle so let's just try and find a nice little hiding spot. I'm sure we can find one down this railway line. Yeah, easy peasy. I know there's a tunnel down here actually. I'll go straight to the tunnel. All I gotta do is drive there. <laughs> I can't believe we're doing this. Leave me alone, guys. Come on, chill out. The entire sheriff's department, police helicopters, literally everyone is chasing me. I wouldn't be surprised if Ford Sankuto come out after this. Does the radio even work in this car? Uh, oh, wow, it does. The radio does work. <laughs> Terrible speaker system, but it does work. This is actually a pretty good buy for 10 bucks. I mean, it drives. That's all that matters. I can actually move in this thing and listen to music. Anyway, we're almost there. They're not giving up yet. I'm still seeing plenty of cars, but <laughs> those helicopters are falling behind. We might actually do this. The tunnel is coming up. It's just around this corner. Come on, Franklin. We can do this. Almost. 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 And... Yes! I'm inside the tunnel. I don't think they'll find me in here. This is a really good hiding spot, especially if you're trying to lose the wanted level. But I'm faced with another pickle. Even if I lose the wanted level, they're gonna be straight back on me when I'm wearing clothes like this. But now my stars are flashing. I reckon we have a chance at sneaking away. <laughs> they don't know where I am. They just know I'm in this tunnel. So if I very sneakily go across this bridge. Yes, they still have no idea. They have no... They're still looking at the other side. <laughs> this is perfect. That's the best flag of the century, Franklin. Congratulations. That was pretty epic, dude. Now, let's go and find some clothes we can change into so I can finally, once and for all, escape the prison for one dollar. <laughs> Ooh, the sawmill. Fantastic. That's a lovely place to hide. They'll never see me in there. Run down here. Go straight into the sawmill. Be careful you don't get turned into a pile of wood chips. <laughs> Just like that. I think we'll be fine in here. Oh, yeah. I'll hide in the wood chips. They have no idea I'm here. They have no idea I'm hiding inside the wood. <laughs> yeah. This is the best hiding spot ever, Franklin. Hands down. Just stay quiet. Stay silent. They have no idea. Yes. Yes. Franklin, we can get out. We've lost the wonder level. We've escaped the prison. Now let's find a new outfit. So that was hands down the easiest escape ever. Having a dollar or a million bucks, it literally doesn't matter. You can still escape the prison. <laughs> nice one, Frank.
Franklin, well done. The safest way out of this mess is to take someone else's clothes. And I reckon I'll take clothes from these two people. Hey guys, I need whatever clothes you got on you. I need to change into something, you know, which doesn't say I'm just escaped from the prison. <laughs> okay, calm down, calm down. I am calm. Now give me your clothes. Nice, thanks guys. <laughs> Check me out, ordinary citizen. Have I come from prison? Nah, 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 nah. Not me. <laughs> yeah, that's the other guy. Home sweet home. Boy, am I glad to see my house again. And chop. Oh, my days. Chop's in the garden. <laughs> oh, no. Chop, how have you been, buddy? It's only been a day. Don't worry. <laughs> well, a day and one night. Oh, yeah, he's fine. He'll be A-OK. -okay. Everything you can imagine costs $1 for today and today only in GTA 5. I want to get yachts. I want to get boats. I want to get helicopters. I want to get it all, Franklin. And look at all these amazing prices. <laughs> What do we buy first? Before we start diving into the lovely cars and luxury things and everything like that, I want to buy my neighbor's house because even though they're not selling it, it still costs $1. I can literally buy anything. I could get Maze Bank. I could get buildings. I could get the IAA. I could even buy the prison if I wanted to. I would love to buy your house. Thank you. Oh, here we go. All right. And buy. Oh, my days. I just bought their house for a dollar. Now I don't have any neighbors. I think I'll buy this guy's car. Hey, buddy, can I buy your car, please? Thank you. I just spent... $2. Did I buy him as well? That doesn't make any sense. Okay, one second. I'm gonna buy this guy's car behind me. Okay, let me see. How much money is this car? $4? Oh, no. Wait a second, guys. What if I check online? What are the prices online? Guys, I think the prices are doubling every single time I buy something, which means once I buy this car here, the prices change to $16. What? I mean, I don't really care, guys. I, I got like $100,000 and the prices are only 16 bucks for like whatever I want. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna buy everything in no time. And, ooh, Simeon. Oh, my days. That's the kind of cool I want to get. I got some nice rides if you want to buy them. I sure do, Simeon. Let's see what cars he's got for me. Wait a second. I only see one car. Simeon, what happened to the other ones? You said you had some nice rides. They sold out, man. What can I say? Sold out? Well, in that case, I haven't got long until this car goes. Thanks for saving me one of them. I couldn't buy this one online. I'll buy this car from you, Simeon. For 16 bucks, it's a pretty good deal. This is a million dollars supercar. And oh, I just got a text. Yo, I've just been given the location of a brand new store. No way. There's a Ferrari car store in GTA 5. I can buy Ferraris? Wait a second, guys. There's also a Lamborghini store. What? Oh my days. There's another one as well. There's this. Come back at 15 purchases. All right. Okay. And then what about this one then? Come back at 10 purchases. Because I bought five things already, I get to unlock the Ferrari store. Oh my days. Do, 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 do. Hello, mister. I'm here to make some, uh, some purchases. I heard you're selling Ferraris. That's right, boss. Any car you like? I like every single one of them. They look insane. Yo, what kind of car is this, huh? This is a Ferrari Dino. Wow, this is like a dinosaur. Guys, we're gonna have so much fun with these rides. Can I buy every single one of these cars? I think I got enough money. I mean, that's gonna be 32. That's gonna be 64. It's gonna be 128. $256. $512. That's literally less than a thousand dollars for every single one of these cars. You want all the cars? Deal. Amazing. I just bought every single one of them. Now, which one do I want to drive first? Let's see. I mean, I kind of want to... I, I, guys, I got to drive this one. It's a racing car. This literally belongs in the Formula One. And now it is mine. Careful. I do own these cars now. <laughs> I still literally have $99,000. Move out the way, guys. Coming through my brand new Ferrari. I'm going so fast, guys. This has to be the fastest Ferrari I bought today. I wonder what kind of cars they're selling in the Lamborghini store. I guess there's only one way to find out, Franklin. Do a little U-turn. Oh, jeez. Oh, my days. We're so going off. No, don't go in the water. <laughs> Anything but the water. Recover it. Yes. Wait a second. There's something else on my map. I didn't see this before. Make 20 purchases to unlock. Guys, once I grab my Lamborghinis, I'm gonna go and see what that is. Oh my days. Look at those Lamborghinis. Wait a second. Look at that one. Okay, I wanna buy all of these guys. There's five Lamborghinis in here. And once I buy these, I get to see what cars they sell in that store. And that doesn't even have a name. Hey, Mister, I love the artwork you got in here, dude. There's the Urus. Now tell me, can I buy these cars from you? 
you. Why, of course, son. They're here for you. This is the Lamborghini Urus. No way. And I love the design it's got. I think I'll buy this one first. All right, that was only 1024 bucks. You know, that's not too bad. You know, for a car like this, just 1024 All right, let's get this one next. Convertible. I don't even know what Lamborghini this is, but it looks really, really fast. And I love the design on this one, too. So this must be the Lamborghini Centurino, one of the most expensive ones in the store. And that's the Lamborghini Turzo. I think I'll go over the Centurino first. $4,096. Oh, these are so cheap. Oh, my days. But how do we get here from just $1? That's pretty crazy. And then time for the Lamborghini Turzo. This one is literally from the future. And for $8,192, that's not a bad price. I mean, have you seen the inside of this car? It is insane. There's even a holographic display. I spent $32,000 on this collection of Lamborghinis. That is such a bargain. After today, I'll be able to sell them for millions of dollars each. This is a really nice ride. He must be so annoyed he sold it for such a cheap price. And now that I own all of these beautiful Lamborghinis, I want to see what else I can buy. I got to get all of them, guys. Every single one of them. <laughs> I still have like $64,000, so we should be okay. Hello. Love these cars you got here. Let's check this out, dude. I don't even know what car this is, but it's solid chrome. Oh my days, it's a Mercedes. No way. And this one is a Ferrari, which looks like it's come from like a hundred years ago. That looks pretty awesome. This is a racing car, and this looks insane. And check this one out, guys. The GTA Spano. No way. Man, how could these cars get any better? Can I buy this car first? Consider it done. It's $32,768. That's still kind of cheap for this kind of car. Now, I want to buy this one next. $65,536. And right now, I have like $35,000 in my account. I don't have anywhere near enough money to buy that. And then, wait a second. If prices keep doubling, that's going to cost like 125 That's going to cost like a quarter of a million. That's going to cost half a million dollars. And then that secret 20th purchase is going to cost me like a million. Oh my days. I didn't realize this would happen. How did this happen from $1? I'm going to see what that secret thing is on my map. When I make 20 purchases, I get to unlock that or whatever it is. Let's take a look at what it is. So this is the location and something's going on here, guys. When I make 20 purchases, I get to buy whatever's going on here. Looks like some construction work. Maybe this is going to be a new house for Franklin. Who knows? But it's going to cost me like a million dollars. So we better make some money. Help, help, somebody. Uh, okay. I mean, as long as you're going to pay me some money, I I'm willing to help you. Mister, I'll pay you half a million dollars. Please, you got to get my money back. Someone stole it from me. Well, in that case, hop in my car. I'm taking you there now, and we're getting this money back. Thanks, man. Uh, this, this really means a lot to me. Uh, I didn't think I would get this money back. This is the house. He stole all my money. Let's break inside and take it back. Don't listen to a word this guy says. He's a thief and a criminal. Wow, he really doesn't like this guy. Well, in that case, let's go inside, and we're not going to listen to a single word he has to say. Hey, buddy, this is a hold up. This is a very nice house, too. Now, where's that cash, and where is he? Oh, my days, you got him. No way. Hey, mister, how dare you steal this guy's money? What are you talking about? I don't know you people. Don't believe it's lies. Don't believe them. Don't worry, I'm not believing them. Now, I can see a lot of cash down there, and I would love to get that half million bucks. Are you robbing me? Why would you rob me? I don't know you guys. Be quiet. Hey, friend, C can you put the cash in your bag? Of course, don't worry, I'll do that. Don't worry, with pleasure, with absolute pleasure. Whoa, this is a lot of money, dude. There's gonna be millions of dollars down here. All the money's in the bag, we're good to go. Ah, jeez, oh my days, why'd you do that? I'm sorry, but you just got played. <laughs> played? No, that can't be. I'll be taking your bag, thank you. Well, just great. He stole every single penny I have and set me up and even took my car from me. But don't worry, guys. I got a plan. I don't just let my cars go driving around the city. In case someone steals them, they can self-destruct with a click of a button. <laughs> when I press this button, we get to blow up the car he's driving. Explode! <laughs> It's kind of close by, guys. Oh, my days. No way. I destroyed the car, and there's so much money around it as well. <laughs> oh, dear, buddy. Looks like you just got double played. No one plays Franklin. I'll be taking your backpack and this lovely pile of cash. Guys, this person had just over a million. That means I can buy, like, so many more cars. Wait, I think I can buy all of them. Let's go back to that store for $65,000. And then this one as well for $131,000. This one for $260,000. 
$62,000. And then the final one, four. Can I just about afford this one? $524,000. No way. I just bought every single one of these cars. Whoa. Hey, officers. Where did you come from all of a sudden? Okay, I'm just going to go around the roadblock and uh, <laughs> I'll see you guys later, okay? You're under arrest for stealing money. This is not how I expected my day to go. Now I've got a five-star wanted level and there's police everywhere. Watch out. <gasps> Franklin? Oh, no! Franklin gave it up! We're going to jail now! I hope you're happy, Franklin. We're now in jail. And how much do you reckon it costs to bail from this place, huh? $1,048,576? That's too much money. I, I don't have that much money. I barely have a couple of thousand left. Oh, how am I gonna- how am I gonna escape prison? And most of all, how am I gonna make that money? I wanna buy the 20th purchase. That secret location. And let's be honest, guys. It's gotta be something good. You're in a green uniform because you're going to a maximum security, son. Inmate Franklin Clinton reports to officer immediately. Oh, no, no, no. He wasn't joking, guys. They want me to go to an officer right now. Well, that's not gonna happen. I'm gonna find another way to make this money and get out of here. Lester's calling me. Hang on a second. I still got my phone. You got locked up big time. Wanna make some cash? There's a one million dollar bounty on someone. Whoa, Lester's got some attitude. Some serious attitude. Well, he's not kidding, though. I am in prison. Now, the location is somewhere around this way. We got a problem. They're serving hot dogs instead of burgers. What we're gonna do about it, huh? We're gonna sort them out, boss. We're gonna sort them out good. That's the spirits. Now go short them. Guys, I found them. So I gotta take out the boss to get this bounty. And I think the boss is the guy talking in the middle. Well, let's just walk up to them like normal. Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. Hey, what are you doing? I'm doing this. Bam. <laughs> get him, Franklin. Get him. Guys, listen to me, okay? I'm your new boss. And as of today, you're all fired. If you don't get fired, you're gonna end up like that guy. So you're fired. <laughs> I got the million dollar bounty. The police have seen me though, Franklin. We better get running. Go, go, go. Now I have a million dollars. We'll be able to get out of here and no. Oh my days. They're shooting me. They're shooting me. Go, go, go. Da -da 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 -da. I've just annoyed a lot of people. I think we can escape this way. I think we can. Hang on a second. There's a guard up here and he's got a sniper. All right, run around this tower, Franklin, and jump. Jump for your life. Go, 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 go. Oh, that parachute just saved me. Okay, now we better get moving before the police chase me. Go, 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 Franklin. Go. Well, I lost the one to level and now I'm going to go back home. I think I'll cool one of my cars over. Perfect. I'll take this one back. Now I have more than a million dollars. I'm gonna buy the final thing. You won't believe this. Guys, they built Franklin a brand new mansion. Clinton Tower. No way. This is crazy. And I just about have enough money to buy this building. Hey, let's take a look inside. I can't wait to see what's in this place. And let's drive my car inside as well. Just in case someone gets some funny ideas and decides to steal this thing. The next thing I buy after this will cost two million million dollars and then four million and eight million dollars how do we get here anyway let's take a look inside through the garage this is my lounge and i even have an office in here guys check it out clinton dower wait there's like so many more rooms in here like there's this random room and there's this ra oh this is a toilet all right doesn't matter ignore this random room i'm just gonna go upstairs this is one of the bedrooms he really likes the color yellow and this is a balcony it gets even crazier i'm on the rooftop and they got a swimming pool here guys this is franklin's lovely rooftop pool this is way better than his house and i'm I'm looking forward to moving in. I can't wait till Chop moves in. It's gonna be awesome. You! Hey, you! Second, is someone calling my name? Oh, my days, it's you! How did you get down there? That's so weird. Bro, that's so gross. You're in the drain. I need some help. Like, right now. This is really important. Whoa, so is this where you've been this entire time? It's pretty gross down here, man. We're about to make a lot of money. A lot of money, you say? Do tell more. Follow me. Follow me. All right, I'm following you, buddy. Now, you better be leading me somewhere promising. Once we blow up the roof over there, the money's gonna fall down. I need your help to throw more down. Oh, you want me to climb up into the vault and throw more cash down? Well, that makes sense. Yo, this guy, if he's actually telling the truth, we could end up multi-millionaires. We'll be able to buy even more things. And what would you buy for $2 million? Stay clear, buddy. This place is gonna fall down. Ah, that should do the trick. Amazing. No way. I can see money. I can see lots of it. Bro, this actually works. There's gotta be tons of money in this room. All right, man, you got yourself a deal, but don't screw me over. Damn, man, only a fraction of it fell through. That's why you needed me. Hey, buddy, I'm throwing more down, okay? There's so much cash up here. No way. Well, that was an eventful heist. We made so much money together. Now, about my share. Of course. Here's your $10 million. Thanks for helping. $10 million? I can buy, like, three more things. That's awesome. I think I know exactly what I'm gonna buy next. Thanks, man. I never want to see you again now. We did nothing together. You guys saw nothing. Just 
Just look at it, Franklin. It's huge and it's all mine for just over $2 million. We're gonna do some mad sunbathing when we're done with this video, guys. I have sunbeds everywhere on my rooftop, on my boat. Now, I've also made two more purchases. One of them is on its way and the other one I think I gotta go and collect. So I'll go and get that in a second. This is a pretty nice yacht, but it's still incomplete. Actually, no, I take it back, guys. My helicopter's arrived. Yay! <laughs> my golden helicopter is here. Da -da 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 it's been a pleasure. Yo, I'm gonna have so much fun with that yacht afterwards. We're gonna go sailing everywhere. Maybe even to North Yankton. Maybe to another country. Who knows? And last but not least, how could I forget my golden jet? Guys, it's been a crazy day. I've got golden helicopters, golden planes, and I've even got myself a luxury super yacht. This is a $1 army. We got no vehicles, no weapons, and there's only three of us. It's not exactly ideal, but today we're going to change that because we're going to become the richest army in the universe. The plan is simple. There's us in the military base, and there's a couple of other enemy armies. One's in the desert, one's in the city, another one's over in the sea, and one is in a land really far away. We're going to conquer each and every one of them until eventually we become the richest army in the universe. But wait a second. One of them's trying to invade on us. I don't recognize that army. On the army bridge next door, looks like we are not the only one conquering armies today. What are they doing coming here anyway? There's only three of us. It's not exactly the best army today. Oh no, it's a tank and they're coming our way. That's it. I need to be Spider-Man because there's nothing else I can do. I literally got no guns. Right, let's see if we can get into this guy's tank. That's all I gotta do. If we get inside that tank, then we can win this battle. Come on, Franklin. Just jump over the nozzle. Let me in. Oh my days. Wait a second. Have I done it? Yes. <laughs> yes. We got the first army. Let's go. And we just upgraded to a $1,000 army. No way! Oh, wait, not yet. There's still one guy left. There we go. Now we've upgraded to a $1,000 army. And we got a tank! That's awesome! We'll be able to conquer all of the other guys so much more easily. Let's go to the guys in the desert. Hey, you guys can keep up, right? Yeah, I'm sure they can. I really want to become the richest army. I mean, can you imagine the things we would have? From golden battleships to golden tanks to so many things. Oh, it's gonna be fun today. <laughs> I can't believe they lost to me. I had nothing. These guys had the tank. This is the desert army. I reckon we can take them, but it's gonna be tricky. They got two tanks, two cars with turrets, and three different men. And wait a minute. One of them has a rocket launcher. Okay, we better be careful. Let's take them down. We're coming to get you. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, boy. I don't think he was happy about that. Oh, wait. Oh, no, no, no. Now they're going after me. Are you kidding me? Right, come on, Franklin. We can do this. Come on. Yes, one of them's down. And so is another one. Beautiful. And lastly, look at them going around in circles. They have no idea what they're doing. Oh, thanks for helping me, guys. Yeah, really appreciate it. They're literally doing nothing. That's the RPG guy. Whoopsie. Sorry, buddy. Didn't quite see you there. <laughs> this is too easy. Four. And once this guy's dealt with, bear with me. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, I wouldn't want to be him in the morning. I've just upgraded to a $100,000 army, and I have so many people parachuting in. Hey, guys, come on, pick your spot. Anywhere down here is good. This is insane. I love this video so much. Right, so uh, this is a tank. It's a one-seater, but not to worry, because we also have air support. You thought you saw it all, but no, 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 no. This is just what a $100,000 gets you. Can you imagine what the richest army is gonna be like? It's gonna be insane. These guys have three different battleships, and I have to somehow try and conquer them from land. Will these reach the boats? Oh, man, I don't think they do. Right, that's it. I need to borrow the helicopter. Hey, you! Come back here. I need the helicopter. There's only three battleships, and I don't think they can do anything to us when we're in a helicopter. So, let's try and sink them. <laughs> ooh, ooh, let's do this. Wait a second. I've already blown it up. No way. No, are you kidding me? That was super duper easy. Hey, stop it! Sorry, what's that? I can't quite hear you all the way up here. You're gonna have to try and get on my level because right now we're dominating. I just blew up every single battleship. I sunk them. No way. That's amazing. But I haven't upgraded to the next army yet. Hang on just a moment. There's another group of them down there. How did I not see them? I'm locking on and whoops, my finger slipped. <gasps> Don't back down, boys. We can do this. I don't think you can, buddy. There's only like, what, four of you guys left? And I'm already locking on to you. <laughs> there is no way these guys can win. This was the easiest takeover ever. You call yourself a good army. Are you kidding me? Oh, you're lucky. This person's gonna go a horrible way if he's not careful. Hey, if I were you, I would just run away and surrender. Come on, dude. It's so difficult killing this guy with my rockets. Nice. We got him. And we upgraded. Amazing. To a million dollar army. 
Wow. Welcome to the one million dollar military. I got a battleship. I got three people in the sky. And you guys ain't seen the best part. I got my own air support right above. These guys will demolish anything I send them to. This is the best army ever. To think we started with three people. We have airstrikes and like have dozens of different people on the beach. And tanks as well. I mean, this is gonna be one crazy takeover. Believe me. Oh, that's a lot of explosions you did there in the ocean. I would love to see you do that on land. Maybe we'll find an enemy we don't like. Like Michael DeSantis' house or an actual enemy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my days. I'm sinking the battleship. Maybe I was not the right person to sail this. Wait, how is this happening? Seriously, I have capsized the battleship. Oh, my days. Okay, we need to conquer another army because clearly I am not to be trusted in these kind of boats. It's completely capsized. It turns out we got fighter jets too, which is pretty good because we need to go really far to this next place. It's an island super far away. Military, come in. We're leaving Los Santos. Meet me at the island. Copy that, boss. We'll see you there. Okay, here we go. There's 50 of us and 100 of them. And these guys have cargo bobs. Wow. Right, I'm using this plane as long as I can. We need to make sure we keep this in tip-top condition so we can destroy everyone in the sky. Like this guy. Oh, that was really close, dude. We took out seven enemies. They only took out four of us. If we keep on like this, then we could win this. Oh, yeah, let's get some more air support. Bam. <laughs> this is going so well. We have drones in the the sky now. That's what you get for an army as big as ours. This is crazy. I mean, look at those drones. I'm gonna fly around with this guy. Hey, let's go in a little formation, and then we fly over them and drop some explosives. Sound good? I could do this all day. This is literally like taking candy from a baby, dude. Whoa, whoa, oh, boy. Okay, don't get too confident there. That was close. Is that a titan? Are you kidding me? Right, let's just sort out that titan. Oh, no, we missed. How do we miss? Okay, that's it. I'm getting out of the jet, and we're gonna do this on foot. Let's go, Franklin. I think I'm skilled enough. It's about time to show people how skilled I am. I got every single gun, which is fantastic. But once I defeat these guys, we'll have almost everything. All right, let's take down some of those. Wait, what am I even locking onto? I'll do it. I'll just buy one that way anyway. And oh, my days. They got turrets on towers? I didn't realize they had those. Yeah, I would so like to lock onto that. They're shooting me from trees. Wow, that's crazy. Okay, these guys are really well hidden away. They got plenty of things and plenty of spots. And there's only 20 of us and 70 of them. Ah, that's what's shooting me. It's the police helicopter. Looks like you guys got the police on your side. You know what else I'm gonna do? I'm gonna lay down an airstrike. Oh, yeah. See what you guys say about that, huh? Come on, planes. Let's go get them. I think we better hide in here for now, just in case. You know, those airstrikes, they're not exactly gonna be nice. Oh, boy. There's only 10 of us left, dude. <laughs> there's gonna be even less of us at this rate, too. Right, that's it. I'm going out and we're gonna get them. Hey, show yourself. I'm ready to conquer this army. Is anyone in there? I think that's a turret in there. It's definitely shooting at me. All right, that's it. I'm taking down the tower. How easy can they be just destroyed? Is, is it really easy? Yeah, that's pretty easy to me. All right, let's take down this turret over here. I know there's a turret here. I saw it. Oh, it was a car. Oh, boy. Okay, now there's literally only three of us. Maybe this was a terrible idea, Franklin. We better get into some cover. There's like 50 enemies left, and there's only three of us. Quick, get inside. Get inside. I was close, dude. I almost got blown up. Wow, they destroyed an entire building over there. Okay, let's just keep our fingers crossed the same doesn't happen to us. This is a good building, right, Franklin? That does sound a bit creepy, to be honest. If you believe in me, subscribe to this channel. Uh, just so I know, we could deal with all the support we could get. Get away! Get out of my way! Come on, move it! If you make one step closer to me, I promise it'll be the last thing you do. Oh my days, there's another guy. Something is trying to bomb me from the sky. I'm really not happy about that. Like, whoever's doing it, can you please stop? I'm the only guy left on my team. It's me versus 56 people. Okay, right, this is gonna be seriously tricky, but I think we can do it. Come out with your hands up, everybody. This will be the last day on Earth for you, not for me. Who's shooting? It's coming from up the my days. Is it another helicopter? I, it's probably another helicopter. Come on, do your worst. Yeah, that's what I saw. You can't. <laughs> Franklin, we are bossing this. Oh, boy, there's another tank over there. Have we destroyed that? Oh, wait, have we destroyed it? I don't even know anymore. Yeah, we destroyed it. That took so many missiles. Come on, get the tank to get. Get the tank to get the tank to. Come on, Franklin, you can do this. You can do this. Yes. <laughs> we got the tank as well. And the helicopter. Can't forget about that guy. Whoopsie, my rocket slipped. Anyone else? Let's just blow that up for the fun of it. There's 30 
35 enemies left. We are actually speeding through this. This is great. And I've had enough fun with my rocket launcher. I want to use the minigun now. <laughs> There's even more people. Are you kidding me? Come on, guys. Just give it up. You're not going to get me. 20 enemies left. Come on. We can do this, Franklin. Come on. Yes. Nine people left. We've almost done this. Are you kidding me? Oh, now you guys are hiding from me, huh? Come on. Show yourself. <laughs> there is nothing you can do. I think we're going to do this, you know. Franklin, we are absolutely bossing this. There's two enemies hiding down this cliff. They're literally hiding from me. I don't believe it, dude. Hey, oh, there you guys are. Wow, oh my days, they're in a turret. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I literally thought they were just hiding from me. There is another guy, like, at the other side of the island, and then that's basically all of them. This island is about to be ours. Oh, no, I found him. He was literally surrendering. That was amazing, dude. No one surrenders to me. We won. We seriously, we got the island. No way. <laughs> and look at us. We've upgraded again. This island is officially ours. This is the $10 million army. We're one step away from becoming the richest army in GTA 5. We have a bunch of tanks, jets, vehicles, and an entire military parade. We're pretty much sorted, but there's one army left to beat. And they're in Los Santos, and even they're bigger than us. Okay, fingers crossed we can defeat them, and this time, a little bit quicker than what we did on the island. The battle is in the golf course. Oh, no. Man down. Come on. Seriously? Someone sniped him. Uh-oh. Okay, we got a few people in front of us. Let's get them. <laughs> this is insane. I didn't think that fight would be in the golf course. There's 35 of us and 27 of them. We'll just do a quick lap around the golf course and, you know, just enjoy ourselves. <laughs> oh, wow. They got so many turrets propped up, dude. We are nine people ahead of them. That could be nine tanks, nine helicopters, or just nine normal people. These guys, they don't stand a chance when they go up against me, aka Franklin, the king of GTA 5. Who's doing that, dude? Somebody is trying to bomb me, and I have no idea who it is. These guys. Oh, I see you now. You're looking so sly, huh? Ah, that's what you get. This is working, Franklin. We're doing a smashing job. That's a friendly... Oh, my days. I can't even tell who's my friend and who isn't. <laughs> this is so tricky. You know what? I'm just gonna call in an airstrike and let them do their thing. That's a turret up there, though. Oh, yes. Okay, I found an enemy. That's it. I'm gonna go for these guys first. Nothing beats a good old airstrike. <laughs> hey, thanks, guys. You're the best. Now, everybody is really spread out. Like, there is someone hiding in these bushes. Oh, there you are, man. Trying to hide from us? <laughs> what do you think you're doing? Ah, oh, disappointed in you, my friend. You should have been with the others. Over there, where the actual fighting's happening. Okay, it looks like it's quite busy over there. Let's go and help him out, Franklin. What on earth are you doing in there? Right, that's it. This is weird. I'm just gonna whack out the rocket launcher and destroy you guys. Turret up in the sky. That turret ain't gonna bother us. There's another turret. These turrets are like the most annoying thing ever. You can only destroy them with rockets, and they're pretty powerful. It is now literally just hunting for the enemies. There is a guy, like, at the other side of the hedge, literally running away. Where is he? Oh, my days. He is really far. He's legged it. No one escapes from the scene. That's the last guy. Hey, everyone, let's go find him. It's a plane. Of course it is. Is he gonna come back to the golf course? I don't know. But I'll be waiting for him. We will all be waiting for him. The final guy. <laughs> he may as well just fly away. Hey, what's that doing up there? Let's destroy that thing, too. Come on. Come on. Come on. All I gotta do is destroy this plane, and we become the richest army in GTA 5. Ah, oh, here we go. One of our teammates is chasing after him. Go get him, boy. Go get him. <laughs> no way. You just took out the plane. That's amazing. Yes, we did it. This is the richest army in GTA 5. <laughs> it looks insane. What is this in the middle? I didn't recognize this vehicle. What does that say? RCA unit. Riot control. Wait a second. Is this a tank? What? Yo, I can't wait to drive this. That looks insane. But check this out, guys. This is my military. There's got to be at least 200 men here. Afternoon, guys. Doing a fantastic job. Whoa, those tanks, they're so shiny. Check this out. Every single tank is literally chrome. That's amazing. And the planes, they're also pretty shiny too. They're chrome? No way. And look at these vehicles. Yo, there's so many missiles. Okay, I want to drive this. This is a really cool vehicle. I have never seen this in a military base before. Come on, Franklin, jump inside. It can't be that hard. It's a tank. Okay, it's got a bit more than a turret. That's a really powerful turret. <laughs> look at this, dude. It's an explosive turret. And believe me, that is powerful. Wow. That's all it's got, to be honest, but that's all you need. You don't need anything else crazier than this. Hey, let me test it out on this guy. Sorry, man, just testing out my turret. This is the best vehicle ever. Today, I'm the king of GTA 5. I can do whatever I want, and nobody can stop me. This is my house, and it's got the best protection. And right in front of me is somebody I'm supposed to knight. This is so weird. Your Royal Highness, what an 
honor to meet you. This is so cool. Everyone respects me, and I don't have to do anything apart from use this sword. <laughs> Let's try and use this on this guy. So I gotta do one shoulder, the other shoulder, and the head. All right, let's try this. Uh, oh, no! Don't kick him, Franklin! That's okay. I'll get down again. What? This guy forgave me? <laughs> Yo, I can get used to this. No one can get angry with me. This is awesome. And I love the jewelry you got, Franklin. Right, let's try and knight this guy again. I wouldn't want to be him. All right, let's give it a go. No, don't kick him again. Are you kidding me? This is not going out as planned. Sorry. Sorry, buddy. Don't give me a sword. It's too much fun. This is amazing. <laughs> Can't do anything. I am the king. For once, the law doesn't apply to us. Hey, who could that be? Let's go and check this out. Nobody just rings the doorbell of the king's house. What kind of person is this? Um, average guy. Got a t-shirt on. Okay. I am really interested now. Hey, who are you? <laughs> what do you want? Yo, King Frank. You forget our bets or what? Our bets? What is this guy talking about? Jousting. Me and you. At dawn. Well, guess what, son? It's not dawn anymore. Forget it. You're just too scared. Wait, what time is it then? We had a... Okay, guys, apparently we were meant to go jousting at dawn, and now it's the middle of the day. Um, I'll joust you. I don't care. I'm the king. Oh, yeah? You really think you're up for it, huh? Yeah, yeah, I do, actually. Okay, then. Well, it's your funeral. How on earth does jousting work in this universe? Oh, with cars, of course. <laughs> this is not gonna end well. Your Highness, this is not a smart idea. Don't tell me what's a smart and not a smart idea. I know what I'm doing. Well, pick your car. Oh man, there's so many to choose from. So if we're jousting, I don't think one with a big windscreen at the front is a safe idea. Let's go for something with a smaller window like this one. Yeah, this one looks perfect. Small windows, it looks pretty compact. It's a... Oh my days, this car hasn't even been released yet. Are you kidding me? How do we have this? Oh, I forgot. God, I'm the king. Are you ready to die? Yes. No, actually, are you ready to die? Oh, boy, I'm not good with this competition talk. Who even is this guy? And why did I agree to joust him? I'm the king. I don't need to do this. Go. Okay, we're going. We're going. Let's do this. Okay, so how does this work? Do we just crash into each other? <laughs> I literally have no idea. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Who's gonna win? Who's gonna win? No! <laughs> We got him! Amazing! His car is annihilated. Oh my days. So that was either gonna be me or him. I'm so glad it was him. Look at my ride. This was so dangerous. Wow, this is the car. That's what's left of it. And wait a second. He didn't survive that. This is a really dangerous sport. Why did we agree to this, Franklin? <laughs> Let's not do that again. Well, I went jousting. It looks like I am the hero today. You, my friend, are the coward. <laughs> well, at least my guards will be happy. They're still in the job. Hey, guys! Look at it. I won. Now, can you go and sort out the, uh, the body at the back? <laughs> Don't know what to do with him. Hey, let's drive into Los Santos. I want to mess with some people and see what happens. Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? I got an entire convoy? <laughs> Check this out. It's not just me going to Los Santos. We got the whole secret service as well. Hey, let's see how fast I can go. I'm going to take them on for a ride of their life. Hey, come on, guys. But you can't catch up with me, King Franklin, winner of jousting. How fast are they going? Ah, look at them. No way they're going to catch up with me. King Franklin, slow down. Sorry, guys, I can't hear you over my crazy loud engine. <laughs> we better get moving. Go, go, go. They'll catch up eventually. And if they don't, I'll just fire them and hire somebody else. <sighs> I've got an idea. Since I'm the king and we can't technically break any laws, let's see what happens if we screw with this police officer. Hello there, sir. I've uh, heard you've been doing some excellent work for the service. Why, thank you, your royal highness. Speaking of which, there's a few tricky things we must sort. Uh, me and the secret service, of course, can only know about this. Uh, guys, take care of him. Wait, 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 what do you mean? Ow, ow, ow. Thanks, guys. You're the best. <laughs> oh, my days. Did he shoot you? I'll be okay, boss. See? I can stand. Great. Well, thank you so much. No one's coming after me. I just took out a police officer. This is amazing. <laughs> Playing as the king is the best ever. I can do more than literally the president can. Your highness, you're needed somewhere. Where am I needed? What's going on here? 100 years 
ago, there was the Battle of Los Santos. People were fighting over cornflakes. This tank was the largest toy ever given in a cereal box. Hey, let's get your good side. Front page of the paper tomorrow. I wish I could get a toy that big. A cereal box toys? Hey, I think someone's telling a fib here. I don't think you can fit that in a cereal box. This is important history. You have to make a speech. Really? I do? Okay. Well, let's make a speech then. Since I'm the king, I gotta show up and do some king work every now and then. You know, show people I exist. I care about these uh, giant tank toys. Hey, I hope they're actual real tanks. Now, that would be fun. Uh, guys, I don't need you with me to do this speech. Come on, and stand in the car park. <clears throat> now, where do I start? Oh, I'll just congratulate these guys. Uh, well done on finding the biggest toy in the cereal box. It was my great granddad. He opened it and there it was. Wow, I honestly can't even believe that happened. Well done, sir. Well, in fact, I'm gonna get you a reward. Oh, what is it now? Sir, this is important. Seriously? More important than this speech? Jeez, what do these guys want? Seriously, this is important. Okay, okay, I take your word for it. But I'm not leaving until I get these guys a reward. I want to exercise the powers of the king again. So, how about you get a photo of this? I am gonna build the biggest house you've ever seen on the side of the observatory. And it's gonna be a museum to these tanks and home to the people who own them. This is insane. The biggest mansion ever to set foot in Los Santos. It's slightly smaller than mine, though, but that doesn't count. It's in the desert. How can I ever reward you? This is amazing. Oh, don't worry about it. Just spread the good word that Franklin here is the best king around. I can do what I want. I can cast magic across the world. And I, I can basically do anything I want. This is amazing. I just built in the best house in the world. Look at the view from here. It is a complete panoramic view. Just glass everywhere. Can it be broken? Oh, okay. It can be broken. Not exactly the strongest glass. You can sunbathe outside. You can have a barbecue, fly in your helicopter. Wow, we've really gone all out with this place. When I said I'd build you a mansion, I really meant it. Sir, you have to come with us. Oh, fine, I'll come with you guys then. Where are we going? It's the military. Something happened to them. What happened to the military? Hey, I don't understand. Can you tell me more? That's all I know. They won't tell me. Oh, man. Something really bad's going on in the military. Great. Just what I need on a day like today. I thought it would be fun and games playing as the king, but clearly we can't get one day off. What do you think's happened to the military base? I mean, how bad can it be? These guys have an entire army. They'll be fine. Oh, wow. We're going through like that then. Not even stopping at the gates. Okay, people are keeping watch for us. This is actually getting kind of scary. Something's gone on at the military base. Get out. Okay, right, we're getting out. Here we go. You there, tell me where I can find the commander of this army. Head to the runway. Oh, here we go. Somebody actually in charge. Okay, we're following him then. Why is everyone just dragging me around the base? What is it that's so secret that they won't tell me already? Are we going in there? Oh, no. That's the commander. He's dead. He was such a nice guy. What was his name? Jerry? It was Terry. Oh, oh yeah, Terry. Man, what a shame. How did he die? You can't do this. I need to find another leader. Sir, if I may, pick me. I have the skills. You? Great. Okay, it's done. You are the commander of the army. Excellent. You will not regret this. <laughs> Great, I'm glad we sorted that out. I want to go home and play some Fortnite. Come on, guys, my feet are getting tired. Nobody told me the king had to walk this much. And with this much gold on me, I mean, I'm basically weighed down three times more than anyone else would be. Oh, dear. Looks like you guys got the short straw. You'll be walking home. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Hey, don't worry. It's a good workout. You'll get your exercise in for the day. You guys are the real winners. You got the right home, eh? <laughs> hey, look at you guys. You'll be first on my squad in Fortnite. But if we don't get any dubs, you'll go into prison. All right, I'm finding a new team. I'll be disappointed forever. Hey, put some tunes on. I want to listen to some new... Whoa, wait a second. Why are the tanks at the front of the military base? Hey, guys. I think you're in my... Why are you shooting all my days? They're shooting us. They're shooting us. Get them. Are you kidding me? What's going on? Hey, you. I just made you... Are you kidding me? Ah, ah, my men, my men! What was that for? Let's just say you're retiring. <laughs> retiring? No, no, you can't do that. Come on. There's got to be something I can do. Come on, get up, Franklin. Ah! Oh, he just kicked me in the face. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? Oh, oh, hey. Wait a second, where am I? Calm down. Calm down? How can you tell me to calm down? Where is this place? I'm in a basement. It's really cold. Hey, can someone give me a jacket? Give this guy a jacket. Oh, thanks. 
that's a bit better. We're making some negotiations. Once the government pays, we'll let you go. How much are you asking for? 10 billion. Are you crazy? That's like all of the money I have. No, you can't do that. If they don't pay, you die. I can't believe this. I play as the king and they kidnap me. Asking for ransom? There's only one person who can help me now. Franklin, I'm gonna have to leave you for a few moments. Michael, you're all we can count on. Let's go rescue Franklin. Michael's done military training for two months now. If anyone's gonna get him out of this mess, it's gonna be him. <sighs> Once that door opens, we're going down and saving Franklin. Get ready for this. Get ready for this. Ah, oh, it's blinding. I can't see anything. Here we go. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go. Oh, my days, dude. Watch out, Michael. Parachute. Even the parachute's frozen over. That's crazy. Wherever we are, it's seriously cold. I can't really see anything down here. Ah, seriously, I'm on land? I can barely see anything. Right, that's it. We better use night vision, Michael. Much better. I can see things now. There's a house over there. Now, Franklin was in the basement of something. What's the chances it's in this house? Keep it cool, Michael. Keep it cool. I don't see any guards. Okay, let's go through the front door. Careful, just in case we see anyone. It's overturned. This house is a ruin. Blank missing, and what is just a safe? Okay, there's no one here, guys. This building is clear. Let's go find somewhere else. I can't really see what's going on here, so I'm just gonna explore and... Is this a frozen lake? Wow, it is. It's so foggy. I literally can't see anything without night vision. What have we got here? No one's been here recently, but there's fire pits and there's crates and a vet. No way found a town. I reckon Franklin's in there. He's gotta be. If we save Franklin, he better knight Michael and the proper way without, like, accidentally killing him. This is a really old town. Totally overgrown. The kind of place perfect to hide somebody. We're looking for some people. Enemies. People from the army. The military. I don't care. We're just looking for people who look very suspicious. I need to find some high ground. Are there any lookout towers? There is. I need to get up there. The question is, how do we... <gasps> That. The fire is lit. Someone's been here. That must mean Franklin's nearby. What can we see on this tower, Michael? And the thing's suspicious looking. We're looking for people. <gasps> Wait a second. I found somebody. Franklin is in that building. No way. I got him. And is that? That's a basement. That's a hole. Okay, so I found where Franklin is. I found the building. I'm just going straight in. Hey, you got the king. Can I see anyone else? Come on, come on, come on. <sighs> No, I can't. I gotta go inside myself. Keep it cool, Michael. Oh, my days. I found them. And we got a shotgun. Beautiful. Two birds with one stone. <laughs> yeah. Hey, guys. It looks like you got something from me. I would like it back. Bam. Oh, my days. I missed them. Get them. And, uh, nice. Nice one, Michael. We're smashing this. Oh, boy. Okay, anyone behind me? I think we're safe. Wait a second. We're not. He's still alive. Oh, that hurts. Anyone else alive? This guy. Ah, screw you. With night vision, I can see everything. These guys can't. Now, Franklin's down there. Hey, Franklin, are you down there? You'll never get him alive. I'll kill him. Oh, boys. He's gonna kill him. Oh, my days. Get him, get him, get him. One more move and he dies. You wouldn't dare do that. Oh, no. He, he would. He would, Mike. Trust me. Oh, you, you really think so, Franklin? I, I, I think so, too. Okay, well, in that case, uh, let's just put our guns down, okay? Joking! <laughs> oh, he really thought I was actually gonna put my gun down? Franklin, let's get you out of here. I can't believe that actually worked. Michael came in clutch and saved us from the military. Well, next time we appoint the leader of the army, I'm doing a background check. Make sure the guy isn't crazy or anything. He almost had us for a second there. Yo, you really shouldn't be the king, you know. You're a bit too stupid. Are you sure you want to speak like that to the king, Michael? I don't care. You can't do anything to me. I know too much. I suppose that's true, actually. All right, Michael. Well, I'll let you off for now. Thanks for saving me. You're the best. It is good to be back home. So, where were you guys when I was kidnapped, huh? I bet you were partying at this house. Sir, the president needs to see you. He said it's important. Oh, really? Can I not get a moment silent today? I thought being the king was fun, but this is really stressful. Fine, let's go and meet with the president. But I'm driving alone, and nobody's following me. I'm taking my Lamborghini, and we're going for a ride, okay? I want you guys to stay here and don't move a muscle. I'm watching all of you on my cameras. If I catch anyone moving a muscle, I promise they're gonna be kicked out of the team and probably thrown in the Lamo Sea. Oh, no. 
Hey, what's going on here? And why are there so many police officers? Sir, we need you inside. Okay, I'm going inside. Is this gonna be another one of those military situations? Oh no, the leader of the police is dead. We need to find somebody. Oh no, no, I'm not gonna fall for that one. <laughs> no way. <laughs> what is actually going on? Whoa, hey, who did this? Where's the gold gone? Why are the cells empty? All of the money in the city was in this vault. Are you telling me you lost everything? It's my fault. I'm sorry. I'll make a speech in the morning. Morning. In the morning? No, 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 no. We're not making a speech. You're getting that money back. That's my money. That's the city's money. That's everyone's money. If we don't get it back, Los Santos will be ruined. And Franklin won't be the king anymore. Let me talk to my friends. I'm sure we can figure it out. You know what? I've got one even better. I'm gonna go and meet a friend myself. This president is useless. He has no idea what he's doing. If anybody can track them down, it's Lester. And because I'm king, he's got no choice but to help me. I'm gonna put on a different necklace for this. Now we're talking, Franklin. Now that looks good. <laughs> Yo, Lester, you better help me out because we are in a lot of trouble. Somebody stole the money. You're gonna help me find it. And if you say no, you are gonna regret it. <laughs> I know who stole it. I was in on the plan. Oh, were you now? Why am I not surprised? Lester's always in on a plan when it involves money. So where are they going, Lester? They're going to the quarry and sailing out with the money. If you're not there in... 10 minutes, then they'll probably be gone. So you're gonna wanna go now. Thanks, Lester. You've given me all the information I need. Do I still get some money? No, no, you don't, Lester. You don't deserve anything. You stole that money. It was mine. And the cities and the people. But most of all, it was mine and the king. Yes, we're just in time. Come closer. We got the gold. What? I said come closer. We're not Superman. I can't hear you. Just bring the gold to the boat. Oh, great. Now my shoes are wet. What does this guy think he is, huh? He's so dead doesn't seem to be going to plan for them. I mean, that guy, for some reason, is a little bit stupid because he's not bringing the boat to the beach. There's a lot of gold on there, guys. Look at that. There is so much. It's gonna take him all day to move into the boat. Just go to the beach, dude. Actually, no, it's okay. Let's just saw him out. <laughs> you can't even see anything. I have no idea. This is amazing. Yo, I'm gonna have some fun with this. The military owe me. Let's just say I called in a few favors, aka an airstrike. Where are the planes? Where are Oh my days, there they are, dude. <laughs> Get ready for this. I would not want to be them. Hey, guys. Heads up. Oh, I did say heads up. <laughs> Seriously, you missed? Right, that's it. I'm going to shoot them down myself. Well, thanks for nothing, guys. You call yourself the military. They really need a new leader. Well, Franklin, we got the gold and we saved the day. Just in time. Let's take this back to the Union Depository. Oh, what an amazing adventure it's been. We've done jousting. We knighted someone, kind of. We lost the money. We got the money. We even got kidnapped. Being a king is stressful. This is where the richest man in GTA 5 lives. He's a trillionaire and I'm going to steal every single dollar he has. But getting inside isn't very easy. He's got security guards literally everywhere and they're from the SWAT team. There's some pretty professional security guards. So don't worry guys, I got a plan. <laughs> I'm dressed as a fireman. So if anyone raises their eyebrows at me, I'll just say I'm working with the fire brigade. I gotta test those fire alarms or something official. <laughs> Let's see if this works. If I can pull this off, I will become a trillionaire, and I'll be able to buy literally everything in GTA 5. <laughs> Shh, don't tell anyone about our secret plan. I'm trusting you guys not to say a thing. All right, here goes nothing. Bring up the fire truck. Now let's see if these guards buy it. Hello, I'm here with the fire brigade. Oh my days, they opened the door. Amazing. <laughs> I made it through the gates, but there's two guards in front of me. I need to see some ID. Well, I suppose I am a fire brigade person, so <laughs> I'll just give him my actual ID. Franklin Clinton. If anything goes wrong, I'm blaming you. Don't worry, mister. Absolutely nothing is gonna go wrong. I'm a professional fireman. <laughs> oh my days, there's Oh, jeez, they're shooting us. Quick, Franklin, get inside, get inside, dude, get inside. Oh, my days. Dude, they must have just suspected something wrong about me. What am I gonna do now? They know I'm up to something. Did you guys tell them? Oh, man, I, I knew I couldn't trust you. Okay, well, in that case, Franklin, let's see. There's gotta be something around here we can use. Maybe one of these people is the richest person. Hello. <laughs> I'm looking for the richest guy. He's at the other side of the building. Please, don't shoot. Fantastic. He's at the other side of the building. <laughs> let's go and find him. He must be through this door and somebody left it open. <laughs> well, isn't that just my luck? Now, where is this guy? Hello? Hello? I'm here for the richest man. 
<laughs> there you are. Excuse me, mister. I need to get all the money you got. You know what? I'll just take it from you. Now. <laughs> right, grab that, Franklin. Whoa, I got the vault password. Yes. And let's go and open the vault. I walked past it on the way in, guys. I know exactly where it is. There's going to be so much money in there. Bada bing, bada boom. Here's the vault. Let's put the code in. <laughs> I found the vault. There's the gold. And I'm officially a trillionaire. Yes. <laughs> Ow. Oh, come on. That really hurt, dude. You messed with the wrong guy. Oh, no. This is really bad. Oh, man. Come on. Can we just put this behind us? Clearly, it didn't work. What do you think you're doing? What are you going to do with a trillion dollars, huh? I'm sorry, man. I had no idea what I was doing. Can I just go home? I got a dog, and I love him so much. We know all about your dog. He's right here. Hey, boss. Look who we got. I've never eaten dog before, but I'm sure it tastes nice. That's kind of weird, man. No, it's not. No. No. You can't be serious. Eat, chop. What kind of evil person are you? Listen to me, son. I'm going to make a deal with you. I don't believe you can spend a trillion bucks in a day. And it's only a penny in my pocket. If you can spend it by the end of the day, you get to keep chop. If you can't, you're going to die. And so is your lovely dog. What? That's the weirdest request ever. He literally wants me to spend this money. And what happens if I do, huh? Then you get to go and keep everything you bought. But you got to spend everything to the last cent. You got yourself a deal. I, I mean, that's actually kind of a, a, a decent scenario where we might actually survive. But I got until the end of the day to spend a trillion dollars. This guy really doesn't like me. They have Chop as a hostage. And unless I spend a trillion dollars, by the end of the day, Chop's going to die. So let's see. I got a ton of gold and a ton of money. A trillion dollars ready to spend. What's the first thing we can buy, which costs a lot of money? We're going to go for the most expensive stuff. Like literally nothing less than the most expensive. Jason. I don't recognize a Jason. Who's Jason? Hello? Sir, how would you like to upgrade your house for 100 million bucks? Upgrade my house? Hey, that sounds like a really cool idea. What do you think, guys? Do you reckon I should do it? Oh, that's an easy yes. Hey, mister. I don't know who you are, Jason guy. Can you upgrade my house, please? Yeah, take 100 billion. <laughs> so I just upgraded my house? That's already 10% of my money gone? I can't believe that was so easy. I better have got a good house upgrade. Let's go and take a look. Whoa, this is amazing. My house has been totally transformed. There is literally another house on top of my house. Hey, let's go and take a look at this place, Franklin. I am gonna take a look in the garden and there's already a staircase. No way! I think I'll just take the staircase up and check out the roof. <laughs> Hot up. Lovely TV with the view of Los Santos. Check this out, guys. I have my own office and a cinema room. Okay, this is a pretty cool upgrade, but this is only 10% of spending my trillion dollars. There's still so much more money to spend. I could do this nine more times. Can you believe that, guys? Nine more house upgrades. Wow, there's even a master bedroom up here. That's incredible. Incredible. And you know what I love about this is that down below, there's a bunch of rocks next to my swimming pool. That's awesome. You know what I could do with now? I could do with filling the garage up with a bunch of nice cars. And I think Simeon's going to have some pretty nice ones. <laughs> and since I have $900 billion, we're going to be able to buy any car in this universe. Let's go and buy some cars. Imagine Lamborghinis, Bugattis, Ferraris. <laughs> Lester. <laughs> Franklin, Franklin. You sound really out of breath, Lester. What do you want? Nice place. Would you like to buy a business? A business? I haven't thought about that. Franklin Clinton, professional entrepreneur. <laughs> Lester, I'm interested. But first, I could really do it buying some cars. This place is looking bare. Forget the cars. You're gonna want to hear this. I know where the owner of Life Invader lives. Do you now? And why do you know that, Lester? None of your business. Except there is a problem. He's not willing to exactly talk to us. You're gonna need to get through his security team. Well, that's should be simple enough. How big's the security team? Oh, not very big. Uh, you'll be fine. Thanks, Lester. Thank you. So it looks like I get to buy Life Invader. Do you have any idea where that is? Let me just show you right now. Life Invader is the social media website of GTA 5. And Denise Clinton coming in with the roast. Does the new crib mean you've moved out? Or haven't you moved out? How many homes do you need before you put some food in the fridge? Denise, screw you. Okay, screw you. <laughs> Actually, I want up her because I'm going to buy this company. I got $900 billion. We easily got enough money. <laughs> Let's go and buy the company and kick Denise straight off Life Invader. This is going to be awesome. This is where the owner of Life Invader lives. This is a really nice house. And I got to sneak inside and find the owner. Lester, you told me there would be no guards. There's so many of them. Right, you know what, guys? I'm just going to do this in Star Whoa, whoa, don't crash into anyone. <laughs> that was close. Hey, just ignore me, guards. Ignore me. Just, just Fireman Franklin over here. <laughs> Right, let's take them all out. Three, two, one. Bam! Oh, my days. That car literally just saved them. Get them, Franklin. Come on. What are you waiting for? Now. Ah, nice. <laughs> and that's all the guards.
that's dealt with. Sorry, mister. I mean, I, I, I wasn't aiming for you. You just drove in front of the rocket. That was basically your fault. <laughs> Whoa, oh, there's even more guards. There's even more of them, dude. There's so many. Uh, screw you guys. Yes. <laughs> Look at me. I made it inside and not a single guard left. Now, where is the owner? I need to buy this business. Hey, this seems a little bit suspicious, you know? I mean, Lester said he would sell the business to me. <laughs> I just took out his security team. Is he really gonna want to sell the business to me? Well, I guess there's only one way to find out. You! I know you're the owner of Life Invader. Now, I'm here with an offer. <laughs> I would like to buy the business. Give me the business or else your windows are gonna break. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Listen, I'll sell you the business for 700 billion. 700 a billion? That's fantastic, actually. I got a trillion dollars to spend. <laughs> I'll buy the business from you. Thank you! That's all right. You're crazy. Yeah, I know. But since I own the business, I also own this house. Can you leave now, please? <laughs> I just spent $700 billion buying Life Invader, and now I own the business. This house is mine. The company's mine. Let's go and check out those offices and tweak a few things. <laughs> Guys, you know what that means? I only have $100 billion left to spend until I get to win this challenge. And since I own Life Invader, that's gonna be so much income for the rest of my life. Come on, let's go and check out the headquarters. <laughs> Before I go and check out my amazing new team at Life Invader, let's go and uh, dress up in something nice. <laughs> oh, Franklin, you look good in this. Well, thank you very much, ma'am. Now we're actually looking pretty rich. <laughs> we're gonna spend this trillion dollars in no time. I almost spent it in one purchase. This is going all too well. And now let's take a look at Life Invader and meet the team. I have a really good prank I wanna play on Michael. You guys are gonna love this. <laughs> Hello, 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 it's Franklin Clinton! <laughs> Your new boss! This is so cool. I literally own the Life Invader building. I got an amazing receptionist team out front. Hey, what's up, guys? Who are you? Yeah, 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 trust me. They, they're gonna, they're gonna, we're gonna get along. We're all gonna get along really, really well. <laughs> and let's go upstairs and play this really good prank on Michael. Wow, this is awesome. These guys literally have no idea that I've just bought the office. I am now your new boss. I am your leader. <laughs> Can you give Michael 100 million followers, please? Michael, he's Santa. Yeah, that's the guy. Are you sure? Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. Just do it. Okay, then. Amazing. Michael D. Santa's gonna get 100 million followers. Now, let's go to his house. <laughs> this is gonna be hilarious if it actually works. No way. It actually worked. <laughs> Michael D. Santa is now the most famous person in the whole of Los Santos. He's gonna hate that. Trust me. Look at all these people. Hey, guys. I'm Michael's best friend. I'm just gonna come through. Michael! <laughs> this is amazing. All because I gave him 100 million followers. Oh, dear. I think Jimmy wants to go out cycling. Hey, Jimmy, I wouldn't recommend that if I were you. You've got a couple of fans outside. <laughs> Let's see what happens. Is he going to be okay? Jimmy, Jimmy, watch out, buddy. <laughs> this is so crazy. His entire family is super famous. Leave me alone. Hey, I don't think Michael likes this one bit. <laughs> hey, Michael, they're not going to leave you alone, buddy. You're the most famous person in Los Santos. And these guys, they're going crazy for you. <laughs> There's so many photographers. This is hilarious. They've even fenced off part of the street. What? Michael has no privacy now. Like, literally no more privacy. This is hilarious, dude. <laughs> See you, Michael. Have fun with your newfound fame. He did tell me he always wanted to be in movies. Now you can be in so many of them. Oh, man. Lester, what do you want, buddy? I was just about to buy a really, really nice car. Forget the car. I got something better for you. Better? Seriously, Lester? You always got something better for me. And last time I trusted you, I had to go and intimidate the owner of life invader, which was pretty hilarious. Have you seen Michael's house? <laughs> Simeon will sell you his store for 10 billion bucks. What do you say? Have all the cars in the world. Wait a second. Simeon selling his store? I didn't realize he was doing that. Yo, Lester, count me in, buddy. I'll go and buy the store from him. <laughs> if I can just buy Simeon's store, then I can have every single car in the GTA universe. Let's go and buy this store. I get to buy Simeon's for 10 billion dollars. Hey, Simeon, I got the memo from Lester. I heard you're selling up. I don't know what you're talking about. Wait, really? Really? Lester told me for 10 billion bucks that I could buy this store. So that's what I'm here for, Simeon, and I would love to get these cars. <laughs> Simeon, give me your store. You're making big mistake. Trust me. Simeon, I haven't trusted you one day in my life. Now give me the store now. Here's the money. Now sell me the store. <laughs> I want to own every car in Los Santos. Fine, fine. Here's the store. Give me the money, okay? There you go, Simeon. There's your 10 billion. Thank you. I would like to buy the store back. No, Simeon, that's not how it works, okay? The store is now worth double. <laughs> All right, this is mine now. This is awesome. Hey, Simeon, we don't need you here anymore. So can you just go? <laughs> 
I have just bought Simeon's store, and inside are some of the rarest cars ever. There's a Ford GT40, a Lamborghini Turzo. This machine, whatever this is, that looks pretty awesome. I think it's hovering. Wow. Next to the machine is this. <laughs> There's a lovely supercar and a Bugatti with golden engravings. And wait a second, guys. Simeon's store is also mine. <laughs> this is amazing. Now I own Simeon's store. I have some really nice cars, and I finally can drive a supercar around GTA 5. I think we'll start with this one for now, but I still have 90 billion dollars to somehow spend. How am I gonna do that? Do you guys hear that? Sounds like a foghorn. Let's go and check that out. <laughs> what could that possibly be? I can hear a really loud foghorn coming from over here. Hey, let's go there right now, Franklin. And luckily for us, I'm in a super duper fast car. <laughs> Welcome to the Bugatti Chiron Super Sport. This is one of the most expensive cars money can buy, and I'm driving it right now. <laughs> hey, maybe we can get like a couple of these for Franklin's brand new house upgrade. I mean, playing as a truly there really isn't that bad. I own Life Invader, I own Simeon Store, I own a house upgrade, and I have one of the coolest cars in the universe. But what is that noise? I still can't put my finger on it. Do you guys have any idea? Let me know in the comments if you know what it is. Are you guys seeing what I'm seeing? This is a cruise liner. Wow, the Queen Mary 2. This is the biggest boat I've ever seen in GTA 5. I must buy this. Have you seen how many windows are on there? There's gotta be at least a thousand bedrooms. Whoa! All right, let's get this thing. This is the size of a town. All right, there's a little queue over there. Hey, guys, excuse me. Out the way. I, I need to get on. I need to get on. This is mine. This is mine. Excuse me, sir. Uh, could I, could I, uh, could I take a ride on this? <laughs> How much for the boat? $20,000 for a round the world trip. $20,000? No, I don't want to board as a guest. I want to buy the thing. How much does it cost to buy a cruise liner? You can't be serious. Uh, in that case, it's, uh, uh, $50 billion. $50 billion? Well, uh, I think we got the money. I still have, like, $90 billion after all. <laughs> Count yourself a deal, buddy. This is now mine. This is an announcement from the cruise liner. Everyone is kicked off. Your holiday's canceled. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing. I have literally just bought a cruise liner. The doors are tiny, but there's the balconies up there to the bedrooms. And look at all of the lifeboats. There's so many. I am really high up as well. Like, this is as high as some of the towers in Los Santos. But let's sail this thing. I think this is where you move it from. I can't believe it. One little steering wheel for this entire boat? Now it's talking. <laughs> let's go, Franklin. Listen to that horn. That is so loud. So I have just got the Queen Mary 2 for 50 billion bucks. I still have to find a way to spend 40 billion by the end of the day. But I think we got a bit of time. Let's take this for a ride out to the ocean. <laughs> wow, this is so crazy. <laughs> it's so cold out here. I'm really far away from Los Santos, and this has been so much fun. But I don't want to let shop die today, so let's go and spend the rest of my money. Oh boy, how long was I gone for? It's five o'clock already? Wow, it really is getting late. Maybe that was too long, Franklin. Okay, let's see. 40 billion dollars. You know, I could buy some more businesses. We'll find something out. Maybe get some. I can't even get cars anymore. I already own the car store. Prison inmate? Hang on a second. Someone's phoning me from the prison. Franklin, it's me. I need help. I'm stuck in prison. Lester's in prison. Wow, that's the first time I've heard him go to prison. Well, let's go and uh, see what the bail is. Maybe we can spend our money on that. <laughs> Knowing Lester, it's gonna be pretty high. Hey, fancy seeing Lamar in here. Hey, Lamar, what's up? Are you meeting somebody? Oh, well, well, he's meeting someone too. Oh, Lester, there you are. <laughs> How do you get yourself in here, buddy? This is kind of weird. Seeing you on the other side is usually the other way around. Listen, it was a mistake, and you're the only person I know. Can you bail me out? It costs 30 billion bucks. 30 billion just to bail you out, Lester? Well, I do have the money, and you know what? If it was any other day, no, I wouldn't. But since it's today, <laughs> you got yourself a deal, Lester. I'll bail you out of prison. But you owe me. No more betraying me, okay, Lester? I know what you're like. You're a real friend. Thank you. I want to pay you back. Here, take my house. I think I'll pass on that, Lester. You don't have to pay me back. Just call it a really nice favor. But I would love to buy another house. Something bigger and better than Franklin's. Let's see what we can buy in Vinewood Hills. <laughs> now this is what we're talking about. Lake Vinewood Estates. The most expensive place to buy a house in GTA 5. <laughs> and this one is one of the nicest houses on the street. I think I'll buy this house instead. One billion dollars should do the trick. I mean, there's no way it's worth more than that. <laughs> Which leaves me with nine billion dollars. You know what I'm going to do with that money, guys? I'm going to throw the biggest party ever. But I'm going to save a billion just for later. You guys will see. <laughs> I think I'll even invite the richest guy over, you know, and just prank him.
looking real good. Right, Lester, help me set up the party. That's what you can do. Oh, that'll be a big favor, actually. Let's go and make the biggest party in GTA 5. <laughs> now this is a party. I got fireworks, I got the whole of Os Santos here, and more people are arriving by the second. <laughs> there are so many things going on, from music video photo shoots to gigantic cars. A running race? <laughs> Wait a second, people are running. They're literally running, dude. What are you doing? What's the point of this game? Wait a second, there's a ladder? Who put this ladder here? <laughs> this is awesome, but I saved $1 billion to prank the person who thought it was a good idea to dare me to spend a trillion all the way down to zero. Wow, there's people chilling on the roof. I didn't realize you could do this. This is actually so cool. Oh my days. <laughs> Wait a second. <laughs> I think someone's falling off. No way. Is that really what I think it is? Is someone, someone is, oh jeez. Bro, you're on your own there, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> but wait a second, I can see him already. He's arrived. And it looks like he's got Chop with him too. Hey, Chop, don't worry, boy. I'm gonna save you. So, let's just get down from here. I'm sure we'll be... Oh, boy! Oh, that really hurt. Maybe we shouldn't have done that. <laughs> Afternoon, ladies. Right, let's go and get Chop back. Hey, guys, let's go speak on the tennis court. Away from the party. Did you manage to spend it all, son? I did. Except for $1 billion. I'm just gonna give that to the police right now. <laughs> yeah. Who have just arrived, actually. Afternoon officer. So, since I just bought the police, <laughs> I told them to take you away for a very long time just for being evil. What do you mean? I did nothing to you. I gave you a trillion dollars. Yeah, but you were going to eat chop if I didn't spend it all within a day. That's pretty evil, buddy. Hey, officers, take him away. I don't want to see him again. <laughs> Funny prank. Tell them to stop. Hey, buddy, I'm not pranking, man. This is real. <laughs> You're going to jail for a very long time for being mean and evil. <laughs> You're the one who robbed me. Yeah, well, you'd sell that to the police, buddy. Have fun. Chop, I'm so glad to have found you again. <laughs> but I own a bunch of really nice things, from supercars to mansions to house upgrades to even a cruise liner. I think we're gonna go on holiday for a while. <laughs> Come on, Chop. Let's go. This is not fair. Get me out of here. Ooh, I don't think he was a fan of that, guys. But now I got zero dollars. I've officially spent a trillion in one day. Last week, somebody took Chop. I woke up out of bed and suddenly I heard a crash bang and a car drive away. I have no idea where he's gone and I'm really concerned because I've searched this house everywhere and he's disappeared. But I did find one clue. It's this note. Subscribe if you want to find Chop. So I have to make this video because I really want to find him, guys. Because if you don't subscribe, I will never get Chop back. And I really don't want that to happen. So please, press the subscribe button now. And maybe they might just tell us where he is, dude. This place is a mess. Oh, man. All I want to do is get Chop back. I've literally searched this house everywhere. Ah, <sighs> my days. Have you guys subscribed yet? I really, really, really want to find him. <sighs> Wait, hang on a second. I got a text. No way. I think you guys subscribed. Unknown cooler. Oh, no. Guys, this is a photo of Chop in Russia. He's in Russia? All right, Franklin, we better get to Russia now. How did they get him there? And why is he in Russia? We better get to the airport, Franklin. We gotta go to Russia. It's gonna take me hours to fly to Russia. And there's no guarantee that Chop will even still be there. Oh, but you just wait, guys. Once I get there, I'm taking everyone out and I'm getting Chop and we're getting straight out of there, guys. What is he doing in Russia anyway? That's what I wanna know. Russia is literally hours away. I can't believe I'm about to go there. I've never been to Russia myself, and I have no idea what to expect. Hey, guys, if you're excited, smash like on the video. Or just press like to wish me some luck. No, actually, to wish Chop some luck. Because right now, he's over there surrounded by tons of dangerous people, and we're gonna somehow take them out, rescue Chop, and get out of there. Yeah, this is gonna be a very, very tricky mission. But I'm at the airport, and within the hour, we're gonna be on the flight and on the way to Russia. All right, just ditch the guy here, Franklin. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go! Excuse me, good sir. I need to be on the first plane out to Russia. Sell me whatever ticket you got. That'll be, uh, $10,000. $10,000? No problem. I, I just need to get Chop back. All right, thank you. I've got my ticket to Russia. Let's go. <laughs> I can't believe we're actually gonna go to Russia. This is gonna be insane. Do you guys recommend any food over there? Because when I go and get Chop, we're gonna go and celebrate over a dinner or something. <laughs> Let's go to Ru Ah, jeez! Oh, oh, oh. oh, that really hurts. Police sirens. Oh, my days. There's a gunfight going on. Someone just shot me. Hey, Franklin, come on. Get up, buddy. Oh, oh geez. Jeez, this doesn't look good. Oh my days. They just took out the police officers. This isn't good. This isn't good at all. What did I do to you? Who is this guy? You're coming with me. I don't really have a choice in this. I can't even get up. Ah! Jeez. Oh. 
boy! Oh, hey, guys. <laughs> what do you want? Don't you recognize me? No, I don't recognize you, mister. Let me think. Who have I annoyed? You stole my cars! You owe me ten million dollars by the end of the day, or you're dead. Dead? Really? You don't mean that? I mean, you're the richest man. What's ten million dollars to you? It's the principle. I loved my cars, and you stole them. Oh, boy, guys. He's really annoyed at me. Really annoyed. And it looks like I can't exactly do anything until I give him the ten million dollars. I might just get on a flight and sneak out of here. And don't even think about sneaking away. My guards will be watching you all day. Hey, that kind of rhyme, man. You, you should not go into poetry. Whatever. Screw you. Well, that's one way to be thrown out of a building. Oh, yeah, of course. That's the guard who's going to be following us. Well, <laughs> sorry, mister. Uh, I'm going to run. <laughs> right, i got to somehow make him ten million dollars. How much do we have right now, Franklin? I have, no, nine hundred dollars. I think I spent everything I had on that ticket to Russia. Oh, that's so annoying. Actually, I've got an idea, guys. I stole all of those guys' cars with Simeon, and that was only the other day. There's a good chance Simeon still has those cars in the store, and if he does, I'll just bring them back, and we'll have paid off the ten million dollars. Oh, no, this doesn't look good. There's nothing in his store. Oh, come on, Simeon. Please tell me you still got them somewhere. Simeon, please tell me you still got the cars. No, honey. I'll be home by five. I promise. Yes, yes, I know. I know. Don't worry. I'll give you extra cuddles tonight, okay? Okay, sweetheart. Goodbye. Yeah. Uh, what were you doing in here? Uh, I didn't tell you to come into my office. How much of that did you hear, my boy? I heard nothing. I just walked in, Simeon. Just walked in. <laughs> I heard all of it, buddy. I just need to get these cars, the ones we uh, stole the other week. Surely you couldn't have sold them by now, Simeon. My boy, I sold all of them. Why? I kind of need to give them back to the person who owned them, Simeon. He's a little bit angry, and I really want to save job. Well, I suppose I can help out a little bit. Here are the addresses of the buyers. Only two people purchased the car collection, but you didn't get the addresses from me, okay? Thanks, Simeon. You're actually a legend. Thank you so much. So he gave me the address of the people who bought the cars. So all I gotta do is go to their houses, grab the cars, and take them straight back to the owner. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. This is where one of the buyers live. They must be so rich. I can't imagine owning a house as big as this one. It's massive. There must be at least 20 bedrooms in there. And look at this garden. Wow. Water fountain, lovely patch of grass. This is insane. Hang on a second, guys. I recognize that vehicle. That's the one I stole literally a few days ago. <laughs> it's a giant robot. It's got guns on the front. Oh, yeah. Rocket missiles. Oh, my days. This thing is insane. <laughs> He's gonna be so pleased when he gets this car back. It's gonna be the most expensive one out of all of them. It might not be worth 10 million, but it's gonna be close, guys. This is literally a giant robot. <laughs> Explosive round. Yeah, guys, it doesn't get better than this. Seriously. <laughs> but that guy only had one of Simeon's cars, and he said there were only two places to check out, which means the other house is gonna have the entire collection. Hey, check it out. 360 full rotation spin. Bet your car doesn't do that. Oh, no. <laughs> this is too good. Hey, man, I got one of your rides back. How much money are you willing to pay for this one? I mean, it's got to be worth several million, right? It's a giant robot, dude. Come on. This is only one of many cars you stole from me. Uh, how about this? Two million dollars off your debt. You owe me eight million dollars now. Eight million dollars? Are you crazy? Oh, no, guys. This was only a fifth of what I had to get him. Okay. Well, I suppose that's fair. Hey, what are you looking at, huh? I'll go and find the other ones. Don't worry. I know exactly where they are. Let's go, Franklin. This is the second address, and I don't see too many cars outside. In fact, all I see is the monowheel. No, no, hang on a second. Where are the other ones? I know they're around here somewhere. There's no one else who bought these cars. They don't seem to be here. What about the garage? Oh, no, there's nothing in the garage either. Where are the other ones? Okay, let's go and find the owner. Hang on a second. I think this is the guy. What do you mean they don't want to pay? Make them pay. Come on. Hey, mister, I need to know exactly where your cars are. Get on the ground and don't ask any questions. Thank Thank you. What do you want from me? What do you want, son? I got money. Plenty of money. Uh, in that case, I would love, uh, ten million dollars. I, I just want to go to Russia and get my dog back. You're crazy. I will not give you ten million dollars, okay? That's- that's crazy. And why do you want to go there? Because my dog's 
over there. I need the money, bro. Give me the money and you're gonna be okay. No, you're going to have to try something else. Anything else you need? Where are your cars? I noticed they're not in the garage. What have you done with them? My cars, eh? Well, I'd sent them all off to another country. They'll be leaving the port uh, right about now. You you're gonna want to get there if you want to get the cars. What? You shipped the cars off? Oh, no, this is even more annoying. Okay, what do I do? Uh, they're leaving now, so I kind of gotta go now. Oh, I don't really have a choice. Okay, go, Franklin. Go, go, go. He's not gonna pay me my money, and I gotta go and get his cars. That's the only way we're gonna do this. Well, at least I got one ride. The monowheel is a pretty cool car. <laughs> if you can call it a car, is it a car? Is it a bike? I have no idea. There's really not much to this thing, but because it's a monowheel, it's so thin that I can go between any situation. Well, at least I got one of the expensive ones. That's for sure. But since these cars are about to leave the docks like any moment now, we better get there quickly or else we're gonna miss all of them. And if we miss them, I'll have no idea how we're gonna make this money back. Cars, cars, cars. Where's the cargo boats? There's one over there. Amazing. Uh, do you reckon the cars could be on this boat? We are loading things up. Um, I have no idea. Wait, what's that noise? I think a boat's just setting off, guys. Okay, let's go and take a look. I can hear the horn. And he told me it was setting off like around about now. Has a boat set off already? Oh no, guys. I think it has. That must be the boat with the cars on. Okay, we better ask someone. Is there someone around here? It's literally sailing away. Hey, excuse me. I need to find a container full of cars. Do you know where that is? Yes, I do, son. You're a little bit late. The cargo boat's already gone. It's the one to the right of you. Oh, no. It is that one, guys. That's the one with the supercars on. Thank you very much, mister. I'm gonna have to try something extra sneaky to get them back. I think the only way to do this is to hijack the boat, get those cars, and bring them back to land. All right, Franklin, let's do this. Yes, I'm on. Perfect. So this way must take me up to the bridge. And once I'm in there, we'll be able to sail this thing and get the cars. I've made it to the bridge, and the captain is right there. Okay, here goes nothing. Let's get him, Franklin. Oh, my days. He's got a gun. He's got a gun. He's got a gun. Come out with your hands up now. No, I won't, mister. I won't. I just want a container. All right, here goes nothing. Here goes. He reloaded. Get him. Get him. Get him. Ah, ah, nice. Uh-oh. That doesn't sound good. Oh, my days. What do we do, Franklin? I've destroyed the entire board. Maybe we can try and fix this. This should be it. Ah, jeez. Okay, guys. I think I've done something to this boat. Please tell me this had nothing to do with the stabilizers. Please tell me. Please tell me. Come on. It doesn't tell me anything. It's just a ton of buttons. I don't know what to do, guys. I just need to find this container. Speaking of which, does this look normal to you? I think the boat is beginning to sink. How could I have sunk the boat from just shooting one little panel? Find the car. That doesn't look good, guys. The sea is literally behind me. How am I going to get the car in all of these containers? There's thousands of them. Well, that did not go to plan. I, uh... Yeah, I accidentally sunk the boat, but we'll be okay. Uh, we'll figure something else out. I don't really have a choice right now. The cars are at the bottom of the ocean, dude. Well, that's the last time I try and hijack a boat again. They're gonna be so annoyed when they find out it was me. Oh, no, I'm so annoyed at myself. We were so close to getting those cars. Well, at least I got the monowheel. Hopefully this will sell for a lot of money. Hey, really rich guy, I've got the monowheel for you. I, I got a bit of a problem with the other cars. Problem? What problem? Actually, no problem. No problem. No problem. You, you can definitely... You'll get your money back. I promise, buddy. I promise. Uh, I have your money wheel. How much is this worth? It's gonna be worth, like, a lot of money. It's a money wheel. One of a kind. That was literally my cheapest car. Or one million dollars. Now you owe me seven million, okay? Fine. Whatever. I still owe this guy seven million dollars. There's gotta be something I can do in this city which makes me some money. I will literally do anything. Anything to get shot back. I love that dog. Hey, I wonder what Lamar wants with me. Hey, Lamar, what's up? Bro, I got a job if you want it. Pays pretty well. A job, you say? Well, let's see what this is about. There's a super rare car in a penthouse in Los Santos. I don't know where it is, but my friend does. Only problem, he's in prison. Break him out, get the location, go to the place, grab the car, and bring it back to me. It's gonna make us all rich, I promise. Okay, then. Here goes nothing. We're flying in. Now, let's see. Where's this prisoner? I don't see many prisoners on the yard, Lamar. Hey, Lamar, are you sure he's here? I'm positive. Check inside if you have to. Really, Lamar? I got... Oh, boy. I wasn't told. I gotta go inside. All right, we better do this quickly. We better do this really quickly. All right, I'm just gonna go for the basketball court. Oh, no, the police helicopters have already arrived. Come on, guys, give me a break. Nice, I'm in. It mustn't be yard time. There's no prisoners out here. I don't see a single person. So let's go inside and find him. Hey, come on, officers, leave me alone. I'm just here to rescue a friend. Um, hello, excuse me. I'm looking for someone who's friends with Lamar. Does anyone know Lamar? That would be me, my friend. Uh, wait, who said that? Was it down here? Behind you, you idiots. Behind me? Hang on a second. You? Are you 
you sure? You? Okay, right. You're the guy who's friends with Lamar, right? Listen, I haven't really got along. I got some officers in here, and I I'm creating quite a panic. Hey, mister, you're definitely the guy who's friends with Lamar. Yes, and I know where this car is and the penthouse. Oh, fantastic. He is the guy. All right, follow me. I'm getting you out of here. Easy peasy. Uh-oh. Okay, there's quite a few guards out here. <laughs> I think they were waiting for me to come out. Hey, guys, I'm over here, guys. Come on. <laughs> All right, just the helicopter. Go, 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 Franklin. I've only got four stars right now. How have we not got five stars, dude? I have just rescued a prisoner from the prison. So, I need to know where this location is. Where is it? It's in Los Santos. Follow my directions and lose the police, okay? Oh, yeah, that probably is a good idea. All right, hold on, buddy. We're gonna go extra high. Wow, I didn't think helicopters could go this high, but I'm pretty high in the sky. Stay up here and we'll be A-OK. -okay. The police are already losing us. This is the penthouse. Inside is a super red car. Thanks, man. You're a legend. Right, let's land this on the helipad. I think that's a helipad on top. <laughs> I really hope it's not a glass ceiling. Careful, careful. We're gonna act official here, like we're on actual business with these guys. And perfect landing. All right, nice. I'm on the helipad. All right, let's go and find this car. Whoa, this is a really nice penthouse. I mean, check out these views. <laughs> I had no idea this place even existed up here. Wow, barbecues. Look at this table. I can see everything from up here. Like, check it out. There's the highway. Hang on a second. I, I gotta do something funny. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, oh, yo. I actually made that guy almost crash. And bam. Check this out. Check this out. Bam. <laughs> okay, maybe we shouldn't be doing that. Let's go inside the penthouse and find this ride. Whoa, they have a massive kitchen. This is so amazing. And look at those views. Oh, my days. There's a telescope to look down at everything. This is a full 360 panoramic view penthouse. Wow. TV area, neon lights around the TV. This is every gamer's dream. I'm not even kidding. This must be the lounge area, but where is the garage? We're trying to find these cars, remember? But check this out, guys. Outside is a swimming pool. Oh, my days. It, like, goes around the corner. That is so awesome. And there's even seats inside the pool. No way. And a TV. And there's even a cool middle swimming over here. What? I love secret swimming spots. That's awesome. Awesome. So this is a bathroom with an awesome shower. All right, this is one of the bedrooms, but where's the garage? That's why I need to know. Where's the garage? Ah, I found the master bedroom. Look at that, guys. Giant king-size bed, lovely views, office space, a place to get ready, get changed, etc. And through this sliding door must be the bathroom. Whoa. <laughs> I really want to get this place now. If, if job hadn't have been taken, maybe I would have found this $10 million and just bought this place. But I found the elevator, so the garage must be down here. No. No way! I found the garage and this place is insane! And this must be the rare car he was talking about. <laughs> this is insane! Alright, let's see what kind of ride this is. I love the green trims around the outside. This is an SSC2 Atari. One of the fastest brands in the entire universe! Jump in, buddy. I got the ride and let's take this thing back to Lamar. Oh my days. I can't believe I'm riding this thing! And I love how this is designed. The doors have tiny windows and then there's a big window above you stretching around to the other side. Two seats, beautiful Beautiful, amazing engine. I've never seen an engine like that. <laughs> All right, let's get this thing out of the garage. All right, be careful. Yeah, just crash this thing within 10 seconds. Why don't you, Franklin? Oh, my days. All right, the acceleration is insane. I just love that engine. I've never seen an engine which looks like that. That's so new. It's pretty fast. It sounds like a race car. And oh, my days, I'm having so much fun driving this thing. Like, so much fun. I wonder how much money this goes for. Because Lamar told me it would make us both rich once we have this right. And I've never seen this before, so I have a feeling it doesn't actually exist yet. This must be a complete prototype. And let me tell you guys, it is insane. <laughs> hey, Lamar, check it out. I got your ride. Your friend's safe and sound. He's gone home and I have the car of your dreams. <laughs> How much is this worth, Lamar? Well, between me and you, I won't tell you the exact price, but you're getting paid five million bucks. Thanks, buddy. Five million dollars just for this? That means I'm only two million dollars away. Lamar, you're a legend. Thank you so much. Do you have any other jobs I can do? I really need to make two million dollars to pay off my debt so I can go to Russia and get my dog back. What do you mean? Who took Chop this time? You haven't heard? Well, someone took Chop and I really want to get him back. So please, can you help me out? Sorry, bro. I don't know anyone who's giving Chops around. Uh, try someone else. Whatever. It was worth a shot anyway. Well, there's your car, Lamar. Enjoy. Maybe I can find luck else. Where? With Lester? Are you kidding me? Hey, Lester, what do you want? What's up? 
fancy a job? Well, okay, well, let's go and see what Lester wants me to do then. I'm in some trouble with the police force. I need you to burn their station to the ground. I didn't realize you wanted me to do that, Lester. That sounds a bit crazy, don't you think? Don't think we got a choice right now. If I want to get shot back, we got to burn this place to the ground. Hey, guys, what do you reckon Lester did? Do you reckon it's going to be bad? You know what, guys? I'm not going to ask any questions. I'm just going to set this place on fire and burn it down. Do -do -do, do -do 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 -do. All right, just pour some gasoline. You guys, don't worry about this. This is standard procedure. Just going to do a standard fire drill. <laughs> you know, the usual stuff. I can't believe I'm doing this. Lester actually wants me to burn down the police station. This is the first time he's ever asked me to do something as crazy as this. Oh, hang on a second. The captain's office. There's got to be tons of papers in here. Why is no one in the police station right now? Like, that's kind of odd, don't you think? That's the captain's office. Let's just burn down these bookshelves, too. All right, the cabinets. Oh, hang on a second. I forgot one more room. There is a room over here. Of course, got to lead the trail of fire to the cell's briefing area. And let's just go through here and burn this room down, too. All right, perfect. This looks good to me. Okay, Franklin, you know the drill. Let's set this on fire. Burn down the station. And you know what, Franklin? We're just going to throw some Molotovs as well, just, just for added effects. All right, nice. Nice, nice. Oh, boy. I should have probably done this next to the door. Hot, hot. Ow, 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 ow. Lester, Lester, I'm going <laughs> to... Oh, jeez. All right, nice. Burn this down. Good, good, good. And burn that. Oh, my days. This is crazy. This is actually insane. This is insane, dude. Oh, boy. Right, that's the police station burning down. And wait a second. I forgot some cars, too. Oh, wait, officer. Sorry, just got to burn down. Oh, my days. <laughs> Quick, get the officers too! I can't believe I'm doing this. That car as well. The entire station's gotta be burnt down! Oh my days. I have actually done that. <laughs> All right. We better steal a police car. Don't worry, guys. I'm an expert at losing the cops. Just grab a police car and let's get moving, Franklin. Yo, I gotta take one more look at that police station. Is it really burning down? Have I really done it? <laughs> It's burning down. <laughs> oh, boy. Keep your eyes on the road, Franklin. Eyes on the road, buddy. I can't believe I've done that. That's got to pay me a lot of money. I mean, I burned the police station down. Suspect moving west through Los Santos in a police car. Wait a second. They're, they're talking through the radio. Uh, hang on a second, guys. I know exactly what to do. Suspect is leaving east, heading to Sandy Shores. Copy that. Copy that. All units, Sandy Shores. Perfect. Now, if I can just hide this police car, let's take it down this alleyway onto this road and then maybe park it in this car park. Oh, yeah. That's a fantastic plan. They'll never find me in here. <laughs> We've lost the suspect. I repeat, lost the suspect. Yes, they've lost me. Amazing. Lester, it's done. The police station is burned to the ground. Thanks, Franklin. I know I can count on you. I got paid $1 million for doing that job, which means I'm only $1 million away from getting this $10 million debt paid off. I've worked for Simeon, Lester, and Lamar, and even the guy who I'm paying the debt to. But the question is, who's going to offer me one more million dollars? I've come this far, and I need to get this $10 million debt paid so I can get job and not die at the end of the day. Now, let's see. How are we going to make this money, Franklin? Treasure? Maybe we can win the lottery? Who knows? Trevor? Well, that's not one way I thought I would make the money back. Hey, Trevor, what do you want? I need you to meet me. You're all I can trust. Oh, okay. All right, looks like we're meeting Trevor then. Let's go and see what he wants. I'm the only one he can trust? This must be bad. The scientist stole my chicken. Get me my chicken. Really, Trevor? Really? Okay, I'll get the chicken back. What's this car for? You gonna need it. Trust me. All right. This sounds kind of fun. <laughs> Trevor wants his chicken back and he's gonna pay me a million bucks for it. Okay, let's go into the labs, get this chicken and uh, yeah, just, just roll out of here, I suppose. Is that how we're gonna do it? All right, guys, I just need Trevor's chicken. All right, so all oh my days, I got four stars. Are you crazy? Well, now I know why I need this ride. Right, let's take this inside the garage and let's find this chicken. Cryogenics. Hang on a second. Are they freezing things in here? If I find out they've frozen Trevor's chicken, let's just keep our fingers crossed the chicken's alive. For the sake of my Hey, hey, chicky, chicky, chicken. Hey, chicky, 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 chicken. I just need to get this chicken. Wait a second. I got the chicken. Amazing. You weren't even too far in. So you're inside a locked cage. Not too bad. I, I think I can get you out of here. Case number 103. All right, here goes nothing. And da. All right, we're getting you out of here, chicken. Don't worry. Follow me. This is the weirdest job I've done. I've got the chicken now. Oh, my days. You really got to go that slow? Bro, I know it says slow on here, but you don't need to take it literally. We're going to be fine. We're just going to get out of here. All right. You still following me? Where's the Oh, my days. The chicken won't even be able to get through the door. Can you get through the door? No, no, there's no way. Oh, boy. It's trying. It's trying its hardest, dude. All right, come on. Come on. Come through the door. Come on. Come on, chicken. Come on. Come on, chicken. Oh, are you serious? Yes. 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 The chicken made it through. All right, nice. Let's go. This is the most tedious task I've ever had to do. All right, come on, Franklin. Run. Get in that car and drive. We've got four stars. Come on, chicken. We're gonna go. What are you doing? Oh, yes. He's running. He's running. Amazing. <laughs> Here we go. Just get in the car. Yeah, get in the car, please. Come on. 
This is so horrible to watch. Okay, you can stay down there, chicken. I'm gonna get you out of here, all right? Now, whatever you do, don't jump out of the vehicle, okay? This is gonna be dangerous. <laughs> I can't believe I got a chicken in here, dude. The things I do for Trevor. All right, here we go. I got a chicken in here. No one screw with me, okay? Nobody screw with me. I got four stars. All right, this is fast. This is seriously fast. This is super duper fast. Okay, here goes nothing. Trevor, I got your chicken. I'm just gonna lose this once level, all right? All right, chicken, keep your wings inside the vehicle. You might lose some feathers otherwise. <laughs> All right, nice. Take it around here. Oh, that was so close, dude. I don't want to hurt this chicken. I really don't want to hurt the chicken. All right, here we go. Get to the train track, Franklin. Get to the train track. We'll lose the police on this. All right, in the event of a train, we're going to have to swerve very swiftly. Careful now. Don't destroy this car on the bridge. All right, how you doing down there, chicken? <gasps> nice, nice. Good. I'm glad the chicken's doing well. <laughs> I'm losing the one to level. I'm on the train track. This car is doing me proud. Seriously proud. Oh, my days. The police are on the train track now. How did you get on here? I didn't realize that was possible. Looks like we got some more swerving to do then. Oh my days, they're going over the jumps too. They're gonna jump on the track. If we're not careful, they're gonna land on this vehicle and crush both me and the chicken. Hey guys, give me a break, okay? I just wanted to get Trevor's chicken back. That's all I wanted to do. All right, looks like we've got to do some off-roading now. I got no choice. We're taking this thing up the hill. Yes, I found a hidden lake. Hide between these trees, Franklin. Hide between the trees. Oh, just amazing. We've made it. Chicken, don't worry. We're gonna be fine. I've lost the one to level. All right, let's return you to Trevor. Trevor, I got your chicken. He's safe and sound. No, oh, don't worry about it, Trevor. I'm glad to have reunited you both. Now you don't have to worry about those eggs in the morning. Thank you. Here's your million bucks. Now I've made $10 million. Pay off my debts and finally go to Russia. Hey, mister, I got your money back. I couldn't retrieve the vehicles, but at least I got you your 10 million bucks. So, uh, here's your money. Are we even now? Yes, my friend, we are even. Thank you very much. Oh, and here's a ticket to Russia. Sorry about your flight. You know, I, I needed my money back. Oh, wow. He actually bought the ticket for me. Thanks, man. All right, looks like we're on good terms. Let's go to Russia and get my dog back. This is your pilot speaking. Buckle in. We're taking off to Russia. Yes, yes, we're on the way to Russia. <laughs> bye bye, Los Santos. Next time we see land again, it's gonna be Russia. What are we even gonna see? Ladies and gentlemen, we have landed in Russia. No way. I've landed in Russia? Whoa, this place is huge. I wonder what that thing is over there. Right, let's go and find Chop. This place is uh way bigger than I thought it was gonna be. And Chop somewhere here? Well, there were some clues in the photo, so maybe we can go exploring and find where Chop is. So maybe we can do some exploring and find his location. Uh, there's a town over here. Uh, maybe he's in this town. Who knows? It would make sense. I mean, this is kind of close to the airport. Hmm, that looks like a massive concrete building, actually. Maybe he could be in here. I have no idea what this is. Some sort of town hall? Okay, maybe this isn't as concrete as I thought it was. This just looks like an ordinary neighborhood. Well, in that case, I don't think Chop's gonna be over here. Here, guys. I wish the weather would brighten up a little bit. It, it's so foggy. <laughs> guys, I, I haven't seen the sound at all since being here. But I found a Lamborghini. I'm pretty happy with this. <laughs> so quiet and empty. This is so weird, dude. I've never been in Russia before. This is insane. I don't even know where in Russia I am. Like, this could be anywhere. It's such a big place. Here we go. More towers, more buildings, lots of concrete. I don't think Chop's here, guys. I got a feeling about this. This is just residential as well. If he was here, we would know. And people would know too. But Look at all of these apartment blocks. There's so many of them. This is insane. They go on forever and ever and ever. Like, look at this. They just keep going on. And there's a tiny house in the middle of nowhere. Speaking of which, what's over here? Over these hills? Wait a second. I got an idea, guys. I, I completely forgot. Chop's tracker. Ah, here we go. I know exactly where he is. He's over here. Okay, if we follow the tracker, I'll find Chop immediately. This is where the track is pointing me to. It doesn't look like a nice place, guys. Seriously? Why would he be here? The doesn't make sense. Is this a prison or a military camp? Like, I have no idea. Let's just climb this tower. This is the top. I got all these lookout points. Check this out, dude. This is insane. No way. All right. I have a feeling Chop's in there somewhere. So let's take a look, Franklin. And don't screw this up. Oh, my days. All right. I don't know where I am, guys. I, I think this building's abandoned. But this looks exactly like the place I saw in the photo. Chop, it's me. I'm coming to rescue you, buddy. Don't worry. It's me. I can hear him. He's in this room. I can hear him. Chop, don't worry, buddy. I'm coming to save you. Okay. Okay. Here we go. <laughs> 
Chop, chop. Oh no, guys, I think he's even further down. I can hear him, though. I can hear him. Chop, I'm coming to save you, buddy. Don't worry. Oh, there they are. Get them, get them, get them. Nice. Chop, don't worry, buddy. I've got you. You're safe and sound with me. Come on, we're getting out of here. Whichever way out is, I have no idea what this place was used for, but it's definitely abandoned now. Come on, Chop, get in my car. I'm getting you out of here, and we're going back home. Boy, am I glad to be back home. I've rescued Chop. We've been to Russia, and everything seems to be okay. I thought it was a good idea to jump the military base in my new car, but I wasn't going fast enough, and I crashed into all of their planes. The military showed up, arrested me, took Chop away, and threw me in jail in a submarine in the middle of the ocean, and there's nothing I can do about it. This cell is tiny, and it only comes with two beds and a sink and a horrible-looking toilet down there. There is nothing I can use to get out of this prison, and even if there was, this guy would be on it straight away. Get ready for prison! Yeah, I really don't like the sound of that. These guys are sending me somewhere horrible. I wonder which country I'm going to. Hey, can I get that information at least? No chance. You're going to hate it. But there's something you can do, actually, which will get me out of this mess. All you gotta do is subscribe to my channel, because when 10 of you guys do, Franklin gets out of jail, and we can carry on with our life and get shot back. So please, what are you waiting for? Find the subscribe button. It's around the video somewhere. Yes, one person did. Thanks. You're the first. And, and, and another person. Oh my days. It's going down. <laughs> hey, mister. Looks like I am getting out of jail. Tap to escape. Let's do this. Phew. I'm glad to be out of that mess. Thanks, guys. You really saved me there. But you know who else isn't saved? Chop. The military took him, remember? Let's find out where he is. I have my trusty chop tracker. It lets me find out where he is at all times. And he is in the middle of Sandy Shores. What are you doing there? Wow. What is he doing here? Yeah, it's a really nice house. Sounds like somebody is having a party and they didn't invite Franklin. Well, this is perfect because I'll be able to go inside and no one will think I'm out of place. Then I'll get chop and be out of here. You know, just as, oh my goodness, dude, this is an awesome party. Look at these guys. Is it going on down there as well? It is. Wow, this is insane. So has anyone seen chop? Oh, man, no one can hear me. The music's too loud. Come on. Right, chop is in this house somewhere. We've got to find him, Franklin, before it's too late. Duh. Uh, no, I've lost him to the party again. This always happens. Concentrate, Franklin. Concentrate. Well, I'm glad you got that out of your system, Franklin. Now, let's go and find Chop. Excuse me, ma'am. Just coming through. <laughs> Don't want to interrupt the party. Oh, I'm glad to be out of that. I mean, the music was so loud, I could barely even hear my thoughts. All right, where could Chop be? What's through this door, actually? Oh, my days. Wait a second. He's got even more cars in here? Who owns this house? This is insane. That's a luxury super yacht. This must belong to the person who owns this house. I mean, it has to. Whoever lives here has a lot of money, but that doesn't explain why Chop's here. I mean, the military took him. I thought he was getting arrested. Not sent to some really rich guy's house. Maybe we'll have better luck upstairs. Where could he be? Oh, come on, dude. Chop, talk to me. Where are you, man? I'm coming to get you. I need to get you out of here. I can hear him. He's barking from that room. He's in that room. Amazing. Come on, Franklin. Let's open up the... Door. Whoa. Oh, hey, fellas. I really didn't mean to intrude. I'm just here to get Chop back. Y you know my dog? You mean our dog? No, he's definitely mine. His name is Chop, and for some reason he's in your house. Now, I'm just gonna go and get him, and you guys can leave me alone. I'll be out of it. Oh, jeez. They're gonna shoot me. Oh, they really don't want me in here. Oh, that was so stressful. I don't know who they are, but they do not want me in their house. This is really strange. I need some answers, and I can't believe the party's still going on down here. I almost died upstairs. Who even are these guys? If I want to get shot back, I can't go through the front door, but there's a balcony which goes around the entire house. If I can get on that balcony, I'll be able to get shot and we'll be on our way out of here. In fact, I think I know exactly how I'm going to do this. If I climb on that wall, I'll be able to climb on the balcony. Come on, Franklin, and don't waste any more time. Eh, seems a little bit too high to me. Oh, no, we can! <laughs> well done, Franklin. That was pretty good of you. Steady. We gotta find shop. I think he was in in this room too. No way. He is in there. No way. What is he doing in the shower? He's taking a shower? Right. I gotta find a way inside. Oh my days. The guards are still there. Quick, Franklin. Run, run, run. Did they see me? I really hope they didn't see me. Right. Let's go and get him back. No. Stop. Yes. Hello, is that? Oh, no, they found me. They must have seen me go past the window. I'm sure we can work something out. You know, me, uh, I'm a reasonable guy. Maybe we can pay for Chop. How much have we got? Zero dollars? Why do you have no money, Franklin? Where did that go? Oh, no, they must have taken it when they arrested me. Hey, guys, I'll do anything for Chop. And it... Ow! Oh, jeez, come on, you didn't need to do that. Grab his legs. Let's take him to the boss. Oh, the boss? This isn't good at all. If Chop knew what was going on, he'd be all over them. What are you doing in my house? In your house? 
Oh, man, I'm really sorry. I, I just came to get shot. Ain't that right, boy? Come on. Don't you mean Ted? That's my dog. Can I shoot him, boss? I really want to. Not yet. What kind of guy are you? So this guy's the boss, clearly, and he's given Chop another name. I mean, <clears throat> Ted? Bro, come on. Chop's a way better name. I'm the richest man. And Ted deserves the best. I totally agree. He deserves the absolute best. But being the richest man doesn't necessarily guarantee that, you know? I mean, look at those parties. I know he is not a fan of those. How about this? Come back when you have an octillion dollars. Then you'll be richer than me. And you can have your stinky dog. Oh, jeez. We better get out of here. Chop, I'll be back. I'll be back, boy. Don't worry. Right. I can't exactly go back to that house. Or else we are going to die. But I have to find a way to make an octillion dollars. And there must be something we can do. Hang on a second. Is that police sirens I can hear? Uh, what? That's a lot of police sirens. Franklin! Franklin! Hey, Franklin! What's that racket? Is somebody calling my name? Whoa, 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 wait a second. Lester? What, is that you? Oh, jeez, he wants me to get in. Hey, Lester, stop, stop, I'm getting in, I'm getting in, okay? He said, ow, Lester, what are you doing? I'm getting in the car. Whoa, oh, that's a lamppost, that's, that's a lamppost. Are you sure you can drive this thing? Positive, I'm just losing the police. Oh, yeah, I can definitely tell that. Going around in circles is not gonna lose the police, Lester. You have to make this go away. Uh, oh, all right, okay, all right, Lester. Uh, so how am I gonna make this go away and... <laughs> I could do with some money for doing this, remember? Take out the chief of police and destroy the data center. I'll pay you well, trust me. The chief of police? Hey, that's uh, that's kind of a big job, Lester. How big are you going to pay me? Really big. You're going to be richer than anyone else in this world. Well, I do like the sound of that. Once I do this job, I'll be able to get shot back, maybe even buy his house, and become the richest man in GTA 5. Sounds ideal to me. All right, Lester, count me in. You got yourself a deal. Hey, 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 hey no need to throw me out of the car. Good luck. Bye. Oh, he's got no respect for me. There's police officers guarding the door, officers guarding inside, and the chief of police is in another room inside the police station, completely blocked away. Getting inside is not going to be easy. And even if we do take out the chief of police, we probably won't survive. At least to do the second part of the job, wipe the data center. But wait a minute, guys. I think I've got a plan. Let me take a look down there for a second. I was right. There's some guards on the roof, and it looks like they're preparing for something. The chief of police, if I had to make a guess, is gonna come up to the helicopter any moment now. And when he does, I'm gonna take my chance and get him. Wait a second, there he is. He's on his way to the helicopter. And three, two, one, da! Nice, we got him! Quick, hide, Franklin, hide, hide, hide. They can't see us, they can't see us! They have no idea where that came from. Nice one, Les is gonna be so proud of us. Let's go and tear down that data center. No way, it must be a code red in there. I can hear so many sirens going off, and they still have no idea who did it. Now, I know exactly how to get to the data center. All I gotta do is walk around here, fingers crossed that no one spots me, and three, two, one. Nice, Franklin. Let's go through this door, and we're in! Okay, well, this is gonna be super easy. Hey, buddy, sorry. <laughs> and I think that's everyone down. So Lester wanted me to destroy the data center. And to do that, I think we just gotta destroy, like, you know, these computers. So, like, these things down there, and these computers here. Oh, this is gonna be fantastic. They're gonna lose everything. They won't know who's most wanted. They won't know who's good. They won't know who's bad. The entire city is gonna go into chaos. Lester must have done some pretty bad stuff if he wanted to resort to this. Let's just make sure, you know, this is definitely not coming back up. A few grenades here and there. This is amazing. I am gonna completely demolishing the police right now. Phew, I'll leave them to get out of this mess. No police cars. They're all on high alert. They must have spread across Los Santos looking at every lead they have. <laughs> oh man, it's been a bad day for them. Anyway, Lester on the other hand it's been a great day for him. Phew, 70 flights of stairs and I finally made it. Lester, remember the deal you mentioned? How I would become the richest man? Let me catch my breath for a second. Franklin is exhausted. This is the last time you tell me to climb up the top of a building. There was an elephant Elevator, you know. Wait, was really? <sighs> Good. You know what? Just give me the money, Lester. A deal's a deal. I did exactly what you wanted me to do. Now make me the richest man. What am I gonna do with these? These are just some keys. You promised me money. Take them to the bank. Trust me. <sighs> well, I'm trusting Lester. I know where to find him if he's wrong, though. Let's take these keys to the bank. I wonder what they open. Yes, yes, you. Uh, I got some keys. I was told this would open something up. Right this way, sir. Hey, uh, I think the gate's locked. Can you open this up for me, please? Unless... Oh, no way. That's good. That's good. I I'm through. The keys open the gate. Seriously? Just give me a few seconds and a bam. The vault is yours. Hey, what kind of keys are these? Why, they're the keys to the city. The keys to the city? That's incredible. 
cool. So, wait a second. Third key on here. Oh, my days. And... <gasps> There is so much gold, and I got one key left. All right, let's open this last door. Wow, there is so much gold in here. With this much gold, I will easily become the richest man in GTA 5 and get shot back. Now, let's do some counting. It's gonna take a while, but I'm sure we'll get there eventually. <sighs> Guys, you won't believe this. I've done some counting, and I counted twice, and then another time, and now it's almost night time. But I only have 500 septillion dollars. I'm halfway there. <laughs> man, what does Michael want now? Yo, yo. Yo, 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 yo! Hear me out. Wanna kidnap the president? President? Are you sure that's a good idea? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> trust me, trust me, bro. We're gonna make so much money. Oh, well, I didn't even get to... Okay, looks like we're kidnapping the president then. Oh, that doesn't sound good. This could end really well or really badly. But whatever we do, we can't take him out. We gotta keep him alive, remember, Franklin. Okay, there's the president. There's Michael somewhere down there ready to pounce on him when I do cause a distraction. Okay, there's a few snipers up top. Okay, three, four different snipers. Let's get them first. One down, and there goes the other guy. There's the other one, and there's the last guy. And no one noticed. Perfect. All right, four snipers down. No one's covering behind him. That means we're almost good to go. Now let's get his bodyguard. Three, two, one. Ah! Oh my days. Okay, now they're running. Now they're running. Go, Michael, go! Yes, he's chasing them. He's chasing them. <laughs> go, Michael! Right, I need to catch him. We need to get him before he escapes. There's his helicopter. Quick, Franklin, get to the helicopter before he does. Oh no, his guards have found me. And the police are coming after me. This is insane, dude. They got FIB officers, the entire SWAT team. This is so crazy. Right, that's it. Say hello to the big boy. <laughs> Where's the president? Where is he? Where is he? Jeez, there's so many officers. So many of them. All I want is the president. Give him to me and you're gonna be fine. Yes, Michael. Great job. You got him. Hey, Mr. President. How about we go for a quick ride, shall we? Come on, get him in, Michael. Get him in. Nice. Come on, buddy. Easy peasy now. You're gonna be fine. I promise. All right, come on, Michael. You too. I need to make sure I'm protected. All right, so he's not gonna be trying any funny business. Look at those eyes, dude. <laughs> he does not trust us at all. Hey, buddy, I promise. We're just gonna get some money. Bada bing, bada boom, and you'll be on your way. I promise. And this is where you'll be staying today. And maybe this week and maybe this month. Uh, I'm not gonna make any promises. Gently does it and we're on. All right, come on, Mr. President. Oh, sorry. When I said safe, I actually meant somewhere you couldn't escape. <laughs> I've successfully kidnapped the president and this is an entire fortress. There is only one way in through those double doors and I have the best security system ever. Michael kitted this place out so if anyone tries to go through this wall, they're dead. Yeah, I wouldn't wanna be them. There is no way that president's gonna be rescued in here. Not with out a hefty ransom. Speaking of which, we're already getting our phone call from the police. What do you want? Well, 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 if it isn't good old police from Los Santos. Oh, sorry, yeah, the president, of course. You want him? Well, listen, I got very tight demands. I need you to meet them. If you don't, we, got, we ain't got a deal, okay? Just tell me what you want. All right, man of no words. Okay, well, this is what I want. Listen carefully. If you got a pen and paper, I'm gonna say it now. And I'm only gonna say it once. I would like an octillion dollars, a teddy bear, not one of those rabbits. I want a teddy bear with the actual bear mouth, you know, short arms, short legs, really fluffy, and... A McDonald's cheeseburger with seven pickles. They always don't give me enough pickles. I, I tell them so many times. <sighs> we can do that, except for the cheeseburger. No deal. Well, Michael, if they gave us the money, they would give us the teddy bear, but not the cheeseburger. So, so I told them no deal. Maybe that was an unwise decision. I mean, they did give me the money after all. Oh, man, I really get caught up on food. It takes over my mind. You did what? Bro, we had a deal. Take the money. And call them again! Hey, 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 Michael, I, I, I can't, okay? It was an unknown number. I, 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 I physically couldn't call them back if I tried. Hey, 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 they're calling me. They're calling me. Michael, they're calling me. Okay, I'll, I'll go back on the cheeseburger. Deal! You got a deal! Check outside! Oh, well, 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 looks like we got a deal! <laughs> Hey, Mike, you'll be pleased to know we got a deal. They left everything we need outside. Oh, they did just drop something from the sky. Did you hear that? I got it. I know what I'm doing, okay? All right, Michael, I'll get out of your way then. I'll just chill here and wait for you to bring it in. Good luck, Michael. G Michael? Michael? Oh, that seemed pretty suspicious to me. Why is he phoning me again? Jeez. I'm asking you the same. Where's the president? We gave you the money. Where's the pr president? I'll give you the president when my friend Michael comes back. I don't know what your friend is. Are you, are you sure he's like not right off without the money? No, I'm pretty 
Let me check. Maybe he has run off with the money. Maybe he was just trying to screw with me a little bit. Make me believe he's actually being killed. Come on, Franklin. Let's get to somewhere high up. Ah, uh, this ought to do. I'll be able to look straight over outside. Okay, Michael, where is... Could have run off, I suppose. Oh, whoa! Jeez, someone's trying to shoot me! Right, he's definitely, he's definitely not run off. Someone is out there and they're trying to shoot me, dude. This is not good. I'm hiding on one of the rooftops and I really want to see where these guys are. It looks clear to me, but let's get a closer look. Use those binoculars, Franklin. They're in the bushes. I found someone and another guy. Right, that's it. We're taking them out. Three, two, one, get them! Okay, we get these guys and then I'll grab the cash. Yes. All right, nice one, Franklin. I got three of them down already. There's more of them over there too. Right, that's it. I'm jumping straight down. I ju oh boy! Ugh, maybe we should have climbed down instead, Franklin. Show yourself, guys. Show yourself. This is so risky. I am putting myself straight out there, guys. There's the money. It's in the crate. There's a car there. If I can get the crate in the car, I'm gonna fly out of here and we'll have the money. Michael, oh my days. I'm so sorry. Right, that's it. I'm getting the cash. Get it on the car, Franklin. Now! I can't believe this. I lost Michael, but I got the money and the president is still in that cage. Maybe they'll go and rescue him instead of worry about me. Oh, jeez, they sent so many people out. I didn't think they knew where we were, but they sent everyone out. Not good. Not good at all. I thought we were so hidden away. Oh, man, there's more police officers. Stop, guys. Stop it. Come on, let me go. Jeez, they really do on me on that flight. They made a roadblock over here. But there it is. There it is in all its glory. All I gotta do is drive on board and get out of here. Come on, go, 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 go. Quick, frankly, go. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yo, the military have shown up. That's the aircraft carrier. I wonder why they had so many people on that island. They really really knew where I was. They were just calling my bluff. Well, look who called it. I got the money. <laughs> and now we're gonna be so rich. I'll be able to buy the house and get chopped back. See you later, suckers. Free at last. Sandy Shores, am I glad to see you? All right, let's land this plane and count the money. If they stay true to their words, I will have an octillion dollars in the bag of this plane. Only 400 septillion? Oh, man, we got ripped off. That's the last time I trust them, but we're 90% of the way there. I just gotta make 100 septillion dollars, and Franklin here will become the richest man in GTA 5. There's money on there. Lots of money, bro! Yo, Oh, Lamar, this is crazy. How do you come across this? It's an entire cargo boat, and it looks like somebody's hijacked it. Really impressive stuff, Lamar. Have you found anything? Lots of money. Money, money, money. Okay, all right, Lamar. All right, let's go and take a look. How much money have you got? Jeez, he's excited. Oh, wow, I know exactly why. Look at all that cash. Right, I'm just gonna take out these guys, and then we'll get the money. Three, two, one. Oh, oh, oh they know something's up. <laughs> right, show yourself, guys. Show yourself. I don't want to cause an explosion, because the last Last thing I want to do is burn the money. Bam! <laughs> right, I think that's all of them. Let's go and get the cash. Right, let's get out of here. I got the cash in the back and no one knows we stole it. No one did. This is epic. Me and Lamar on the road again with more cash than you can imagine in the back of this truck. It's actually weighing it down a little bit. Like the suspension is really low. Let me think about it, guys. A million dollar bills. That's got to be kind of heavy. It's all paper. Hey, hey, Lamar, you're getting a bit close there. You're getting a little bit close there, buddy. You're, you're going to crash into me. Right, that's it. I'm stopping. I'm Lamar, Lamar. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's a little bit excited as well. So what's inside this truck is mine. What's inside the other truck is Lamar's. He's already gone. Fantastic. No more screw-ups. Right, what have we got in here? 99 septillion. Wait a minute. No, no. I'm one septillion away. Oh, great. Now si Simeon wants me. Oh, fantastic. Hey, 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 Simeon, what's up? One job pays big. You in? Yes, Simeon, I'm in. This better pay more than a septillion dollars. Oh, man, he could have told me the job beforehand. I gotta go in to the military base and collect a car for Simeon. Oh, right, don't screw this up, Franklin. This is the final thing we gotta do. Oh, no, I got four stars. Oh, jeez, there's tanks in front of me. Drive, Franklin. Oh, this is insane. Right, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. I know exactly what I'm doing. I know where this car is. Oh, wow, this really is a full circle. This is where I crashed my car first time around. Yes, I found it. There it is, dude. I collected this for Simeon the other day. Wow, he really loses this car in the weirdest of places. Now, how am I gonna get out of here in one piece without exploding this car? There's tanks all over the place. Place. And if they get one shot on this, then it's bye-bye to Simeon's beloved car. I got an idea. I'm taking this through the entrance. Oh, boy. Okay. Okay. There's just a tank there, but that's all right. Everything's fine. Everything's ever Everything's okay. <laughs> oh, boy. Nice. And we're out of the military base. Oh, my goodness. Boy, am I glad to be out of there. That was so stressful, dude. I am not going back to the military base again. 
Once we shake off this wanted level, I'll be home sweet home. Come on, Franklin, let's go. This better be the car he wanted. If it's not, he's got no choice. And, uh, I think I got your car, right? This is the one you ordered. That's the one. It's gold, okay? Why, yes, Simeon. Gold is fantastic, actually. I'll be able to melt that down into anything I want. Thanks, I guess. So I just made, like, five septillion from Simeon, which gives me more than one octillion dollars. Guys, I finally done it. Franklin has gone from zero dollars to an octillionaire in GTA 5. But we're not done yet. Hey, quite the entrance. I see you got all of your friends out here. Hey, Chop, good to see you again. You enjoyed this life? Well, guess what, buddy? This life is never gonna end because I am an octillionaire. Screw you! <laughs> hey, guys, before you try anything funny, I'm gonna buy this house. How about you work for me? How much you paying? More than that guy. I don't know what he was paying you, but <laughs> I'm gonna pay you more. Hey, amazing! One big happy family. Apart from that guy, of course. He was way too arrogant. Hey, Chop, so good to see you again. I can't believe we went through all of that. I mean, all because I crashed into the military base. Hey, come on, let's go and enjoy this party. These guys are still dancing, and I want to join in. And now we are gonna dance the night away. Today Hey, I'm upgrading the slowest to the fastest car in GTA 5. Make sure you watch till the end because the last vehicle is literally insane. But first, let me show you guys the slowest car. It might not look uh, attractive and this did just come out of my garden shed, but voila. <laughs> you wanna know how fast this goes? I don't actually know, so let's find out. I'm gonna make a guess, like 10 mile an hour. Wait, wait a second. Yo, it's literally saying zero kilometers an hour. That is not possible. I'm moving. <laughs> how am I going at zero? That doesn't make sense. But don't worry, guys. We can upgrade this. All I gotta do is get into that portal, which might take a, a while. <laughs> Come on, Franklin, we can do this. What if I jump in this car? Do you reckon we can do that? Yoink. Oh, no, we can't jump. <laughs> This thing's too heavy. Uh, come on, it won't jump. Seriously. I don't know why it's this slow, but it's it's really, it's it's not the best car. Put it that way. Come on, just get to the portal, Franklin. We gotta upgrade this. Come on. This is so slow. So close. We've almost done it. Oh no, guys, I'm stuck. This is literally the worst car I've ever driven. <laughs> Franklin, come on, let's get this off the ledge. We just gotta upgrade this, dude. It's not that hard. A little bit further, Franklin. A little bit further. We just gotta get across that line. What are we gonna get next, dude? Please, make it much faster than this. This has been horrible. So, what do you guys think of my brand new vehicle? This is the second slowest in the world. It's Franklin's toilet, with some tires trapped on the bottom, of course. I think it still smells from earlier. I, I genuinely think they took this one from Franklin's house. <laughs> but the question is, will this do the loop? I don't think it's gonna do that, guys. I'm, I'm sorry to let you down, but we're already going seven kilometers an hour right now, which is an infinite improvement from the last vehicle, might I add, which couldn't even score one kilometers an hour. And wait a second, I got a helmet. Franklin, I hate to break this to you. I don't think we're gonna need a helmet, buddy. Not yet. We got some much faster vehicles to upgrade into. This is, this is slow, okay? If you fall off this, you're not gonna get hurt. As we upgrade the cars, let me know in the comments which one is your favorite. I wouldn't judge you if one of the cheap ones was. Wait a second, what if I add, ooh, guys, a cool idea. I've done a big brain play. I put a fire extinguisher on the back of this toilet. So when I start spraying, we're gonna go boosting. Let's do this, three, two, one, go! <laughs> This is awesome! No way, I'm actually going at like 79 kilometers an hour! Big brain play, ladies and gentlemen! Ow! Ow! Yeah, straight into the plane. Order, well Franklin. Hey, now I got the fire extinguisher. Do you reckon I can do this? Let's find out. Three, two, one. Go, 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 go! No! <laughs> completely. We're gonna need a faster vehicle than this. Even with a fire extinguisher on the back of it, it's not very good. Come on, Franklin. Let's give this one another upgrade. I want to get into some real fast vehicles. Like, what do you think the fastest vehicle is gonna look like? Let's hope the next one is not a toilet this time. Are you ready for the next upgrade? Please, make it like 20 kilometers an hour or at least something good. What are we gonna go? Oh, boy! Wait, hang on a second. Why am I flying? What is going on? What are we gonna get next? Please, just give me another vehicle. Oh, seriously? Another toilet? I can't believe I was given a portaloo. I mean, we went from toilet to like, you know, portaloo. So basically, this is an upgrade. What's up, guys? Welcome to my crib. 18 kilometers an hour this thing goes. This is my brand new vehicle. Yeah, what do you guys think? Oh, yeah. <laughs> my girlfriend's gonna love this. I got a toilet, steering wheel. There's my water on tap. I can even look through the door as well. No peeping, guys. Franklin might actually be going. <laughs> a vehicle like this is actually really handy. Not when you want to go fast. 
has, but if you want to go long distance, I mean, you can go when you need to go. Do you reckon we can cross the, the, the big loop over there? I mean, I got my doubts, but I want to find out. <laughs> Let's see. I love how there's like four different tires underneath this thing. They're working pretty hard. I don't think it can go faster even if I want it to. Oh, we're going with the door open this time. Frank, let's go at it like a boss. Yeah, I don't think we're going to do it, guys. I don't even think we're going to go up this, this little hill here. Like, that's going to be tricky. <laughs> no, don't flip. Come on. I almost flipped the portal. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> This is so scary. Do not flip this. There is so much stuff underneath Franklin. Okay, we do not. Oh my days, I'm doing a wheelie. Check it out. <laughs> now it's all good. Hey, I don't know about you, but these really slow vehicles are actually pretty cool. I'm going to miss them when I upgrade them again. All right, no more wheelies, Franklin. I do not want to mess in this. And I'm not cleaning you up, okay? <laughs> Believe me, he doesn't even own a shower. Let's just let's just take this to the portal and upgrade it again and see if we get something better. I mean, of course we will. It's going to be faster. But what are we going to get next? An actual car? Who knows? Will this be the first vehicle to actually make the jump? Let's find out, guys. Here we go. And go, 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 go. No way. No. <laughs> guys, I upgraded into a bath. This is so cool. This goes at 39 kilometers an hour, way faster than the other ones. And I'm sitting inside a bathtub. This is so crazy, dude. Speaking of showers, Franklin finally has one. That's awesome. I can take a shower in this. I can have a bath. I can keep driving. And there's a crazy engine on the back. Now it's time. I'm definitely going to make the loop the loop. Now, 39 kilometers an hour is the bath. Gonna be the first one to make it round. Let's find out. Three, two, one, go! Oh, come on. It's still not gonna do it. Well, that's still okay. Maybe the next one's gonna do it. I'm getting closer and closer and closer. Wait a minute, guys. I no kidding. I've actually turned the shower on. <laughs> Franklin is literally showering in this bath. That's amazing. Oh, no. The water's going away. Oh, my days. The more I, like, drive, it pushes the water back. That's, that, okay. That's kind of counterproductive. I got to stop to actually have a shower. <laughs> this is so amazing. But I want to upgrade this again. We're only going at 39 kilometers an hour. We can do better, guys. We can do better. I mean, a bath is cool, but we can do so much better. Imagine what the fastest vehicle is going to be like. If we're getting stuff like this, the fastest one's going to be, I don't know, I mean, maybe a washing machine. <laughs> this rate, guys, I have no idea. But this might make it across the jump this time. I have a good feeling about this. Three million times faster than the first vehicle. It's gonna do it. Wait a second. Subscribe to keep upgrading. Guys, you gotta subscribe to my channel to keep upgrading. Oh, man. Okay, that's an easy fix. It's not gonna let me upgrade these cars unless you guys subscribe to my channel. So if you haven't subscribed yet, press the button now, start subscribing, and maybe the next time I go around, we can actually upgrade this into another vehicle faster than this one. Let's find out. Here we go. I'm sure enough of you guys Subscribe. Upgrade! Oh, seriously? It's not upgrading! No, guys. Clearly not enough for you guys subscribed. If you haven't subscribed yet, I'm giving you a second chance to do it. If you don't, then we're not going to be able to upgrade any more of these cars. All right, let's try this again for the third time. Please, please, please. Yes! <laughs> we actually got something good! I got a car! No way! We actually got a car! Yes! Wait a second, though. This is a three-wheeler car. This seems really dangerous. Guys, I got the Reliant Robin, and... Look, just watch this. Just gonna take a corner. <laughs> And another corner. And I rolled it already, dude. Such a difficult car to drive. Come on. Well, at least it's fast. You know, it's faster than the others. I can tell you that, guys. We're going at uh, one second. Let me, let me just let me just go in a straight line. Okay, perfect. Let's just line up again. No, no. <laughs> Franklin, we just need to line up, okay? Just turn it, line it. No, jeez, this is so tricky. Nice. Okay, I've lined it up. And we're going at 59 kilometers an hour. I will take it, guys. That is a bad. This might be the first one to actually make this jump. All right, we might, we're not going to do the loop. I'm not gonna get my hopes up that much. I'm not crazy. We might just make... We're not making the jump. All right, that's cool. That's fine. We're not, oh my days, I flipped the car again. <laughs> I've driven vehicles before which have at least got some air on this. And they're slower than this. What if we try again? No, no, it's just not working, guys. <laughs> I feel it already again. <laughs> this is literally a death trap, but I love it. It's kind of fun. If you roll this down Mount Shiliad, you're not surviving. The person who invented this clearly just enjoyed fun cars. This is what I would call a fun car. That's my definition. Three wheels. You can't take a corner seriously. I want to upgrade this again and actually get a car with four wheels next time. Once I, you know, actually drive this properly. Okay, here we go. Nice. Nice. Do you reckon I can do a drift in this? Screw No, we can't. No, we can't. We definitely can't do that. All right, what do you reckon we're going to get next time? If we're lucky, we might just cross the 100 kilometers an hour zone. Let's see. A... 
Wait, where's half the car gone? What the? Oh my days. What's happened to my car now? I have been given a car which has literally been sliced in half. This is awesome. Now we're talking, guys. What kind of car was this before? Let's see. Any any, any clues on the inside, Franklin? Like anything? I think it was a Dinka blister. I mean, I'm, I'm seeing Futo on the front. Maybe this was a Futo. I, I don't know. <laughs> no idea. I can't even drive this straight. Come on. All right, let's try this again. I'm going at 20, 30. Come on, dude. It, this has to be faster than the other one. I just know it. I, it's got to be 40, 50. All right, I'm still bringing up speed. 60, 70. Come on. Hey, come on. Push on 80. I know you can do it. Come on, come on, come on. 77. This is so difficult, guys. It's not going past this. It's it's faster than the others. I'll give it that, but it's it's really tricky to drive. I mean, having a car sliced in half is quite tricky to drive, but this is pretty cool. I got a sunroof. There's even an aerial. I can listen to the radio on this. Listen to my amazing beats, guys. See? And it's got decent subwoofers. I can drive and the party can follow behind me. You know what? I'm thinking this was just a party car. That's what they wanted it for. They just blast some tunes down the road. But we're not going to get far in this. I want to upgrade this and see what else we get. We're going at 30 kilometers an hour at 40. Please just give me something good, like an actual car this time. Whoa, guys, this is the best car I've seen so far. Wait a second. There's the American flag on top and on the side. Wow. And look at all those lights. They work. <laughs> all right, this is actually an amazing vehicle. This is a Wrangler, guys. This is one of the toughest vehicles you can get. I actually can't believe I'm driving this thing. This is so good off-road and everything, literally everything has the flag on it. Hey, do you want to see if we can actually make this loop the loop? I crossed 100 kilometers an hour. We're in the club. Now every single car of this is going to be good. It, it, I just know it, guys. We're going to get some pretty amazing cars after this. But can we make the loop? Let's go. Oh, my days. I've actually made the jump. Come on. Come on, dude. Come on. Come on. So close! Guys, I almost did it. All right, maybe the next car is actually going to make it around that loop. I can't wait. I've been looking at that literally the whole video, waiting to drive a car around it, and nothing's gone around it yet. This is such a mean machine. I love it. It's such a relief to drive something like this after getting those three-wheeler vehicles. Check this out, guys. I can make a turning. I can even do a drift if I wanted to. And we're going to be okay. Not even a single wheel comes up from the ground. Do you reckon I can jump up those barriers over there? I mean, any other vehicle? Probably not. Oh, my days. Imagine if I got on the rooftop. Yo, I gotta see if we can do it. Let's go. Let's go. I did it. No <laughs> way. I literally jumped on the roof. Okay. This is my favorite car so far. We've been through a lot already and this one is just so impressive. Anyway, I want to upgrade this again. We might actually cross 200 kilometers an hour this time. Let's see what we get next. I mean, if this is what the car is now, imagine what the next one's gonna be. Are you ready for this? Let's find out. Go, 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 go. No way. I got a supercar and it's got a turret on the top. Wait a second, guys. I, I need to check this out. This is amazing. So I got a lamp Lamborghini and check it out guys. There is literally a turret on the top of this car. I want to get inside this turret. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I need to get inside this thing. Franklin, get inside that thing, buddy. We need to destroy stuff. I have a turret on my Lamborghini. This is amazing. I can shoot anything. Oh my goodness. I'm blowing up those barriers. That's awesome. Okay, I take it back. That Wrangler Jeep we had earlier, that, that's got nothing on this. This is literally the best. And since it's a Lamborghini, I reckon we can go pretty fast. Yeah, we're going fast, guys. I'm going at 110, 20, 30. This is really fast. Faster than the last one. <laughs> Can we do the loop the loop though? That's the question. Let's do it. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Nice. Oh my days. This might be it. This might be it. This might be it. Go on, Franklin. Go on, go on. Oh, we were so close. I literally made it halfway around. We're so close, guys. The next vehicle has to do it. But you know, guys, I'm not really that guy about that. I mean, who cares about the loop when you got a car like this? <laughs> hey, how long do you reckon it'll take me to destroy that plane? Let's find out. Hey, Adios Airlines. What's up? Oh my goodness, this is crazy. I just blew up the plane. <laughs> I love this car. Can I shoot the car? Nope, I can't shoot the car. That sucks. Don't ask me why I want to do that. I'm just interested. So, as you can see, I have got one of the craziest cars in GTA 5. I mean, I would just happily accept this any day of the week. But since we got to get rid of it and upgrade it, I'm going to miss it. I really am. Let's just keep our fingers crossed the next vehicle is better than this one. Not just faster, which it will be. It's got to be better. I expect to get cannons, you know, missiles. I want the I want the works on the next one. Let's take a look. What are we going to get next time, Frank? Please, be good. Be good. Be good. Yes! I got a golden supercar! Get in! <laughs> Check it out, guys. Okay, this is the uh, Apollo Intense Emojion, I think. <laughs> Solid goal. I really don't care, guys. This looks beautiful. Look at this ride! And I wonder how fast it can go. Well, this is uh, it's faster than the last one. <laughs> do you reckon we're going to actually make it around the loop? Let's find out. This might be the first car to do it. Go, 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 go. Nice. 
Nice. Oh my days. Yo, I actually think we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. No way. <laughs> no way. We finally did it, guys. No way. That's crazy. This car goes 220 kilometers an hour. That's what we needed to get around that loop. Finally, we got a car around it. I didn't think it was possible, but we got it, guys. This is the first ride to break 200 kilometers an hour. I don't know how fast this thing goes, but it, it can go past that speed limit. It's, it's still going to 220. That's crazy. Look at this beast. This has to be worth $5 million alone. It's solid gold, and it's a super rare supercar. Plus, it looks pretty nice. Well, we're going at 249 kilometers an hour. Let's just upgrade this again. Oh, it's got a rocket on top. Are you kidding me? I can't believe what I am witnessing. This car, this ride, it's got a rocket. <laughs> and I just crashed the vehicle on top of the rocket. Yeah, fantastic idea, Franklin. Way to blow everyone up. <laughs> so, check it out, guys. Oh, my days. Look at those exhausts. Yo, you gotta see this. Look at those. Look at those. Look at those. <laughs> this is such a nice ride. No way. Okay, let's see. How does that rocket... Oh, my days. That's how it works then. Okay. <laughs> Okey-dokey. We just got to 300 kilometers an hour pretty quickly. Let's try that again. Has it recharged? Can I ha okay, I can't use it all the time, but I can use it some of the time. We're going so much faster than the last vehicle, guys. I actually can't believe how fast I'm going in this ride. This is the Pontiac from Fast and Furious. It's not even a real car. All right, th this was literally made up in a movie to be fast. And I saw somehow have it in GTA 5. It looks like a time machine on the inside, by the way. There's so much going on. Oh my days, there is a plane. No way, no way, no way. Wait, hang on a second. I can jump in this? I didn't realize I could jump. <laughs> The plane's just landed. It's on the runway. It's a 747. I'm gonna catch up with that beast and jump the plane. Now who's talking about doing crazy stunts? Are you ready? I don't think I am. Let's give it a go. Three, two, one, and jump. Oh my days, I just went into the wing. <laughs> this is such a fast car. I love it so much, dude. Just look at this. I can keep jumping and crashing into planes if I wanted to. <laughs> okay, maybe we shouldn't do that, Franklin. That seems like a really dangerous idea. But let's just take it around that loop. It's gotta, it's gotta make it around. This is such a fast car. Anyway, let's see how quickly we can do this loop. I'm just presuming it can do it. There is no way it can't. Let's give it a go. <laughs> All right, nice. Still on the outside. So easy. Oh my goodness, dude. I made it round. So easy. I mean, I did fall off, but who cares? We must be so close to getting the fastest car in GTA 5. I actually can't wait to see what it is. If it's not this, then what else are we going to find? Are you ready? Let's upgrade. It's got to be the next one. It has to be. I mean, I have upgraded so many cars from literally a wheelbarrow to this. The next one is going to be crazy fast. I just know it, guys. And to make it even better, I'm going to rocket boost straight through this ramp. Let's go. Three, two, one. Boost! <laughs> Franklin, watch out. We're going to hit the ramp. We <laughs> literally just went straight over the ramp. Are oh, you never done that before. Never, never. Out of all these cars, never. <laughs> all right, guys, we have hit super fast territory. And ladies and gentlemen, the Red Bull racing car has come out. This bright yellow masterpiece. It's got rocket engines. Can you see that, guys? There's rocket engines. Yeah, that's pretty cool. We can smash five, six, seven, even 800 kilometers an hour. That is crazy. Oh my, oh my days. How can a car do that? That is not possible. Surely. Come on. 800 kilometers an hour. Hey, just for fun, let's, let's do that loop. Just for fun, guys. I mean, at 800 kilometers an hour, we're gonna do that so easily. <laughs> I'm gonna be in and out within like one second. Are you ready? Let's, let's give this a go. Franklin, don't screw this up. Level it in the middle. All right, nice. And go, 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 no way! All right, that's kind of difficult, but you guys get the idea. We, we, we can do anything in this car. It's so fast. This is the inside. There's a bunch of buttons. I love those lights. That's pretty epic. I have never driven a car like this. Like, I can tightrope around this ramp. Check it out, guys. I can go at minimal speed and just keep using my engine a little bit. Let's use some boosters. Nice. 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 <laughs> And I went straight around. This is gonna smash a like. This is such a nice car. If you want a car like this in GTA 5, smash like on the video. No, no, no. Oh, come on. I downgraded. Oh, boy. Watch out for the seat. Watch out for the seat. <laughs> Well, this sucks. Now we know. Don't go through the portal the other way, or else we uh, downgrade like this. Come on, Franklin. Let's get this right out of here, buddy. We can do it. Use that engine of yours. Now, where was I? Oh, yeah. Upgrading cars again. Nice. I got a different color car this time. Right. Let's put this one through the machine again. I'm struggling to believe there is a car faster than this one. But there's only one way to find out, and there is. I have literally just got a rocket. No way. Watch out for the ramp. <laughs> Check it out, guys. This has to be the fastest right now. I wonder how fast this will actually go. Hey, let's go somewhere a little bit, like, more spacious. Because I can't even drive this round here. Okay, it's literally impossible. Let me see if I can get it around this. There is no way. This thing is just too long. Let's see. All right, nice. Come on. 
Oh my goodness. No way. No, it's too big. It's too big. This thing is too big and too fast. We gotta go somewhere better. I'm on the longest road possible. It goes from one side of the map to literally the other. And we are gonna test out this speed. Now, we just gotta hope we don't fall off this track. That's definitely possible. I am going at a thousand. No way. What? 1200? 1400? 50? Guys, look at the speed. This, the speed's going so fast. I can't even count it. 2000 kilometers an hour? <laughs> This is seriously fast, guys. I am going so fast in this car. 2,300 kilometers an hour. No way. Two and a half thousand. We're still, we're still building speed. There's the airport down there. Come on, bring it to the side. Don't go off the track. I am literally crossing Los Santos right now. This is so crazy. There's Maze Bank. You're getting a tour. You're getting a whole tour, guys. I am about to cross the map. We're still gaining speed. No way. <laughs> this is such a fast ride. Come on, make it to the other side, dude. Guys, I'm already in Palito Bay. It's been like 10, maybe 15 seconds, and I've crossed the entire GTA universe. And there's a ramp at the end. No way. Oh, boy. Okay, we're a little bit too fast for that. But that's pretty cool. This is a really fast ride. I like it. This is good. <laughs> The richest person in GTA 5 lives in this house. They have a centillion dollars, and we're about to steal all of it. Now, I've done a big brain play. I've hacked into their security system, so I can see every single CCTV camera inside their house, from their bedroom to the kitchen to the lounge, and that must be the richest person. This is going to be super tricky because this house is on a hill. I can't exactly just sneak inside around the back. I have to jump up these rocks, but Franklin's been training for this. I trust he can do this. Now, all I need to do is fire find a way onto that ledge. Oh, guys, this is gonna be so difficult. Okay, we gotta get on top of this rock. But whatever you do, Franklin, don't get caught. There's guards literally right in front of me. Okay, steady, slowly. Yes, this is going to plan. Everything's going to plan. Now, all we need to do is one big jump to that ledge, and we can sneak inside. All right, here goes nothing. Three, two, one, go! Yes! Oh, my days, we actually did it! Hey, did you hear that? No, why? Uh, I'm gonna go check it out. Oh, no, guys, I raised the suspicions of one of the guards. I think he heard me when I landed on the ledge. Gotta get inside this house. I need to get that money. Here's a centillion dollars in there. Do you have any idea how much that is? Okay, I gotta be extra careful. This guy doesn't see me. He's literally right above me. Maybe I was just imagining things. Looks like my luck's run out. I gotta figure out a way to get over this wall without alerting those guards. It's not even a ledge I can stand on down there. Oh my days, this is not gonna work, Franklin. We need them to move. What if I just throw a grenade right over there? Go on, go on, go on! Who did that? Who did that? Two guards ran over there. Perfect. But now there's only one guy left here. Okay, this is the best it's gonna get, Franklin. Let's get him before they turn around. Three, two, one. Da! Nice. Oh, no. He shot his gun. Did they hear that? Oh, yes, they did. Franklin, we better get running. They found me. Jump down here, Franklin. We gotta find somewhere to hide in this house. They're chasing after me. All units! All units! We got an intruder! Oh, no, 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 no. They're already talking on their radio. Okay, I'm gonna hide in here for a second. I need to get this cash. Oh my days, there's someone here. <gasps> is he down? Nice. Okay, we got him. All units, suspect is fleeing the house. He headed north. Go chase him. Oh, amazing. I can hear them leaving in their cars. Well, here goes nothing. Is this the vault? Oh my days. What is this? I didn't see this on the cameras. No, 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 no. This is really protected. Is this what I think it is though? Oh my days, the gold is in there. I just shot at that and everything ex exploded. Oh my days. If I go in there, we're gonna be torn to pieces, Franklin. I need to find a way to get rid of these lasers. Arr, the gold is literally right there. That's a centillion dollars. And all I can see is a keypad. Oh, it looks like a password to me. I don't even know the password. Oh my days. The cameras didn't show this. There's only one person who knows the password and they're living inside this house. They're in the lounge. If I want to get this password, I gotta go to him first. I will do whatever it takes to get that gold. Whatever it takes. Since we got a window, oh my days. No, we don't. They're back. Are you kidding me? He must have called his guards back. What am I gonna do? They know I'm in this house. I'm literally trapped inside here. I need to get that gold. Well, in that case, I'm gonna take him out. Stick him up, guards. Let's go get him, Franklin. You'll never get me through this bulletproof glass. Yes, it's actually working. I don't think they can shoot me through there, but I can shoot them through here. Perfect. I took out every single guard. Once I get the last few guards, he'll have nobody to protect him. Oh, that was close. That was really close. And now, you guys are done. And now you're in the lounge. You were in the lounge. Where has he gone now? Oh, my days. He's left. 
And there's someone else in the garden. He must have fled somewhere. Don't let him escape, Franklin. He's got to be in the house somewhere. Now, if I was him, where would I go? He definitely isn't downstairs because I was down there. How many guards are there around here? <laughs> if I was him, where would I go? I'm about to enter the master bedroom. Oh, he's going to be in here. Stick him up. Are you here? Hello? Let's make this easy for us. You come out and, like, you know, give me the password sheet. <laughs> And I don't kill you. I think that's a pretty good deal if you ask me. Uh, hang on a second. I think I found the password sheet. Rich life for me. I'm never going to forget that password. Let's be honest. It's so easy to remember. No, 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 no. Something's happened. I think they shot me. Pick him up. He's coming with me. Ah, ah, what did you do? Wait, hang on a second. Where am I? Oh, my days. <gasps> That's a shock! That's a shock! What are you gonna do? Listen to me, mister. I'm angry with you. You've done a lot of damage. Too much damage. And you know too much. Hey, listen, man. All I want to do is take your money. Is someone just not allowed to dream or something? Come on! You've done a lot of damage to my team and my house. You're gonna pay for that. Oh, no, 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 no. This is really bad. Franklin, come on, get up. Get up, buddy. Get up. There is a shark there. There's a shark! I promise I will never come back to this house again! I'm gonna have to find another way to take that money. It's too too late to beg for forgiveness. I've made up my mind, and my pet shark Harry is hungry. This guy is crazy. He's gonna feed me to the shark. I'm gonna have to make a break for it. Listen, mister, I'm sorry. Go get him, Franklin. Bah! Run, 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 run. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. Wait a second. If there's only one guard left inside the house, what if I take him out and use the password and get the golden run? <laughs> That's a perfect idea. I think I managed to knock out the guy called too. Oh, come here, mister. Are you still there? Yes, he is. Get him. <laughs> Okay, now's my chance to get the gold and go. I'm gonna become a centillionaire. So I've got the password. Quick, put it into the keypad. Okay, rich life for me. <gasps> Amazing, it worked. No, 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 no. This can't be. The gold isn't here anymore. Where is it gone? What did they do to the gold? Let's check out those cameras, Franklin. Ah, oh, no, they moved the gold away. And they're driving it somewhere else. Fort Sankuto. They're taking it to one of the most secure places around. And luckily, this guy has a supercar. I'm gonna take this and track down that van. We got to get to it before it gets to the military base. Oh, no. No, no, no. I think I'm too late. I can see them on the bridge already. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. We got to get to that bridge. We got to stop them. We got to stop them. <laughs> no. <laughs> They're already driving into the military base. Oh, this is going to be really, really close. Come on. Come on. Just catch up. Catch up. Catch up, dude. Come on. Oh, it's no use. I'm just a few seconds short. He's already met with the military. If I make a raid on this truck now, the whole military is going to be after me. Oh, yeah. I got the money on the truck. You know it's centillion dollars. Go on right in, buddy. We're expecting you. Please, guys. Uh, uh, I have a job in here. I'm an intern. I was back up for that truck, which is just going into the military base. Oh, come on. Please. You need to turn around and go. What? What? No, you can't do that. Please, man. I just want to get inside the military base. I totally belong here. I'm not going to ask again. Three, two. Okay, 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 okay. I'm going to turn around. I'm getting out of here, guys. Oh, my days. If I go inside the military base, they got tanks, they have jets, and missile systems. We're gonna be blown to smithereens. Ah, oh, man. But that money is inside the base. I need to find a way inside. If I don't get inside, then we'll never become a centillionaire. Oh, my days. They're taking it off the truck, and they're putting it into the elevator? Hang on a second. It's going underground. This is going into a bunker underneath the military base. As if I thought it couldn't get any worse than this. There's gotta be another way in. I've dug a tunnel, and believe me, this took me a long time to do. But since the money is under underground in the military base. This is gonna be the safest way to get to it. And behind that plank takes me down the tunnel, which takes me just inches away from what I believe is the vault full of gold. Oh my days, this is so crazy. They have no idea I'm right underneath the base. Like up there, that's the runaway. And I'm just walking underneath them. They have no idea. Now I do have this. This will tell me when I'm near metal, AKA gold. And when it starts bleeping a little bit faster, that means I'm closer and closer to the gold. And I think I'm just about now the location. We're almost there, guys. It's just down a few more steps. And here we go. It's already getting faster. <laughs> it's getting faster. Now it's just up here. At the other side of this wall is the vault full of gold and money. And once I blow 
while this open, I'll take everything and become a centillionaire once and for all. Okay, one last sticky. All right, that's 20 different stickies on the wall. Now get some cover, Franklin. This is gonna be a big explosion. Three, two, one, explode! Yo, yo, <laughs> that was a massive explosion. And I think I'm inside the vault. Wait, what? Where's the gold? No, 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 no. I'm inside the vault and the gold isn't even here. Apart from this tiny gold bar. That can't be. That doesn't make any sense. Where would the gold have gone? Uh oh, guys, there is a guard right in front of me. What is he saying? Don't worry, we got the gold. They don't even suspect a thing. <gasps> They stole the gold. Someone else did before me. Looks like I'm not the only person after this centillion dollars. Now, mister, <laughs> you better tell me about this plan. How did you know? This was meant to be a secret plan. Ah, leave me alone. I'll give you gold. I got lots of it. Sorry, man. I'm here to take the gold. I want to become a centillionaire. Now, tell me, where are you moving it? Or else I'm going to call the guards back here since all of them have now left. You wouldn't do such a thing. You're here for the gold, too. If I go down, you go down. Oh, he's actually got a point, though. If, if he goes down, then so do I. Well, clearly, they're not too far ahead of me. So I'm gonna deal with this guy and then find this truck, wherever it is. <laughs> don't let them escape. Whatever you do, Franklin, don't let them escape! Alright, get in the car and let's go. They can't be too far ahead of me. Once I find this truck, oh, believe me, that gold is gonna be mine. This can't be good. Which way do they go? This way or this way? I'm gonna go with this way. Let's follow the helicopter. There's quite a few police out here. Oh, my days. I can't believe this. They're all searching for him. I can't believe they've taken the gold. Gold. Yo, we better get this gold quickly. This guy has an entire Armageddon after him. And there's a barracks truck. Wait, hang on a second. This has the gold. I think I found the gold. What? <laughs> hey, mister, pull over. I need that truck. No chance. This is my gold. Mine. Fine. Looks like you've made your choice and I've made mine. Oh, my days. Hang on a second. What is this? No, 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 no. He's got other people helping him. What am I going to do now, Franklin? We're completely screwed. This car's going to explode if I don't get out of here anytime soon. Guys, stop it. Stop it, I'm just a normal person. I'm gonna have to get them from in here, Franklin. It's the only way. Urgh, there's so many people here. What? I had no idea there were people working with him. I didn't even see them in front of me. Next time, I keep my eyes ahead, not behind. That guy really bought some time. Yo, guys, I have just got a crazy idea. But I need to get out of this car quickly before that tank explodes. Here goes nothing, Franklin. Three, two, one. Urgh, screw you. All right, now everyone's down. Grab that tank, Franklin. We're moving. Sorry, mister. You gotta get out of the tank. Listen. Listen to me. I'll catch your guy. Don't worry. I found him. He's at the airport, and I think he's about to be picked up by a magnet helicopter. I didn't realize they were on the records. Take him down. Arrgh, you'll never take the gold. This gold is mine. We gotta stop this helicopter from picking up the truck. Oh my days. This is so reinforced. Looks like you're not gonna be escaping today. Right, get him out of the truck. You got nowhere to run, buddy. That gold is mine. Not gonna allow you to disrupt any more of my plans. And now let's look at this gold. There's so much of it. No way! Oh my days. Franklin, we are now officially called a Sedillion. Franklin, what just happened? No, 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 no! Finally, this ghost chase is over. Bring the gold back home and take it with us. Seriously, I was this close to getting the money. And now I'm stuck behind this wall of lasers. This is not fair, man. Come on, you gotta let me out. Welcome to my evil lair. You, my friend, are 10 feet below my house. And if it wasn't for you, none of this would have happened. I'm pretty sure some of this would have happened. There was someone else out to take your money. Why wouldn't you believe me? Ah, oh, my day. I can't believe I'm back with you again. I thought I dealt with you. And I thought I dealt with you too. Harry the shark wasn't very happy. Anyway, you're gonna meet him very soon. And this gold will be the closest you ever get to it. It's where I store it in case of emergencies. Seriously? Oh my day. So I can't get through these lasers, but I can stare at the gold. But there is a keypad here. Guys, I've got the note still. Franklin, we still got the note in our bag. I know the password to these lasers. No way, it actually worked. Get him, Franklin, get him! <laughs> this gold is mine! Okay, grab his gun, grab his gun, grab his gun! Arrgh, arrgh, screw you! Yes! And you're not waking up again! Oh, hang on, he's still alive! Oh my days, how are you still alive? That was crazy, dude! I can't believe that! I finally got the gold! Alright, let's load all of this stuff up, get it to my house, and start spending, Franklin. At a glance, it looks pretty yellow. You know, it's just gold, but this is now mine! It's all mine! And check this out, you haven't seen the best part. This is how much a centillion dollars is. It literally Judy goes off the charts. This is like nothing we've ever seen before. I can do whatever I want. I can buy whatever I want. I could buy Los Santos a million times over and still have change left 
walked over for a McDonald's large meal. We're gonna have so much fun. And first things first, I'm gonna go and pay a visit to Simeon and see if he's got anything good for me. And I wanna upgrade this house. I mean, I have not just come this far to be the richest person in the world and not do any upgrades or get nice cars. <laughs> Simeon, 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 have you got something nice for me? <laughs> I can see there's a car in the store. Let's see what he's actually got. This better be a nice ride. Simeon, I got money to spend and plenty of it. And whoa, I gotta buy this car. This is a Lamborghini. No way. Hey, Simeon, tell me about this car. How much is it and can I buy it? All the way from Argentina. Rumor has it. The person who drove this last was a king. Are you ready to be a king? For a price of 50 million bucks, it's yours. I don't even care if I'm getting ripped off. I won't even see it leave my bank account. Simeon, I'll take it. Thank you very much. Oh my days. I have just bought myself a supercar. It's a Lamborghini, dude. Check this out. The inside. Everything about this is luxury, dude. I can't believe I'm driving this thing. Okay, what else can we buy, Franklin? There's gotta be some other crazy things around this world we can buy, like houses and other stuff like that. Michael, what do you want today, buddy? Yo, I heard you ran into some money. I got some boats you might like. Swing by the beach. You'll love them. Now, these better not be some tiny little rowing boat, Michael, or anything like that. I wanna get myself a luxury yacht. Let's take a look at what Michael's got for me. It better be good. Whoa, this is awesome. Awesome, Michael, where did you find this? Skylight walkway right above me. A spiral staircase going up. And check this out, dude. This entire area underneath is just for diving in. Hey, Michael, this is an awesome boat. Or should I say luxury yacht? Wow, there's even an inside to this, like a kitchen? How much for this boat? I will pay anything. 250 million? That's a bargain, Michael. I'll take the yacht right now. <laughs> I just bought a luxury yacht from Michael. And check this place out. Look at this kitchen. I'm gonna make guacamole first thing. You just wait. There's bedrooms down here, marble bathrooms. This thing is a piece of luxury. And there's five stories of it. Oh my days. Yo, Michael, this is a masterpiece. Thank you so much. Hey, what do you think about this place? I came across it just earlier and I think it looks amazing. And get this, from above, it spells out F. So this is the front drive and there's even a drive going into a garage underneath the house. Da -da 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 -da. Now I parked my car underneath the house. This is awesome. Is there anything else down here? Like, what's through this glass door? This is the craziest house ever. Oh my days, I got my own security room? Now we're talking, and I think there's another secret door over there. I wonder where this goes to. No way. Hang on a second, guys. I've got an armory here for when people attack this house, and I got a vault for putting cash, gold, and everything else I want to stay secured. Wait, there's another secret door here? What? Guys, there's so many secret doors everywhere. I've got an office down here. This is so cool. Check out my view, guys. A view of a centillionaire. Why are we still wearing that bandana, Franklin? We're a centillionaire, dude. Well, you know what, guys? I've had a pretty crazy day, and it's about to get even crazier, because when you weren't looking, I ordered a couple more supercars from Simeon. I told him I got money to spend, and he put an order in for me. Let me show you what's outside. I think it should be there. I know he said they were $50 million each, but guys, I couldn't resist. <laughs> now I have every single one of these kinds of Lamborghinis in the entire world. Check this out. I got so many of them. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed the video, smash like and help us get to 6 million subscribers by pressing the subscribe button below. Did you know that most of you watching don't even subscribe? So what are you waiting for? You're missing out on videos like this every single day. But thanks for watching. My name is Nort, and until next time, stay awesome.